Okay. Here we are back at Sanctuary. We have survived another day in Fallout. Uh, we nearly gave up on the Commonwealth yesterday. It was hanging on by a, by a thread. Uh, but yet, here we are. One more day. One more day we shall go. <laughs> One more day. We'll see if we can survive it. Hey, what's up, Lively? Oh, four o'clock, you remembered? Nice. Yeah, look, we got Heather. We're trying to stack the cards in our favor. Be strong, my streamer. <laughs> okay. We're trying to stack, stack cards in our favor. We got Heather in uh, a grab bag of power armor. We gave her a, kind of a crappy minigun. I'm about to throw some stuff on Valentine. Oh, then we're gonna... Honestly, we might kill this guy. Uh, then we're gonna find that. We're gonna find that stranger dude. Yeah, I hope your, hope your day is going good, Lively. Hope everything is perfectly swell. Okay, let's see. So we, I wanna find, I wanna find some proper armor for this guy. Or should I just keep letting him run around in his, what is this? Nick, what are you wearing, really? What are you really wearing? You're only wearing a fedora? Do you just have like a, a ba some base armor? Is this all you have is a fedora? I can do. Where's the jacket, Nick? Where's your jacket? Okay, here, let's find something for Nick. What should we put on this guy? Should I keep him looking good or should I just make him pretty? Uh, pretty beefy. Let's see. Oh, what's good for him? A dress, of course. Oh man, we got some, we got some armors here. Field scribs, armor, okay. Okay. Tough. Make him look good or just make him good? B90 armor. You know what? That might go pretty good on old Nick. Okay. Is this for Nick? Yeah. This is for Nick. This is for Nick. I'm assuming Heather doesn't need power armor or doesn't need armor because she's just in the power armor. Let's see what he'll wear. Sin oh, let's put him in some synth stuff. Will he wear it? That's the question. All right, Nick. Hey. Let's figure you out, okay? Let's figure you out. Whoops. Oh, yeah, dude. Look at Nick. <laughs> Look at him, dude. Wow. Oh, my God. You're... Oh, my God, dude. That's Nick like 4.0. He skipped 2.0, 3.0. He went straight up the ladder. Holy smokes, dude. Nick, you look fresh. Is that a full body suit? Or can you put arm pieces on it and everything? Hold on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there's a mod for that in vanilla. He can't change clothes. Nope, he can. All right, all right. Question is, can I also, is that just a torso piece? Is that like a... Okay, can I also throw the helmet on him? We need... Let's see, let's see. Smash? Oh, for diet, smash. Okay. Oh. Okay, yeah, we'll find out. We will find out. Oh. Oh, we can put Heather's clothes on him. I want to get him the synth stuff. Right? Like, that only seems right. Left leg, right leg, right arm, left arm, synth field helmet. Yeah, like, I want to see. I want to see. Okay. There's something you need. Oh, dude. You're... Dude. Nick, you're going to be so good. You're going to be so good. Trust the process, Nick. Right arm, left arm. Yeah, yeah. Trust the process, Nick. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Wait, where's that left arm? Synth left arm? Oh, okay. Take this back. Oh, yeah. Dude, our boy's ready. It's up, Windwalker. My guide, my leader. How are you, General Rafezi? Sir Windwalker, I... I am... I am... I am good. I am great. Things are going as they should. <laughs> Dude, I Windwalker, I was pretty uh I was pretty downbeat yesterday. 
Uh, but we survived. Oh, we, uh, we figured out some stuff with the help of others. And we are going to persevere through Fallout. I'm back. Man, yesterday I'd like given up on myself. Yesterday was nearly the last day of the Fallout playthrough. But here we are. Here we are. Larn? Oh, you didn't give up. Well done. I didn't. We threaded the needle at the end of the at the end of the stream with the help. The help of you guys. With help of lively. I appreciate that. Other people helped too. Other people tried to help earlier on too, but you know. Maybe I wasn't having it. But yeah, here we are. We got Heather. Kitted out a little. Good old Nick Valentine looking like a stormtrooper. Oh yeah. I think we're ready. I think we're ready. Things are about to get serious around here. All right, let's just see. So we need to wait a couple days for our friend to come. So let's do that. There we go. That went well. Oh, it's going, it's going. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Come on game, you can pass the time. But yeah. Hope everything's going well. Hope your day went well, Larn. Also, you and Walker, all you guys. All obstacles are only temporary for the Professi. <laughs> You're holding me up on a high, a high pedestal, dude. <laughs> all right, we gotta find this stranger. Task number one. Task number one. I just want you to have fun. Being frustrated is no fun. Hey, yeah, not really. Being, it's more frustrating when you get stuck on stuff when you're streaming. For me, I, I'm, I'm saying that for me. But it probably it probably pertains to a lot of people. Now we gotta find the stranger. Here, maybe we already chatted with him. Okay, so we're gonna wait a few days. We're gonna give him some time. We just waited a few days. I'm hoping he just like strolls on in here. Like it ain't no thing. But I don't see him. We waited three days, I think. You look very kitted out now. You might stand a chance. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, we got our our groups, our group, Nick and Heather. They're doing, they're looking a lot. They're looking a lot more prepared. So I think we have a better chance against everything now. So I'm feeling better about that for sure. And if we can just keep progressing down Sim settlements, then uh, we... Things should go really good. That's my hope. That's my hope. Then when we finish some settlements, I think we'll be able to dominate Far Harbor. So I hope I hope we can thread the needle like that. Uh, you have to listen to his private frequency to start the next quest, remember? Oh, no, I don't remember at all, dude. I don't remember at all. Oh, who's, who's Jake? Jake's private frequency? What is this? Okay, we'll listen to that, but should be Travis. Hello. Hello. <laughs> is this working? Heather looked. Oh. Hey, that's slick. I hope you're receiving this. Bang, transmitter. If you can hear this, come on back to the hardware store. I got it. No got some news on the combo. Under understood. Oh, is this even broadcasting? No, no, I got you. Travis, oh, I hear you. Okay, industrial. Okay, got this it. They unlock whatever that is. Message. Message repeats in three seconds. Oh, really? Oh, Travis. Travis's message is gonna keep repeating, huh? Let's make sure. Yeah. Hello? All right. Hello? It's okay. Travis, hold on, dude. I'm coming. I'm on my way, man. I'm on my way. Heather, Nick, get over here. Let's go. Oh man, I feel like the crew is ready today. You triggered last night, been listening to the radio. Oh, I see. <laughs> I'm very lively. I'm I'm very forgetful. Should you should be aware. <laughs> I'm very forgetful. Oh, don't forget to talk to Heather too. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. Here, look. she might have some progress. Here, well, let's just hey. chat her up right now. Hey. Hi. <laughs> hey. Need something? I just, I need you to be happy, okay? Can we chat? Sure. What's on your mind? I feel like I'm robbing you every time you buy something from me. You are. So I'm going to give you the biggest discount I can afford. Oh, about time, Heather. And I want you to Do have you the key wonder to if the we safe my spice things up between Feel us. Feel free to take whatever you want. It's a little bit of overlapping dialogue there. Interesting. Hmm. Oh my god. Oh my god, Heather, you you dog. Maybe we should try being more than best friends, Heather. 
Maybe we should try being more than best friends. Yes. I'm not looking for a big commitment. Just something a little more... Oh! The game? Oh, God, what? She's not looking for... Okay, well, Heather, I gotta be real with you, okay? More physical, sure. But I'm a one gal kind of guy. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna need a little bit of commitment, okay? I can't you having... I can't... I can't have you. I can't have you be running around, you know, getting physical with Nick or anything, okay? Or Preston. I'm gonna need a promise, okay? Yes, absolutely. Let's get the hell out of here. Yes, absolutely. Let's get the hell out of here. Right behind you. Okay. Oh, Heather, by the way, keep the power armor on, all right? I'm into it, okay? Keep the power armor on the whole time. Oh, hey. hold on. Let's talk to her warm thought. I wasn't expecting a romance with Heather. <sighs> Heather's, wait, Heather is looking hench. Might need a little WD-40, though. She needs some better power armor. She, this is like the grab bag from the clearance section of Walmart. Kmart, sorry. She, uh, I don't know. It's lacking, but it's all we got for her right now. <clears throat> the professor gets all the honeys. We try. Sounds painful. <clears throat> it's okay, I have a tool that helps. What affinity perks does Heather have again? I have no idea. Hold on a second. Maybe Parker? Lively knows, but I don't know anything. <clears throat> I'd like that. You can keep talking to her if she sends, uh, you keep talking to her till she sends you back to her bunker. Yeah, I'm gonna keep chatting with her. What's on your mind? You know, my parents were brotherhood. Uh-oh. They were from California originally. Traveled to the capital wasteland under elder lions. At some point they fought with lions and left. Dad said they abandoned lions and his bad ideas, not the brotherhood. I always had the feeling they wanted to go back to California, but they came here instead. I killed her parents. You know, no, dude, I trip. didn't. Being cautious. I didn't. Not a bad call. My mom was a paladin. She's the one that trained me with weapons. No. <laughs> she wasn't going to have a kid that couldn't handle herself. <laughs> yeah. Her parents she are brotherhood. Uh oh. No, no, no. My dad's a scribe. They, they got out. They, they were in a different place. They were not the, they were not the airport. Okay. Okay. Did something They weren't at the airport. He left us years ago. See? See, it was a different time. Everything's fine. Did you ever ask him why? Yeah, but he wouldn't give me a straight answer. He might have left because my Dad, mom. You're not so left. sure. You know. No, no, I, I know. Can make people do some weird shit. <laughs> okay. <sighs> oh, when walking, remember this part gave me Fallout Three nostalgia feelings, dude. I actually thought the opening for Fallout Four because I didn't remember, dude, because I didn't play it since launch week. I thought the Fallout 4 starting part of the game, in my memory, I completely replaced it with Fallout 3. I thought I was going to have to go through all of that stuff in the in the vault and like grow up in the vault. I was very surprised. I completely misremembered how the whole game started. But I don't even think I ever beat Fallout 3. I think I got to the very, I think I put like 40 hours in. I, I feel like I was at the very end of it when I was... I failed. I was a different person back then. I quit a lot easier. What's on your mind? Thought it was about time we celebrate this partnership. Okay. Here's to clear roads, clear skies, and good company. This I wonder, one's on me. I wonder if there. Oh, settlers punch. Okay. I wonder if there's a mod that takes off helmets in cutscenes. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sure it'll come in handy. Thank you. Uh. I'm sure that'll come in handy. Oh, good. Okay, let's go. You're not sure. Oh, there is. You've used it. It can be a bit buggy. Okay. I always like those because it's nice. <clears throat> I mean, if it's buggy, I mean, it's already... My, my cutscenes are already buggy. Every time, every time my guy's talking, he's like this. Turn around immediately and slowly turn back all the time. But uh, it's nice when that's in games or if it's natively supported. Because it's nice to take off the helmet and be able to see the face of the hero or the mistress, Heather. Here, let's try with her one more time. There's probably a lot of dialogue. Hey, partner. 
we've done this before where we just kind of like powered through can we chat a I handful of her stuff because we don't talk to her that often what's on your mind i can hack terminals when we need it i know i'm not very good at it never had to be but i'll learn plus if it's easy enough i never fail <clears throat> what's on your mind Folks say Nuka World is the cheeriest place in okay. all the world. I don't think she has Maybe anything. Maybe we could go there sometime. Too important. I could use some cheer. You, oh, I have snap. a list of all the places I want to see oh. and an empty bottle to get the discount. I know that's not a thing anymore, but I have the bottle. Okay. And I want to pick up some Nuka Cola darks while we're there. They're Nuka Cola and alcohol. Like a dirty wastelander, but better. <laughs> okay. Is it dangerous? Sounds like fun. Yeah, sounds like fun. I can't wait to see the River of Quantum. River and the Galactic Quantum. Zone. With a name like that, Galactic you have to zone. think there'll be alien artifacts there, right? Is there a Galactic That's Zone? All. Interesting. Uh-oh. Okay, guys, show me your colors, okay? Oh, my God. Get him out there! Get him! Oh, my God. That's the A-team right there. Oh, yeah. We got our tank girl, Nick, heading back a little bit. Bam. He's got that sweet plasma rival. Dude, I feel like we got the best team ever now. Hey, I'm so happy. Let's go, guys. Let's lock all this in. Heather's the aim of a stormtrooper. Yeah, it don't matter. She draw fire. If we find it, now I want to find a good minigun because there are some miniguns that are really good. I didn't have any of them. I just had crappy miniguns. Oh, you agree, Live? You like, you like helmet removal and dialogue. Borge Gate 3 has it integrated. It's lovely. Man. Oh, how did you like Borge Gate 3? <laughs> that was that was a wild game for narrative choice. It was so good, dude. It was crazy. Pretty much, ev I feel like everyone here mostly played it. It was wild. Ugh. Oh, you loved it. Good. Yeah, it was it was awesome. Ugh. Games like that don't come along very often. I feel that felt felt like a real gem. Oh, it actually have to hydrate, dude. Oh, Windwalker, sorry, I missed your message. The, the rugged lifestyle of the Perfezzi, the rugged lifestyle has made him mature and become the wise leader he is today. The struggles primed him to become the leader of the Institute. Oh yeah, so we can save the Commonwealth. We're doing it day by day, day by day. For the best team ever, I'd need Ivy. Oh. <laughs> Oh, Lively, how do you feel about the Ivy mod? Uh, folks that were telling me uh, that it's really good. But we just have Heather in here. But Heather is also like the other companion mod that everyone was saying like, gotta make sure, gotta make sure you have Heather. So we had that on lock, but I don't know. I'm assuming you played with Ivy. She, uh, there's some interesting, there's some interesting stuff there. <laughs> oh. Oh, apparently. Oh, that's what. Okay, you were telling me that, Garlic. That there's been compatibility or something with Scourge. Maybe. Oh, do you need good aim at 1,000 RPMs? No. Stormtrooper. They can get by. They can get by with a minigun. Deck. She fits in Fezzi's style based on what I was watching last night in Far Harbor. Yeah, she'll be good. She'll be just fine. Uh, may the Lord bless you for your guidance. <laughs> What's up? Okay, then. What's up, well, Travis? Let me know if you need anything. Dude, I love that his name is Travis, though. I hope people, I hope people pop in here that are familiar with Sim Settlements, and they're like, what? Travis? I hope. Oh, Ivy's a sexbot follower, and the author got banned from Nexus for integrating a faction of pirates called Wabajack that deserves to be executed. Okay. Suffice to say, I do not get along, and I do not follow not safe for work mods anyway. Okay, copy. Copy. Yeah, there's a... Uh, May the Lord bless you for your kindness. I'm aware of uh, okay, some of the quests well, Ivy can send you on. <laughs> I've, <laughs> I've been Next informed. Not <laughs> They're not, uh, but, yeah, and all that content is uh, sure, perfectly uh, I mean, it's not like anyone else legal to stream oh, here. May the Lord bless you for your kindness. Any chance you got a second now? <laughs> okay, then. Well, just let me know if you need I'm ready, anything. Travis. If you like it, more power to you. 
here to Next spread my belief not here to spread my beliefs opinions but ivy won't be an opus ever copy no 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 that's, sure, no, that's fine dude i was just I mean, asking i'm like just curious oh, may the lord bless you for your guidance it's just interesting <laughs> Okay, what then. what makes well, the cut or for why like there. why or why not it makes the cut you know like the difference between a pine forest redone versus the forest all, my but like i was saying pine forest church. way sure, better I way mean, better best magazines oh, in the wasteland the okay you <laughs> okay <laughs> yep copy okay, then. hey there oh shoot slick. what's up travis see you again how are you doing gotta say i'm doing pretty good as you can see by the crate I managed to get the comm hub back. Although it wasn't easy, let me tell you. I've got the hub inside if you'd like to see it. Oh yeah, I do. I, I do. Why not? All right, follow me. I'll follow you. Oh, well, Force didn't make it primarily because of the weird flat leaves blown in the wind. They were oddly distracting in a bad way. Oh, copy. Okay. Yeah, like I, I was saying. I, I didn't like it very much just because of the density. You were saying density, but like the visibility, like this is so much better for me. It's so, o it's really open. I like it that it's taller and the under canopies in the pine forests are like largely gone. So you can see through them rather than all the trees like starting kind of where the upper canopy starts and the trees come down, you know, it's just nice to be able to actually see. That's what I, I really appreciate that. Quest mods for Opus require voice acting that isn't AI generated and they have to be fun. Prefer things that you stumble into naturally rather than to start a quest mod. You have to do specific copy. Copy. Oh, Lauren, what up, Fezzi? Please don't say this guy. I would never. Firstly. Secondly, uh, there it is. same things every day. Well, it's still really hot here. So I'm working. We're gonna try to, something's wrong with my air conditioner or something. But I have been able to give the old I have to do some adulting around the house. Got a rough understanding of the hardware. <sighs> yeah. Oh wait, Fezzi. Oh, you got some Jaffa cake. Okay. I I messaged that to my wife. She's down to try to find it. I'll let you know if we ever get it. And we uh if if and when I get it, I'll I'll bring it here and we'll I'll eat it on stream. And I'll give you my live reaction. I won't eat it off stream. I'll, I'll save it. We'll open the box here. We'll see if we can get some. It might be something we have to order and have delivered. I don't know if the local stores have them. Oh, a lively one quest that didn't make the cut because it had over 4,000 aluminum cans on the ground. <laughs> Enough to lag out your PC. Coffee. Oh. Oh, you know which quest he's talking about, Garlic? Those cans did suck. Okay. Oh. Oh, nice. If you get them on stream, that'd be sick. Okay. Yeah. I'll try to get them. I mean, they look good. I'm sure they're. I'm sure they're good. You've got my attention. Well, judge I'll see what I can do. I'll try to pull some strings. A giant process. <sighs> my guess is that it operates as a kind of ASAM switchboard. Okay. Connecting and communicating with the sensors, which makes sense, really. I mean. It is called the comm hub. Now, if we could get sensors connected and communicate, that really would open up our options. Let us do some cool things. Copy that, Travis. What do you mean by that? Well, for example, remote management, mass software updates, division of settlement labor, and the obvious one, better communications. Important, now, you, especially for war. Sound like much, but trust me, better communications is something we want. Yep. Travis so knows what's up. Our best interest to get this comm hub running. Really begin to rebuild the Commonwealth. Communications is key. I'm on board. Where do we start? I'm on board. I'm gonna start calling him T-Rav. In order to get things going, instead of Travis, we need to turn this thing on. And for that, we're gonna need some serious power. T-Rav. I'm afraid my little generator just ain't gonna cut it. However, as luck would have it, just a couple of feet below us is all the power we could need. Copy that. Copy that, T-Rav. You're going to go grab mine. They're pretty good. As long as you like chocolate and orange. Wait, chocolate and orange is incredible. <laughs> like I was saying the other day, I love those. You get those orange chocolates. It's like a chocolate orange and you like crack it and you like get the orange slices. Those are so good. I don't get them, but I remember getting them as a kid. Get like one of those in the stocking on Christmas or something. I feel like that happened. Mom, if you're out there, uh, 
please confirm or deny in the chat if I ever got one of those on Christmas. I feel like I did. I feel like I did. Go on. Concord has a municipal plutonium well. Probably used to power every building in town. To get some real power flowing again, all you need to do is turn it on. That is, <sighs> if you wouldn't mind helping out. Yeah, no, I'm here for you, dude. I'm here. I'm on it. It's as good as done. <laughs> I knew you'd help. <laughs> Terry you chocolate oranges slap. Is that what they're called, Terry's? The yeah, they're Once good. Down there, find something that looks like a big old generator. All right, copy that. What you need to start it up, then head on back. All right, I copy that, dude. Okay, I got you, T-Rav. All right, Heather. Nick? Dude, Nick, look. This is so funny to me. I love this. I wish... I want to find a Courser suit. I want to find another Courser and kill it. And give Nick the armor. So we can go around in matching Courser armor. Like the synth brothers we are. Oh, but this looks awesome. I'm so happy for him. I'm so happy for him. It's like, what an upgrade. You get confused when you're looking at X edit on the other monitor. And here you go, Nick. Because that's, oh, that's your name. Oh, I see. Got you. All right. <laughs> so, oh, well, Nick is, I think, I think Nick is going to be a mainstay companion. So, <laughs> sorry. Don't worry. If I ever, if I'm ever talking to you, I'll say lively. <sighs> That'd probably trip me up too. <laughs> Okay, come on, guys. All right. Mr. Valentine, Heather. I wonder, I, what, is there a sex is, okay. Do I need, never mind, never mind. Never mind, <laughs> never mind. We'll find out together. We'll find out together. All right, come on, guys. Oh man, if you guys have, if you guys have standing desks, or you're standing, dude, we used to have these mats at work. Oh, we used to have these mats at work, like on the production line. But dude, getting a mat to stand here helped my feet so much. It's so good. It is such an upgrade. All right, let's see how they do. All right. I want to see what they can do without me. Oh, it's just a roach. Okay, come on. Chained on the other side. Uh-oh. We did got good. Him. Oh my god. I really like that weapon Nick gave. Thing is, it was not practical for me to use because I didn't have enough ammunition. But I love that you can give them to companions and then they don't use then they don't use any ammunition. So like guns that weren't viable because I didn't have anything for them or any ammo for it, all of a sudden is like viable for a companion to use. I like Heads that. Up. Oh God, oh God. Dude, they are good. Dude, there's, holy smokes, dude. I think we go back, I think we go back to Far Harbor. I think we go back to Far Harbor and actually survive it. Come on, Heather, you monster. Okay, let's go. She's she's so kitted out. All right. It's over there. It's over there. Oh, you were a chef for about 17 years and mats are 100% required to stand for long periods for sure. Oh yeah. Yeah, when you're in the same spot and you kind of shuffle around, I imagine, I can imagine the kitchen, a commercial kitchen, and I can imagine where I worked on the production line. It's like when you're shuffling around the same like 10 to 20 to 50 foot spot and you stand a lot, dude, it, it, uh, it it's a game changer. It definitely helps a lot. Takes the soreness off the feet. <sighs> Takes the soreness off the feet. Figure out how to restart the reactor. That didn't work. 
Okay. I am now doing the thing where I pick up all the guns. Okay. Kick. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I kicked it. I don't know if that... Did that work? Oh my god. So dumb. <laughs> it worked. Here, let's go open the shortcut. Okay, good. Oh yeah. Oh, flippin' yeah. Uh oh, oh, shoot, dude. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> so let me just walk right to the reactor. Ma'am? Oh, I wonder, hey, Dex, where, I saw that you got it. When you showed me your screenshot, when you were playing this, um, Dex, where, is it hard to find that uh, predator armor? I would love to find that predator armor for, for Heather. That way when she gets out of the power armor, she's like looking something fierce. Oh, no, you craft it. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, copy. I wonder what... Do you have to find, like, the blueprints for it to craft? It's in the outfit or chem bench. Okay, so I may have to level up a bit first. Wait a second. I'm super lost. Oh, there we go. Through the tunnel. There we go. Can I just go out here? Oh, don't, don't drink the water! Don't drink the water, dude. I just meant to set you up the ladder. Okay. Which you can't. Okay, you have to go. Okay. Don't just go drink in the water, dude. It's disgusting. Oh, what's that? Okay. Okay. Oh, you just need armor perks and mats. Okay, copy. Copy that. Oh no, you very much just dislike the blueprint mechanics that some mods introduce. Weapons are usually level perks locked. Okay. Clothes and armor are usually quest locked. I think the only thing that requires blueprints might be the blink grenades. Okay. You're back. I don't even know. Oh, you went to get your Jaffa cakes. Oh, Sapashi, thank you for the hydrate. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, we survived another day in the wasteland, Sapashi. I don't know if you were here yesterday when I was, when I was crumbling, like a, I don't know, like a wet cracker, a wet cookie, a wet piece of paper, a wet piece of paper. I was crumbling. I was folding. I basically gave up on everything. I was so defeated. But we made it. We survived. Okay. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, Splash, you wonder if this works? Followage? I've never done that before. I've never done that before. Lauren, you think it's time? Time for what? What do you got going on? Follow age. Oh, not followage? Are you sure it's not followage? One word? Three months, 25 days, 23 hours. Oh. I I can already tell you who's got the biggest followage here. I already know. I already know who it is. And I am also curious how long it is, but I'm not going to say that person's name. I'll give the dog a treat. Okay. Which one you feeling? You Oh, whoa. Whoa, look at this. Look at this. Oh, both dogs. Okay. All right. They appreciate that. They appreciate that. Thank you, Lauren. You have no idea. I haven't been here for too long. Oh, I don't know who it is. 
<laughs> Love when Sim Sandler Shoe does those little cutscenes. It's such a nice touch. It was, yeah. It was. Let's go back and find T Rav. Let him know we did what we had to. <laughs> Garlic? Yeah, not fair. Keep on following you? Yeah, well, I hope it's worth the meme, right? <laughs> I hope it's worth the meme. Oh, it is. It is. Oh, that one's cooler at night when the lights. Oh, and the lights are on? I'm sure. I would like it if, uh, I would like to just magically have lights throughout the entirety of the Commonwealth, like street lamps, on the entirety of the roads. So, like, it's lit up everywhere along the roads. That'd be kind of fun. I would like to, I would just like to see it. Oh. <clears throat> Let's talk to T-Rav. Hey, what's up, Squeege? Hello there. My nose is getting stuffy. Uh-oh. Sick? Uh-oh. Yeah, I noticed. When the power came back, it blew out half the bulbs in here. Oh, sorry, dude. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to replace those. But the important thing is, we now have power. Will it be enough? I don't know. Let's go find out. Oh, All you right can then. you can tag someone Let's to figure out how long they've been following. Up. Interesting. Now Interesting. Oh, Lively, you could do that. It'd be a ton of work. I think it'd be a... I I think... I mean, I'm not asking you to do it because <laughs> I'm never gonna... I'm never gonna see it. But, uh... I just think... I like seeing lights. You know? And yeah, doing doing all that lighting across the Commonwealth is probably pretty crazy. But I just think running... Like, I don't even play at night. Like, I rarely... I rarely let it be nighttime. Which I'm probably... I think I'm missing out on quests by doing that. But, uh, it would just be cool to be going down here because you have power, right? So you can have power drop, so it makes sense if there is power. But, like, it would be cool to, like, light up all the roads. Just have street lamps. But, yeah, no simple thing, huh? Oh, Squeeze so far is not so bad. Don't think it's the vid. Okay. Look at them trees. Yeah, the trees are nice. Trees are nice. Yeah, you do it for your Starfield uh, player home. Uh, have duplicate lamps and the light sources tied. Initially disable some opposite parent. Tie them to a light switch. Activating the switch swaps out the lamps. Enables. Wow. Well, okay. Oh man. I'm excited for the Starfield playthrough, you guys. I know. I'm pretty sure no one here is excited for me to play the Starfield. To play Starfield, but guys, I'm excited. I've never had my chance. I've never had my shot. <laughs> as soon as I get that service roaming vehicle, as soon as I have that service roaming vehicle, it's happening. As soon as that DLC drops, it's happening. <coughs> Are you okay, T Rev? Okay. <coughs> that didn't exactly go to plan. Oh my god, what are you choking on, dude? <sighs> Was that squeeze closer to what? Chernobyl Prip Pripyat is right now? Oh, this is closer to Chernobyl. I see you're saying. Funny thing, I heard the plants around Chernobyl grow toward radiation source. Oh, I have no idea if that's true. That could be true, but I have no idea. That sounds made up, but maybe. <sighs> oh, Lauren, nah. I hope Starfield is good. Yeah, me too. I mean, I already, I mean, people already know what it's like, but I don't know. I don't have an actual real life opinion on it. Yeah. Oh, you yeah, see that? <laughs> Bugged. <clears throat> to be honest. No I voice. Kind of this might happen. Interesting. I've been sitting around the news for so long. And so many of its parts have degraded. Seems even with enough power, there's no getting around Blowing out capacitors and pair of semiconductors. <laughs> Still, it's worth a try. So what now? Oh, interesting. Give me a day or two. Oh, I guess. Hey, back at swap out well, the busted parts. Wait, is this not voice choose? acted? Not for some settlements, are you not voice acted? Like it, but that would make sense. For some reason, I just thought I thought I was talking to Travis before, but I guess I wasn't. <laughs> not a bug. 
Oh, you definitely are talking. Okay, I don't know how you broke this. Wait, I didn't do anything, dude. I was just playing. He's supposed to be downstairs next to the comm hub for this. Dude, he's up here choking on rust or something. Sure. <laughs> oh, I heard my guy talk. Oh, wait. Before you He go. was just insanely quiet. Hey, take this. I heard him talk. After all the trouble we've had with raiders, I started wondering if ASAMs could offer a solution. Now, I've not had the time to put some together myself. Been too busy with the comm hub. But what you have there are instructions on how to jury rig together a sort of defense plot. Okay. It's not very advanced, but should at least deter attacks from some of the small fry. Oh. Alarn, uh, you, you didn't play that much of it, but I was really excited for it. Yeah, I think everyone was really excited. I think everyone was. How does it work? Technically, it's just a creative use of an ASAM program with an industrial plot. But by making the changes listed on that piece of paper, the ASAM should be able to guide someone to build something a little more defensive. After okay. that, it's just a matter of basic maintenance by whomever was assigned Who are we defending against, Trav? Well, I'm gonna I can hear it. I can while, barely so I hear it. But I'm sure you'll be able to figure I wonder if yourself. I save and reload if it'll sort itself out. If I'm not talking in the next but dialogue interaction. Again when I've got news. Take care out there. Okay, copy that. If I'm not talking in the next dialogue interaction, I will save and reload. Because a lot of times that seems to sort stuff out. A lot of times that seems to sort stuff out. Well, well, well. Come on, Trav. I want to help you, dude. I want to help you. I guess we'll just wait. We'll give him some time. We'll wait for a couple days. Oh, Squeeze, you weren't interested in it. Okay. That's fair. <clears throat> I wonder if your voice is coming from downstairs since that where you're supposed to be. Maybe. I mean, I could hear it. I could hear it. So it's just ever so faint. Oh, you gotta take off for like 15 minutes or so. We'll be back. Hey, don't worry about it. Thanks for stopping by, dude. Here, let's uh, let's see if we can catch him on the radio or something. <laughs> Give hey, dog a treat. Switch. Okay, which one? Oh, both. Got it. Don't Got bother it. answering that. I can't hear you through your pit, boy. Also, this is pre-recorded. I got some news on the comm hub. After a little tinkering, a few replaced parts, and a whole lot of cursing, I've still not been able to turn it on. <laughs> not exactly the best news, I know. <laughs> they appreciate that. Out, too many of its parts are degraded beyond use. However, here's some good news. An acquaintance of mine did some information digging, and we made a little discovery. Turns out there's a building. Oh my god, in more trees. We may find a second comp hub in better condition. This oh goat video. Okay. I got map. you. I'll be waiting for you there by the time you hear this. Alright, copy that, Trav. This has been a pre-recorded message. Copy that message hub of the problem. In three seconds. Go video coming up. Hey, they're slick. They're How thirsty today. I got video of them Don't swarming the water that. bucket. Also, this is pre-recorded. Hey, let's take off this. I got some news on the comm hub. All right, come on, doggos. Oh, all right, let's go. Oh, have fun with this quest? Okay, I will. <laughs> the only time they get fed. You remembered. You remembered, dude. Yes. <sighs> Feed them, you guys. Give them some treats. They need it. They need it. Where'd he say he was? Hold on. Oh, he way down there. Meet Jake near the Charles View Amphitheater. Let's go. Let's go to the plaza. Where's Travis? Who's Jake? Good man. That's right. We're calling him T-Rav now. 
That's his new nickname I just gave him today, which is a derivative of Travis. T-Rav. Uh, and we're gonna go, we're gonna go get him right now. That's what we're just listening to on the radio. <laughs> oh, yeah, it, these, these goats, it's crazy. They'll, uh, so you can kind of see the, the field going down the hill, uh, the pasture. It like, you can kind of see where the road is if you look at the top of the frame on the left. Um, they will take, oh my God. Get her, Nick! Oh, yeah, dude. They're so powerful now. Holy heck, dude. But the goats will take the bucket and, like, mess with it and, like, walk it down the hill once it's empty. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. What are the goats doing on this fine evening? Uh, they're outside right now foraging on <laughs> in the pasture. That's what they do every day. It's crazy. They just eat and sleep and drink. It's all they do. Easiest life. <clears throat> and then one day they get butchered and die. <laughs> but we don't need to tell them about that. We don't need to tell them about that part. Keep that a secret. We'll keep that a secret. All right. You think these guys, you think Heather and Nick can take them out? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Okay. <clears throat> Come on, guys. Come on. Come back. I, was having fun. I need to get them in there. They're way stronger now. They're way stronger now. Oh, there we go. Lure them out. Gotcha. Come on. Get them, Nick. Look at Nick. He, his gun is wicked. Oh, oh yeah, dude. Nick is a badass. Nick is such a Nick get in there, dude. Oh my lord. Get to work, dude. Idiots incoming. They're in <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Heather. Oh my god, dude. She's so good. Oh. Worth it, the goats. They got a good life. They got a good life. <clears throat> I can't wait to get the uh, to to get the baby goats. Show you guys. That's gonna be a good time. Oh, crow! Thanks for the lurk, dude. <laughs> the hawk, the hawk, do we girl? <laughs> no. Oh shoot. Okay. okay. Oh you god. The wrong fight, Raider. <laughs> dude. Dude, we are so much stronger now, you guys. We could totally handle Far Harbor now. With these two, I think we can now. They're so much stronger. Wait, Alarn? You're saying the goats just eat, drink, and sleeping? It sounds you do less than that every day? Do you just not sleep, right? They they probably sleep more than you. They just sleep out in the grass. In the sun, in the shade. They're wild. They're wild like that. Oh, not as strong as Jennifer Fezzi. Dude, they are. These companions are top tier now. Hey, right, Travis. I'm just excited to run into trouble. I kind of want to go back and test their might over in Quincy and see if they can see if they can hold their own against those guys over there. Cause they were, those are really tough. All right, Heather. You should be running the other way, you dumbass. Check it out. Oh my lord. Yes, dude. Freaking Nick. Approach and identify Oh my lord. Check them out. Let's just watch them do their work. Nick, get to work, dude. Oh, that's a good guy. Good fucking riddance. Nick is not, hasn't quite figured out how to conduct himself on the battlefield, I think. Oh, you think you know this place, Squeege? Uh, oh, yes, Windwalker? Hey, thanks for the Lunch bits, it. dude. Uh, thanks for the bits, man. Doesn't he? 
I appreciate Another that. Day? Thank the you, dude. Of course they're top notch. Ask yourself, who's leading them? <laughs> true. Big, big true on that. Commander Brevezzi. We can do, we can do anything together. I appreciate that, Windwalker. Thanks a lot, dude. Oh God. Okay. Hey. Something out there. Nick isn't very like. Oh, this guy. Okay, so we got a juggernaut here. Let's see how they do. Let's see how they do up here. I'll try to draw them out. Covering fire. Oh shoot. Okay, let's see. Let's see. You a good guy? Oh, he's down here. Where's that juggernaut at? Dude, I don't know where that juggernaut went. Oh, right there. Okay. Play with us. Oh my god, dude. It's Nick, man. He's so good. It's this like plasma rifle we got him. He's so good. It's so good. It's this. It's one of these. We stopped using it. Raider Power 6 helmet? Oh my god. Look at this. DC Guard Heavy helmet? Interesting. It looks, it looks definitely different. Apparel. Power armor. Oh, wow. Wait, I think that might be a really big upgrade for, for Heather. Roger that. I wonder if the other stuff, Raider power right arm. Oh, let's just take a look at it real quick. No, so there, well, maybe. Here, let's just give it to her. Uh, trade. I'm ready. Let's see. Tell me what you've got. Okay, let's compare real quick. If not, we'll just drop it. Uh, left arm. I wish you could compare. Like, oh, you can. Why? Oh my god, dude. Okay, I did not know you could do that. Okay, so then we can just. No, I can't drop from here. Okay, wait, Charity. What am I comparing it with? Oh, you hit Y. I see. You hit Y and it brings it up. And then you go over here and you can look at the other stuff. Okay, so it's a downgrade on that. Uh, Raider power left leg. Downgrade from the quantum steel. Okay, what about the torso? What about the helmet? The helmet might be a big one. Oh, yeah. Helmet is a big upgrade. Okay. Let's give this to her. All right, we'll take that helmet back. I don't think any of the legs are gonna be upgrades, but potentially the, let's check out the torso. Uh, downgrade, the T60 is better. And I know the quantum leg, what are the, the arms, the gunner? The left arm in particular. Oh, did I even pick up a left arm of that guy? I did, right here. No, it's a downgrade. Okay, so the helmet was an upgrade, though. I was, oh, look at her. Hello. Oh, wow. Nice. All right, let's drop this other stuff. Dude, this was the best idea. The best idea ever. Putting her, putting her in the power armor. Apparel, power armor, and we drop. Drop is R. There we go. Goodbye. Dex, you yeah. Sure no, it was good. That. And then also getting, dude, Nick is so, Nick Valentine, he's so much more useful now. That plasma rifle is incredible. Big help. Big help. All right, we got to cross the pond. Here, let's go to the left. Yeah, I feel a lot, I feel a lot less vulnerable now. I mean, because they can actually hold their own. Does that mean... Since the power... 
power armor doesn't break when your companions are in it, does that mean Heather can't die? Was that a car? It's like a car symbol. Does that mean the car's gonna blow up? I don't know. Let's get away from it. Interesting. <laughs> Nick, come on, Nick. Let's go, dude. Oh, look at that. Yeah, dude, get put in work. Oh my god, I almost fell through that hole. Okay, come on. It's actually surprising how Heather is at her best with heavy weaponry and power armor. Oh my god, the car did blow up, dude. Did you see that? The car did blow up. Oh god, oh god. Heather? Oh yeah. Oh my god, look at Oh my god, Nick's down. You Go on, Heather. Dead. We'll see what she can do. Let's see what she can do in there. Oh my god. Help! Dude, I feel like she's indestructible. I feel like she's indestructible. Yeah, I'll take some of that dog meat. Whoa, target is poison for 10 seconds. Hold on. Inventory, weapon, all. Interesting. Poison damage. I don't think I've noticed that before. Who else? You like how she cried help for the... <laughs> when the dog started getting her, that's when she needed help, dude. She's not good at killing animals yet, but we're gonna get her there. Don't worry. We're gonna get her there. She's gonna be killing all the little puppies in no time. You know, for the good of the Commonwealth, of course. Damn. Got nothing. It's okay, Nick. Oh, citizen finished improvements at Sanctuary Hill. Oh man, there's rolling in. All right, we're on the side. We got double back. All right, we're going west. Oh, I love that. Sim Settlements 2, just doing work behind the scenes. Staying busy. All right, we got someone over here. Where you at, friend? Up top, down below. They're up top. Someone's coming. I know. I know, Nick. I know. Take him out. Do your thing. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Maybe we can snipe them. Oh no, they already took care of them, did they? Are they still up there? I still see the red dot. I don't see any movement. Oh god, there she is, there she is. Oh shoot. Got him. Dude, that... Plasma rifle Nick has is so good. Got him. Hard to see him amongst the fog, but they're there. Oh, they're there. I'm going to stock up on stim packs. I think that's what I'm going to spend all my money on. That's the only thing so far that I've spent it on. We still have about 7,000 left. I think I think stim packs is the way to go. I think it's the way to go. Heads up. Helps out. Things can get tough around here. Oh, what's up, Epic? How's your day going, dude? And ran into a death claw fighting a bunch of muties. Mm. Death claw. Oh, it's good to hear. You're doing good? I'm doing good, too. Oh, I'm doing good, too. Still another hot day here. I saw a guy here once who was playing a guitar and singing. It's like 38, 38 Celsius today. High 90s. We got, uh, 
we fixed, we fixed ourselves up. We got better prepared. Got Heather kitted out <sighs> in some power armor. Got Nick Valentine kitted out as well. New weapons and everything. So they're like really useful now. They're really good. So I, I don't feel nearly as under underpowered when I have them now. So that's good. <laughs> it's helped a lot. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Keep your distance. We'll let them handle that, I think. Oh my god. Whenever you see him go flying like that, that's just okay. I'll, I'll get the bird. Don't worry. That's Nick with his freaking plasma rifle. It's crazy. It's so good. Oh, here we go. Here's T Rav. Oh, let's lock it in. There we go. All right. What's up, bud? Need to chat with you, okay? Hey, slick. Say. You spoke to any of the people around that old theater? Those glazed eyes, creepy smiles. I wonder if my voice is still bugged. Their little pamphlets? I tell you, they ain't round the head. Let's see. If it's bugged, I'm gonna reload the save. Felt yeah. A tad underdressed it's after bugged last still. Adventure. What with the bullets flying everywhere and such. Anyway, as I said in my message, I've been unable to get our com hub running. That's okay, Honestly, Travis. Given the state of it, I'm not surprised. Tech like that ain't designed to be left sitting around unused. True. Too many of its components have seized up or just degraded over time. Man, I hate that oxidization, huh? Oxidization, ox, rust. Hate it when things rust, man. What can I do to help? As a matter of fact, yeah, there is. If we want more out of ASAMs, we need a comm hub that works. But as it is, I don't have what we'd need to repair the one we have. However, fortune has smiled upon us. A friend of mine discovered where we might find a second com hub okay. in better condition. All right, dude. As well as a nice stockpile of ASAM products to boot. So if you'd care to join me, I want to go check this place out. I'm with you every step of the way, my guy. I knew I could count on you. With luck, we may just find ourselves a working com hub. Or at the very least, a few ASAM goodies. Here, let me update your pit boy map. Sounds good. Here we go. Here, as soon as we grab All right, this. Lead on. As soon as that quest ticks. Investigate, lead, Jake, receive. Got it. Let's make sure. Yes. All right. Let's try this out. Save. Auto saving. Okay. Uh, quit to title real quick. And we'll see if... Because uh, this has fixed bugs before in the past. We'll see if this will fix it. I need to get more coffee. Annabelle is gone. She's in Seattle now for uh, for a couple days for work. And it's just me and the doggos. What what shall we do? I don't know. Maybe 24 hour stream. Maybe drink some of that special Mountain Dew on stream. I don't know. <laughs> Something to celebrate, you know. It's so quiet in game. I don't feel like. Oh, yeah. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Let, let's talk to Heather. Let's talk to Nick. Do something for you. Yeah, Any dude. Chance you got a second our now. our voice is like permanently bugged, but so are sound effects. Maybe we should close the desktop real quick and see if that fixes it. It might just be bugged forever. But I noticed like my my feet aren't making sound effects or nothing. I was like, it seems awfully quiet when I'm moving around. What's up, Smoke? You'd never make 24 hours. You're too old. Whoa, dude. I made it 19 hours, okay? Here, let's quit the desktop. Let's see if this is the thing that let's see if this is the thing that fixes it. Okay, I'm launching right now in mod organizer. Don't worry though. I'm gonna talk. No, I could do it, dude. I could do it. I could do it. I just need a reason to do it. 
We did 19 hours. I bet if I really tried, I could make it 24. Because that 19 hours was on a whim. It was rough, though. Get some Joppas and, doing two, and do a two-hour stream? Wait, just a two-hour stream? Oh, 24. I was like, sounds like a bit of a downgrade. <laughs> okay. It sounds like a bit of a downgrade. I would love to, I, I would love to do something silly like that at one point to mark a special occasion. I don't know. One year anniversary? I don't know. Something. Two hours would be hard if it was two hours of straight eating Jaffas. What do they call that? Mukbang. Just a mukbang stream of just like a thousand Jaffa cakes all here. And I just eat non-stop like a thousand of them oh. <laughs> that, that sounds like that'd be good for the first like three minutes <laughs> okay okay wait i i i think everything's fixed hey there hey. okay it's fixed thank god dude i was like I was like, I can't handle another thing. If we don't have a voice or sound effects for the rest of the playthrough, there's gonna be another thing rooting against me. All right, Nick, let's go, dude. Let's go. I think there's a decent chance that's deadly, to be honest. Well, I mean, I mean, I, I, I think, I don't think you would die. I don't know if you could, it'd be hard. You'd have to really eat It'd be really hard to overeat to a point of like a health risk, I think. I mean, I can imagine you being in pain from overeating, but I think your body would work it out. Like either throw it up or something. Well, I don't know if you could actually eat a thousand. Like eventually you would just, you would just have to stop. Like you probably couldn't make yourself eat anymore. You'd probably throw up or something. I don't know, something would probably happen. <sighs> you think a pack only has 12 or something? Oh my gosh. Do you guys, no, if I can get a pack in the U.S. Jaffa, Jaffa cake. I looked this up yesterday. It looks like Walmart does sell them, but you have to buy them online. They don't sell them locally. Yeah, they, they'll deliver them to the area. A pack of 20 for 15 bucks. That seems like a lot. Of, they're normally cheaper, right? For a pack of 20, probably normally like $8. But then again, you guys, I don't know what currency everyone's on, so. Jaffa Cakes? Yes, Jaffa Cakes. Oh, shoot, I hit. Guys, I'm... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, yeah, dude. Now that's one way to get Not afraid at all. Dude, we... We could go back to Far Harbor, man. We could go back to Far Harbor. <clears throat> I have confidence that we could that we could that we could do it. Now that they're upgraded, I feel totally different now. I feel way better about it. Oh, and yes, Dex, talking about Jaffa cakes. I don't know how to say it. Ja is it Jaffa like Java, or is it is it Jaffa like giraffe? Aff. <laughs> Java or giraffe? I don't know. Jaffa. Jaffa. Wait, giraffe. Oh. <laughs> it's AF. So Jaffa. Be the right address. Records say a lot of ACM stuff is delivered here. I'm getting contradicting information. Oh, here. Wait. You hear that? Not Jarfar. Okay. <laughs> oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh God. Dude. Dude, they're so much better. I can't get over it, you guys. I, it feels so much better. It feels so good having companions that that are like, that are really good now. I mean, they were good for a while at the beginning and then, you know, through neglect. <laughs> through neglect, they got worse. 
Jaffa's not not for the Middle East, so it's not Jaffa. <laughs> I don't know. Jaffas are overrated. Uh oh. Uh oh. Don't tell Lauren that. I mean, it's just like a, it's just like a store-bought cookie cake biscuit thing. Sticking Google Translate tells you how to say it. Really? Jaffa cake, uh... Hold on. Jaha cake. Wait, that's Jara. Oh, I spelt it wrong. I can't find it. <laughs> Why is that important? Hold that thought. Just found the employee records. There's a name in here. Magnuson. Madison. Have we heard that name somewhere before? Oh, here we go. How do you pronounce this name? Jaffa. Jaffa. Cake. Jaffa. Okay. I was saying it right the whole time. Jaffa cake. Got it. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, bring peace to the Commonwealth. Oh, I will. Oh, yeah. You, oh, yeah. Dude, those emotes are so old. I remember I got those made of SpaceX. Good times. Good good time. Back in my astronaut days. We could get a 24-hour day in the life of Fezzi. Whoa. Maybe. Why do you ask? I no, you were not. Yeah, Jaffa. I just looked it up. It was somewhere recently. We were it's called Jaffa. Wait, I remember now. The terminal records at the That's how I was saying it, Dex. We read the same name As a Brit, I can categorically categorically state you're not saying it right. I'll say I'll say Jaffa. Huh. Maybe this guy was in charge of I think delivering hubs or something. This seems like something we should look into. Jaffa. Maybe this Magnuson had an office here. Let's see if we can find it. I just listened to it. That's what they said. That's how they said how you say it. Send me I'll look at a video uh, of like someone getting a tour of the of the Jaffa Cake Factory and then however they say it, you know, like where they're produced, uh, I'll, uh, I'll, that'll be the, the source of truth. Wait, you're going to send me a soundbite of you saying it? Yeah, but you might just be saying it wrong. My, one of my co-workers, have you heard of Choco Tacos, you guys? One of my co-workers, you know, he's a Spanish-speaking dude. He's Mexican. His name was Ivan. And he would always call Choco Tacos, Choco. Choco Tacos. And I was like, dude, they're called Choco Tacos. And he's like, no, that's not how you say it. And he would, I swear he would call them Choco. Choco Tacos. I was like, okay, I understand what you're saying. That you, that it's supposed, this is how you say chocolate or whatever. I don't remember. I had to pull up, I had to pull up the video of where they produced them. I think it was in Pittsburgh where the factory was of them giving them a tour of them giving a tour and of the actual owners of the company walking the facility with the news crew calling them Choco. And he was like, that's so stupid. That's not how, it, and I was like, dude, I, <laughs> that's just what they're called. So I don't know, just be. I'm just saying, I may not be 100% convinced one way or another. I have to hear it from the CEO's mouth. <laughs> Are we talking about Final Fantasy? I don't know. We're talking about Choco Tacos. <laughs> oh, Lauren, you're back? Wait, I thought you were already here. Where'd you even go? You just are perpetually back. You're perpetually... Oh, you love Choco Tacos? I used to... Okay, guys, the statute of limitations is up because it's been like 15 years. But when I worked at Taco Time, I used to, uh, I, I closed the store. Ta and Taco Time is like a different type of Taco Bell, like a fast food Mexican inspired restaurant. Um, and we sold, and we sold Choco Tacos. And whenever I would close the store, I would just grab them from the freezer on the way out. I was just grabbing from the freezer on the way out, and then it became a problem. 
But yeah, I totally stole Choco Tacos. Oh, you're dumb? I heard Chocobo? <laughs> hey, well, we like Final Fantasy around here. We like Final Fantasy around here. Uh, although I think the only the only one I think that's playing Final Fantasy 14 right now I think is Smoke Smokeless Joe. There might be some others out there. But yeah, I'm I'm a Final Fantasy fan. Just give me a second. All right, let's figure out where we need to go for this guy. Data. Find the Magnuson's office in the Vault Tech Regional. Investigate lead Jake received. Copy. We gotta find the office. Let's turn the light on. What is a chocolate? Wait, what is Choco Tacos? It's a, it's like a waffle cone. You know a waffle cone that they put ice cream in? Imagine a waffle, that, that kind of waffle cone, uh, but folded up in the shape of like a hard shell taco. And then the, and then in that hard shell waffle cone taco thing, there's ice cream and then there's like chocolate fudge. And then there's like a chocolate, and then the top is like dipped in chocolate, so it's kind of encased in. So it's like a vanilla chocolate fudge filled chocolate dipped waffle ice cream taco. Yeah, that's what it is. You sent Fezzy, you sent to Fezzy, although I bottled it and didn't record myself. You made me doubt myself. <laughs> okay. You send a video of someone else saying it. Was that in the Discord? Oh, you sent it to you DM me. Jaffa cake. Yeah, that's what I Yeah, Jaffa cake. Oh, ja, not jaw. Jaffa. Okay. That's the difference. Okay. Not Jaffa. Jaffa. Like Jaffa the Hut. Got it. Oh, when do we get a Final Fantasy 13 playthrough? Dude, I've never played Final Fantasy 13 or 12. I. <laughs> You'd have to get people on board with that. Do you think that would? Don't you think that would be too slow for this for stream? I don't. Actually, I don't think so. I don't think it would be. That'd be kind of fun. That could be fun. Oh, Larna sounds good. I don't have to find one. They are good. I mean, it's just it's just ice cream. It's a novelty. Like it, it's kind of a gimmick. Guys, we need to find this freaking office. Yesterday we were looking for so long in a place. There's an enemy in here. We were lost for so long yesterday. For so long. Heather is so loud. Jeez. Yeah, Heather's so loud. Yeah, dude. Oh, here we go. No. <laughs> Jinx. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, you owe me a Coke, okay? <laughs> That's how that works. All right, this is not an office. So what we're looking for is find Magnuson's office in vault Tech Regional Headquarters. And I think we're, we're currently at, yeah, we're currently at the Regional Headquarters, just making sure. Oh my god, Heather. Slow it down, girl. Dr. Reed's terminal. Welcome to Robco Industries. Okay. Wrong place, bud. Wrong place. But I just sped read all that, okay? Room by room we clear. Let's go this way to the left. Oh, garlic. You made her this way? Oh, we go up, 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 up. Okay, cool. We haven't been here. Get your guns out. 
<laughs> Oxymoron? Unironically, Mexican Coke tastes way better. Wait, why is that unironically? I like it, because it always, they always serve, whenever I get Mexican Coke, it's in the glass bottle, which I just enjoy drinking out of the glass bottle more. And then, and then it's got, it's got sugar cane. You know, it's got, it's got real sugar and it just, it's nice. It's nice. I'm a fan of that. I, I really like the bottled, uh, glass bottled Coke. You think you ever heard anyone say Jinx or however you spell it in a few years? Forgot that existed. <laughs> Got him though. Are you sure? I'm fairly sure. Glass bottle Coke is awesome. Yeah, I, I like it. Because he used to work with Rob Crow in the A. Coke and glass bottle is so much better. Yes. Yes, I agree. Judging by his terminal entries, I don't think this guy like his job here very seriously. I, I want to put a freeze, yeah, uh, a fridge, a refrigerator in the garage and just fill it with he that. Was using his position here to embezzle company equipment. I should embezzle company equipment. That's a hell of a risk. I have the Xbox, the Xbox Series One. Uh, the, sorry, the Xbox Series X mini fridge. <laughs> I should, I should put that here and just put Coke in it. Have That's you guys seen those? The nerve on this guy. He was actually stealing from Vault Tech. Oh, you had one for the morning cold, absolutely robots. bliss. Hell, he was even stealing oh, yeah. the ice and Oh, I don't think we're gonna find a second comp up here. <laughs> What's going on with that camera, dude? I don't know why, but Fanta outside of the UK is crazy good. I think they're made different. I mean, I don't know about the UK specifically. I know Fanta in the US is much different than abroad. But I don't know the specifics of it, but I saw a comparison video. It's interesting. Why? What's going on? Vault Tank were expecting a com up to be shipped here. But this Madison guy hijacked the delivery. Had it sent to Olivia instead. What we came here to look for, we've already found. Okay. How do you know, T Rav? How do you know? Madison wrote an entry all about it. It's almost as if he was bragging. Apparently, he walked into a shipping depot, bold as you please, and switched the shipping label on the com hubs crate. Seems like he's been doing equipment from Vault Tech for months. It's okay, bud. It's okay. You couldn't have done. Well, maybe you did. Thanks. Appreciate the kind words. Yeah, no problem, Trav. Looks like we're stuck with the hub we have. No problem. But it does sound like Vault Tech were working on something similar. Maybe we should investigate this rival product of theirs. Hey, maybe it's something we can use? The terminal said this place has a warehouse where they worked on projects. I'm thinking we should take a peek down there. Although, terminal also said we'd need to take an elevator. And supposedly, we'd need a key card for that. There's gotta be one around here somewhere. Let's see Trav has beautiful it. eyes. It's that, like... Uh, it's like a... I mean, I don't know if I can really say it and make it sound beautiful, but it's like a deep brown ocean <laughs> of mud, but beautiful, you know? Oh, uh, it's like a brown lake. <laughs> Gorgeous, absolutely beautiful, but, but for real beautiful. It's an unfortunate, it's an unfortunate thing. He's a good guy. <laughs> okay. Okay, find a way into the basement. Okay, here. Well, I don't know if the basement's gonna be up here, but we might as well open up open up the rest of these doors real quick. Oh my lord, there we go. You gotta get the head. Oh, elevator ID card! Let's go take that elevator. Dude! Oh god, oh god. Oh god! Dude! Thank you, man. I appreciate that. Okay. We got a quest marker going down. Is there anything in here, though? Get out of the way! Heather, get out of the way! Okay. There's nothing. Let's just drop through the floor. 
Okay. Here we go. All right, guys, we made it. Key card. He has the eyes of a man that should be named Jake. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. <laughs> I can when I look at his eyes, I can see it. I can see a Jake. I, I can see that being a Jake's eyes for sure. I can see that. Basement. I can see that. Stinks down here. Uh -oh. oh come on, not again! <sighs> Damn creepy ass girls. Yeah, I know, dude. I know. Tell me about Let's it. Okay, I'm looking. There's gotta be something down here. All right, there's a button right here. I'll press it. Don't worry. Oh God, Travis, where are you? Travis? Oh, thank God. How about you? <sighs> oh wow, there's a lot of reverb in here. I tried turning the reverb off. Uh, but it's still persistent. Like you still. Where are you at, dude? Empty. Not a single sensor or anything. Oh, you're right there. It must have been keeping all the stuff they were working on somewhere. This can't be all there is. We're, we're missing something. Yeah. What are we missing? Okay. I got you. All right. All right, Travis. I'll go this way. You go that way. Okay. Okay. I got Walter Scott's terminal right here. Hacking in. Okay. Nope. Nothing. Just a bunch of lame journal entries. Alright. I got a door. Oh, yeah. There we go. There we go. All my Skyrim lockpicking practice didn't go to waste. Okay. I am the master. Oh, yeah. Too easy, guys. Nice. Come on. Come on, game. Give me a challenge. But not really. <laughs> <Don't>. <laughs> Keep it easy for me. It gave me a challenge yesterday in Far Harbor. I wasn't actually ready for it. <sighs> I wasn't ready for it. Oh, smoke. It all tastes good. And it's all good for you. Don't, don't be tricked. All right. Don't be tricked. <sighs> you find it interesting that some people, some countries wash eggs and others don't. Oh, you gotta wash your eggs. There's literally, like if you get them from the farm and they're not washed, there's like chicken poop on them. Most countries don't. Oh my God, you can get, you can get sick from that. If you crack it open, I mean, I know the egg is on the inside. I know you don't eat the shell, but when you crack it, if there's like dirt and chicken poop on it, you can still get, you can still get stuff off that. Like if you're cooking with it and you're touching it with your hands, right? Cause you're touching it with your, you know what I mean? If you're cooking and you have these poop covered eggs, right? You could definitely, you know, it definitely get you. You could definitely get you. I mean, yeah, we. In the store, they all come clean, but. My, my mom, my stepdad, they they have chickens, and when you get them straight from the uh, straight from the hen house or whatever, when you collect them, they're they're messy. Not always, but they sometimes are. Sometimes, sometimes they got some. Some stuff on them. You gotta take off. Wait, you don't eat the shell? I just realized. You don't eat the shell? There's a lot of minerals there, actually. Next time you're eating an egg, you should grind up the shell. Grind it up in a pestle and mortar. And then just sprinkle it on top of your food like pepper. You should definitely try that. Get all your micronutrients in there. Eat the shell. Totally normal. Wait, what is happening right now? Search the Vault Tech Regional he Did I? Wait, where did I just go? We were literally just in here. And then I ran out. 
zombie. Okay, we go back down. I was supposed to go outside. What's up, Crow? How's it going, dude? <sighs> Travis. Sorry, dude. I just, like, abandoned you. I wasn't paying attention. I just ran outside. <sighs> Wait, does the dance redeem include you breaking it down? Breaking it down? I don't actually know what that is. <laughs> I don't actually know. What do you mean, like doing a break dance? <sighs> Smoke, you can't believe some countries get their milk in a bag. Wait, you get your milk in a bag? <laughs> I haven't heard of that. Oh man. Okay, you guys I can't figure out. I don't know where where this basement we're supposed to go. Uh-oh Okay Okay I don't know. <sighs> okay. I don't know, dude. 10 out of 10? Okay, thanks. Dude, we keep we keep going in and out here. <sighs> we keep going in and out. Druid Sandstorm is the downfall of the Roman Empire. We can start playing I'm blue instead. <sighs> We can start doing I'm blue. Mix it up a little. We keep going around. Hey, what's up, diet? Bonjour. You guys, we just keep going in circles. <laughs> we're, we're trapped again. <laughs> we're tra we are trapped once again. <sighs> Absolute cinema. I like the sound of that. <clears throat> Missing something. Okay. Let's keep looking. Okay. I'll try this again. I press the button again. Search the Vault Tech Regional HQ basement. Okay. It is not that way. Oh my god. Oh, I thought this was a door. No secret. Heather, you're so loud. Here, let's get back on the terminal. Let's go through all these logs. One of them might have what we're looking for. I miss Sharon. A container arrived in Vault 10. Dark, do not open. Okay. Heather? You need to be quieter in that suit of yours, or I'm gonna take it away. <laughs> what does that button do? I keep pressing it. Oh my gosh, this is why I hate power armor. Here we go, what's this? We can't get in that safe. We press a button. 
Nothing. Huh. Has anyone done Sim Settlements 2 that might know what's going on here? Travis, you done looking? <sighs> we're, we're missing some. Let's keep looking. Oh, what's up? Oh, no, I... I'm trying to figure out, we're in this basement. <clears throat> and we went out here, but that just takes us out to Beacon Hill. We go in here. I thought maybe there'd be a secret door or something. Oh, there's a mini nuke in the toilet. <laughs> it's in this room. It's in this room? Maybe again, first person. Is it in the bathroom? No, the big room. I've been looking around. I don't know what I'm looking for. I found a button. And then I found this chest over here, but we can't, we can't get in it. Is this why Lively had said had have fun with with that? Oh, look at that! Because I get stuck. Uh oh. All right. Yeah, I don't know what to do. I give up. Yeah. No, I I come through this place. I don't understand what the game wants me to do. You have to poo in the toilet. There's a weight. Okay. Oh, smoke. Late response. But yeah, four liter milk comes in a bag. Anything lower than that is cartons. Okay. Interesting. Three smaller bags inside a big bag. We put a smaller bag in a jug. At the okay. Interesting. Interesting. Look for some mats on the floor and move the. Oh my gosh. Hey, nice work. Hidden trap door, huh? Yeah. Super hidden. Talking. Thanks, dude. God, I hate that. <laughs> oh, Corvus, what's up, dude? Hello? Hello, sir. Ah, Hope you had a good life. day. Let's go take a look, see, shall we? <laughs> Check this place Epic, out. Now, I don't know, though. That'd be I'll insane. That's how it works. I want to play the mod, the mods you make, Epic. Oh my lord, we got stuff leaking. Your guess is as good as mine. Water's leaking everywhere in here. Let's split up and see what we can uncover down here. Copy that, Travis. Dude, that water. It's like a waterfall's in here somewhere. Figure it out. Lively. Oh, I made it to the basement. I see. Just barely. Just barely. Stuck in that dumb room up top forever. Had to get help. Figure out. Figure out where, where the door was. Oh, where am I in game? Yeah, well, Lively said. Uh, Vault Tech headquarters in the basement. Crow, you want fried chicken? I would take that. Grilled octopus? Hard pass. Hard pass for me on the octopus. Oh, I, ugh. Not a fan. You can have all, you, you can have all of my grilled octopus. I give it to you. Oh God. Thank you. Oh, this is the freaking stash, isn't it? Kind of, well, not as much as I was thinking. 
Yeah, not really. <laughs> Thought that was going to be a way better score than it was. Ramen's good too. Yeah, I'll take some ramen. God, grill the octopus in chili? That sounds so gross, dude. But that's good news for you guys. You guys can have all the octopus I don't eat, okay? I'm. You guys can have all of it. There's, there's gonna be so much more octopus in the world for you guys to eat because I'm not eating it. You guys owe me. <laughs> I don't like the texture. I can't do it. Come on. Come on, Mr. Valentine. Let's go. Uh, oh, yeah. What's all that ruckus about? <laughs> Would you look at this thing? What would Voltec trying to do here? And what's that noise it's making? Yeah, must be something wrong with it. All right. Get to work, Travis. You know what to do. Huh. This machine's picking up some kind of radio signal. Okay. Seems like it's trying to connect to something nearby. Hey, do me a favor. Go to that table with the ASAMs. No, the garlic. Room. I do not want to chew on some tentacles. No, I don't. I'm not a fan. It's not for me. I don't like right, it. Should you should join the railroad for your crowd control system. playthrough. <sighs> the railroad cannot be joined. Okay. I don't know if I have the... I don't know if I have the heart to be so callous and evil as to join the railroad. <laughs> All right, come on back. We'd have to kill him. We'd have to kill him. <laughs> but I'm glad you remember the crowd control thing. I keep forgetting about it. I keep meaning to check it out after stream. I keep forgetting about it. I really want to do some research on that. Excuse me. Yeah, that confirms what I thought, all right. To kind of get a feel like, like what games in its entirety does it support? That's what I'm what? curious. The signals this machine was picking, <sighs> they were coming from those ASAMs. They were emitting the radio signals. <laughs> Baby squids. Squid, you can have it as well. Makes sense, I suppose. It's all yours, dude. You shut off the power to the ASAMs, we shut off the signal. Simple deduction. I didn't know the sensors could do something like that. Emit a radio signal, that is. Now that begs the question, just what is this thing? Why I don't is know. It trying to pick up signals from sensors? Interesting. Just what kind of ASAM technology with vault -Tec trying to copy here? Your guess is as good as mine. Well, we can find out the answer. Now that's the kind of spirit I like to see. That's right, T-Rav. There's got to be someone around here to tell us what this machine is. Some notes or documents or something. Okay. Take a look around. See what you can find. Okay. Okay. Notes or documents. Thank you, game, for telling me exactly where it is. I, not in sarcasm. I appreciate that. Just let me know exactly where this stuff is. <sighs> okay, we got our notes. I found some technical documents for you. Really now? Where's the water in here? Well, I'll be. It sounds like there's an open waterfall. I wonder if it's in those pipes. It's extremely loud. suppose an effort was made. Not much a rival product, though. Doesn't even seem to work right. I guess after Magnuson stole the hub, Vault Tech were forced to build their own version with no real reference. No. If this thing really is a reproduction of a comic, I think we actually might be able to use this. Okay. I'm listening. We came here looking for another comic because the one we've got so badly damaged it won't even turn We're on. We're gonna have to turn that down for a sec. You're driving me crazy. Exactly what I expected to find. This bomb tech knockoff might still be useful. Call me optimistic. But between this thing and the real comic, we might just be able to cobble together something that works. We can do it. We can do it, Travis. You and me? Together, we can do anything, dude. We can fly twice as high. If it's in a book, we take a look. We can do it. 
Now let's get out of here. Let's make sure though. Investigate the lead, Jake. Oh, Jake. Travis. Right here. Bam. I'm just hitting the button, dude. I'm getting out of this room. <laughs> we'll just let we'll just let Travis talk to himself in there. You're doing a really good job, Travis. Oh, are you done talking, my guy? Dude, this room sucks. <laughs> Is it machinery moving? Nice. You know a machine can't make something if it don't got the schematics for it. Yeah. I suppose so. Well, would it surprise you to learn that this thing has a copy of the schematics needed to build ASANS? I wonder who vault paid off for of that. Let me just download a copy of this. I'm not sure vault won't mind. And there we are. We may have to adapt for it, but now... We'd be able to build as many senses as we want. Oh, perfect. Infinite no ASAMs. This is a real game. Oh, oh heck yeah. No problem, dude. I reckon we've still not uncovered everything that's here yet. Let's keep looking around. <sighs> okay. As long as we don't have to look in this room. Okay, let's go in here. Purified water. Something in here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Jake. Something? Yeah, I got something for you, dude. Ooh, what have we here? That's right. That's right. Take a look. Take a look. Oh, well, how about that? This holotape contains data for the different ASAM variants. You know, block types. The different things ASAMs can be programmed for. Heather, you're I so loud. Like plan to copy the software. Let's see. Diet, the water's starting to sound like static TV to me. TV static? I know. I know. Me too. It's like, I don't know what. It's awful. Commercial? Sick. Do you know what you just found? Oh, yeah. I think so. There's data for four new plot types here. Four more things that ASAMs could build. I don't think Robco ever released these variants. At least not to the general public. This is one hell of a find. I'm gonna have to study this tape. If I can figure out how to transfer new data on the sensors, I'm fairly certain we'll soon have more things to build. <laughs> Crow, it's the girl from the ring. She's trying to crawl out of the well through the, through the TV. Oh my God. Dude, that movie was terrifying to me when it came out. What do you mean you're only fairly certain? Well, oh wait, let's not talk to him about that actually. I'm sorry, it's okay. Sounds great. Well, with that, I think we've uncovered That was a very can. scary movie when that came out. Okay, let me just take a mental... Mm -hmm. We got the schematics to build our own sensors. New plot types, if I can figure out how to make them work. And, of course, vault version of a comm hub, which just might allow us to start repairing the one we've already got. <laughs> to call this trip productive would be an understatement. Yeah, uh -huh. all right. We're speed running this to get out of here. Hey, I'm here to help. Well, it's driving me crazy. Who's Who they? they? Uh oh. An acquaintance of mine. Actually, okay. the guy got us the info on this place. Said he needed to talk to me once I was done here. Something about some important information he wanted to share. There's no way I can just leave all this stuff here. Look, I know I'm kind of passing the buck, but could you meet with this fella for me? See what he wants? Sure, sure, sure. Okay. Sure, I can do that. Oh, thank you. You're a real pal. Sweeter than a baby's breath. Whoa, why are you smelling well, baby's breath all the time, Travis? Shit. He's an information broker. He calls himself the ROM. Chances are he wants to sell us some info. And given his past track record, it's probably something useful. So here, take these caps. Pay him and find out what he has to say. Most hours of the day, you'll find him in his office, towards the back of the city. All right, time for me to get this stuff back to the hardware store. This should be a fun challenge of logistics. Once you've wrapped up everything with the ROM, head on back and let me know how it went. Oh, actually, before you go, might as well take this. What do you got for me? Here, 
Okay. That's a copy of the ACM schematics. Got it. Appreciate it, dude. Let's get out of here. Nice. I won't blame you if you want to test out. Oh my gosh, Travis. I gotta go. <laughs> I gotta get out of here. Oh my god. The ring girl. We're never going in that room ever again, guys, okay? It's been blacklisted. <laughs> I'm never going back in there ever again, dude. Holy heck. Oh, oh, lively. They. This quest used to be really buggy and hugely problematic. Since it has three objectives, you can complete in any random order. It took a long time to get this work in. Travis has side activities. Wait, was that a bug? That, that static noise? Was that just a bug? Oh, sorry. They added this background noise stuff in an update like eight months ago. I have no idea why. It's really obnoxious. Copy. Yeah, I feel like it's... I don't know if it's an attempt to add uh, environmental noise variety, but it not only did it not make a tremendous amount of sense, because it sounded like it sounded like it sounded like open water, like a waterfall. But yeah, it, it was it was just not good. <laughs> it's, it was a net loss overall. It was a net loss. Uh, it should be removed for sure or cut way down, but I don't understand. Was it trying to simulate the noise of water through pipes or something? You imagine it's probably better without headphones on, but would still suck either way. It, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, it sucks either way. I'm sure. Cause it was like, it, it was like loud and kind of dominated the dialogue. There was no escaping it either. But whatever, you know, I appreciate the, the free content that the modding community brought to us. So can't be, can't be too picky, but it is one of those things. If I were ever to give feedback, that would, uh, that would have made the cut. <clears throat> that would have made the cut of something. Just think of it as Travis listening to sleep sound effects in the basement. Oh, it's just his white noise so we can get some so we can get some Z's in. Okay. Chapter three was so buggy on first release, you couldn't even get past some quests. Oh, I see. All right, Travis. Okay, find and speak with the Ron. Well, chapter three took you a solid two to three months to patch into the list properly and a lot of back and forth with Kingith. We'll see how it goes. I'm, I'm interested to see, is it gonna feel like when chapter one ends, is it gonna feel like a resolution to an arc or is it gonna be like a seamless is it going to be like a seamless transition and I'm not going to necessarily know where chapter one, two, and three are? Also, I'll just figure it out as I go, so it doesn't really matter. I'm That's what I'm thinking right now. I'm curious about that. If it's going to be something that's really obvious, like, oh, that was the end of the movie. And now I wait for the second installment. Or, yeah, we'll see. You will know. You will not know when chapters end up again. Okay, okay, copy. We gotta work our way through town. This is super dangerous. This is super dangerous. <laughs> Corvus, the railroad has one upside. Ramen. Uh oh. What's that? Okay. Get him, guys. Oh god. You guys get them. I'm just gonna take uh, take his stuff real quick. The Ron. I'm on my way, dude. Hang tight. Q. 
Q Lincoln Park is when you'll find out when a chapter ends. Wait, I don't get it. Is there a is there a song, a Lincoln Park song that I that I that I don't remember? Oh, there used to be a message copy at the end of the chapter that was like the next okay will be released continue the story later got it got it okay yeah i wasn't sure if like they were like mini arcs that were then stitched together but okay so it's just one narrative never with the narrative intent to be partitioned or like to have mini arcs. It was just one big arc that took multiple releases to get out. <laughs> Heather absolutely rips them off the part of the minigun. She does good. Nick does really good too, dude. Oh, do I have a guy counter? Oh, it's in the shop. It's getting fixed up. It's in the shop. Oh, you can tell me when the chapters end if you like, but you really won't ever know otherwise. Oh no, I, I don't care. I was just curious. I was, I was just curious. It's just, I was just thinking out loud as, as I do. Got him. Nice. Uh oh. Where's he at? Oh, they're right there. Come on. Oh, there we go. Diamond City. Oh no. That was a Diamond City security turret. That didn't go through that. <sighs> well, they took care of that. Diamond City security turret. <sighs> okay. <sighs> I thought we were getting the jump on it, a raider, a raider encampment or something. It's okay. At least we know where we're going. Right here. Rip. The end chapter three is obvious at least. Okay, I would hope so. I would hope so. Come on, Nick, I need your help. Okay, friendly turret, got it. And a friendly dude there. Wait, where are you at, Ron? Oh, he's like, wait, wait. Oh, is he in Diamond City? Come on, bud. Where are you at? I've been looking for you. I have a feeling you're not back here, Ron. He is in Diamond City. Got it. It's like the long way around. Don't do terrorism on Diamond City. Hey. They, they need to work out being identified in this fog. Really easy to put out some friendly fire. That was, that was hardly my fault. That was hardly my fault. It might've been, honestly. <laughs> it might've been a little my fault, but uh, they just look so much alike. Those turrets. Oh man, my coffee is, whew, my coffee is empty here while this loads in. I'm gonna go fill this up. I made some pretty strong coffee. I'll be right back. You guys watch the dogs. Don't let them do anything crazy.
Let's sit. Did she? Did she do it? All right. Oh, a big crane lift going off there over at Starbase. Yeah. I'm watching it right now. There's a lot of cool action going on over there. Oh, we're getting ready for uh, uh, launch five. The plan is to catch the booster to land it back on the tower. It's going to be wild, dude. It's going to be wild. If it works or it doesn't work, it's going to be crazy. I imagine at least, I imagine there's a good chance that we, that we really destroy a chunk of the, uh, of the launch site. There's, there's a solid chance. It's going to be exciting. Oh, oh, smoke. Frezzy, now you have all the crafters and gatherers out in 100, full 100 gear. Dude, you're about to be done with the game. You're going to start getting into PvP or doing some extreme trials or something. Oh, could you could you go into bid and what you did at SpaceX? Uh, I was on, well, I started out in uh, 2015, right when, uh, right when the Orbicom 2 mission was happening. Uh, so that was my first mission with the company. Um, <clears throat> I was working on Falcon 9 on the fairing. That's the top of the rocket that encapsulates the payload. So when I started, I was a technician. So I, I got my degree in aerospace engineering, but I will just say due to me sucking, <laughs> not, not having the technical prowess or the smarts to immediately start as an engineer, I don't know. Uh, I joined the uh, the production team as a tech, and I did production on Falcon 9 uh, for about a year and a half, uh, working my way up to basically running the testing uh, at the end of the line for fairing, for the fairing part of the vehicle. Uh, I did pneumatic checkouts, uh, basically prop checkouts and uh, AVI checkouts. What we did is we would test after we integrated everything and built everything, uh, basically before you ship it. Uh, you verify all the systems and subsystems, right? So we'd hook it up to like a, we call it the core sim. It was like a, the Falcon 9 flight computer simulator. And we would just like run a system checkout. So that's what I did. And then, uh, then I switched over to engineering and, uh, I was a test administrator. So I basically ran that from the engineering side with the intent to kind of make the production teams autonomous from the engineering team so they could do it. Uh, without constant help and support from engineering, which is what was required before I stepped in. Basically, all that testing was done before me by engineers. So maybe it was helpful that I was an engineer coming as a tech, I don't know. But then my buddy, he basically handed it off to me because he was the integration test engineer when I joined as a tech. And so he kind of like <laughs> handed that off to me in a way. And then I kind of took over and then I then set up the team in a way trained the techs to run that on their own and did what I could to help automate the process so engineering didn't have to be involved. Then I switched over to Dragon. Um, demo Demo 2 is what I was working on, uh, Dragon V2. Um, that was the one, the demonstration launch that Bob and Doug were supposed to be on for the first crewed flights. Uh, but then our Demo 1 vehicle uh, blew up during a test because uh, there's an issue with uh, the Super Draco engines. But anyway, so I worked on that as a, as an integration test engineer. Again, doing 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 system checkouts. That's largely what I focused on. Um, and for that, I predominantly was uh, responsible for getting ground support equipment ready, uh, making the oh making the setup uh, work orders and. Uh, an instruction for the production teams uh, and integration technicians so that way they could walk through the multi-day setup of the vehicle so we could actually do the propulsion checkouts and avionics checkouts. Um, so it was all kind of ground support equipment related and vehicle testing related. Uh, and then I switched to Starlink and stepped away from doing engineering and I switched back to doing a technician role and joined production and basically just coasted for a few years, for four years before I dipped out. But yeah, I worked on the satellites, worked on Dragon, and worked on Falcon 9. That is, that is the short, the short of it. But it was great. It was, it was awesome. 
it was it's one of the one of the one of the things I'm most proud about. I I loved it. I loved it. Are we supposed to be in here? Kamu? Hello, Kamu. How's it going? Is this the Ron? Yes, it is. Oh, Dex is so cool watching the last launch. Yeah, it's fun, dude. Yeah, if you're ever curious, uh, whenever we launch. So the only thing I follow really now with SpaceX is Starlink related stuff um, and then Starship related stuff. It's tremendously exciting to me. Whenever they launch, I stream it. It's normally very early in the morning. Uh, but if you ever want to like talk SpaceX and I won't like I, I don't play a video game. I just I just live stream it and they last for a couple hours. And that's like that's like the best time to just rant about SpaceX and all sorts of stuff. That's it's fun. So if you ever want, you should stop by for that when it happens. The next launch is going to be next month. They're wild. They're they're crazy. The Starship launches are crazy. They're so cool. Okay. <sighs> to you. <laughs> okay, Ron. The smokes. They've got to get all the combat classes to 100. Okay. Dude, that's a big task, dude. Getting all the jobs up is a is big. <sighs> that's so cool. I admire you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Yeah, and if you do come to the live stream for Starship, you should, uh, if you want, you should ask me at the time, if I remember, you, I mean, if you remember, you should ask me to show you some, uh, some SpaceX stuff, because I got a ton of SpaceX memorabilia, mission patches, pieces of the rocket, the satellite, and all sorts of stuff. I never, I never really busted out, but I got, my drawers are filled over here with stuff. Oh, Doron. Yeah. Hello there. Did it just get cooler in here? He's like, who's that? Who's that character from Cartoon Network? Johnny hey. something? All right. Wait. Find and speak with I, the Ron. Johnny Bravo, the yes. Excuse me. Oh yeah. What's wrong with him? Oh yeah. Dude, I'm here for you. All right. Come on, What's Ron. The word? I don't know. What's the word with you? Hello. To you. Oh. Now what's up? Let's load back. <laughs> Hyped up on chems, maybe? Oh yeah, maybe he's too busy hanging out with Mama Murphy. Hey. Hey. Oh, oh, I know why. I know why. I know why. I know. I know why. I know why. Hold on. I kind of blew past this guy out here that's trying to talk to me out here. Maybe that's why. Maybe that's why. There was this gunner dude right outside the door. And then he like, when I, when I was walking up, it like forced me into the dialogue. And I just like walked away. Maybe I have to talk to him in order to get everything working. I'm a gunner business. Best you turn yourself around. Okay, Gunner. Excuse me. Hey, were, you, were you the one who's talking to hey, me? Hey, where do you think you're going? Now you better answer if you want to keep those teeth. You didn't do a very good job of keeping me out, dude. <laughs> That's none of your business. You don't seem to understand who we are. Will you just leave them alone? We're not meant to start trouble with the locals. Yeah? Well, how do we know this ain't the man we're looking for? He doesn't even match Who are you looking for? Now, come on. Let's get going. We got work to do. God, you son of a fool. You got lucky this time, Wastelander. I better not see your face again. All right. Kill. Kill or let live? We'll let live. We'll let live. We'll let live. Diet, don't say anything, okay? <laughs> I'll just wait for you to go kill. Ugh. <sighs> Died. If you get that PC, I'm expecting you to play some some pretty some pretty beefy games when you get it. You, that's a pretty nice rig. <clears throat> well there. Oh, that was it. Did it just get cooler in here? Interesting. Wait, no, that wasn't it. Oh my lord. F 
fine and speak with the Ron. <laughs> we kill them for you in our minds. He deserved a bullet. Thank you. You would like to play Nolvis? Oh my God. You could. You could. All right. Maybe we just steal his stuff. Hmm. Lively, are you there? Do you have any idea what's wrong with Johnny Bravo? <laughs> Do I sit in the chair and talk to him? Hi. Oh yeah, I like that look. The kind that oh. says, don't you... start trouble with me unless you're cruising for a bruising. I can tell you're you have to sit in the chair straight. The smart, sophisticated type who really understands the way of things. You have to sit in the chair. Got it. Well, that was a little he's supposed to tell you to sit. Please stop breaking things. It is broken when I got here. <laughs> it was broken when I got here. Copy. Well, good thing we were able to figure that one out. You played you played at least a dozen times. Hey, that's not a you need to play it a thousand times, okay? That's not a large enough sample size. But anyways, you're seeing it all live here, dude. <laughs> I did nothing except come in here. Interesting. Well, it's okay, we were able to figure it out, but a bit scuffed, but it's alright. Who the heck are you? Whoa, slow your roll. Are you telling me you don't know who I am? He probably am? did tell you right before you shot you him in the face. Nuh-uh, dude. I didn't. Talking to the coolest cat in the Commonwealth. I didn't Everyone shoot him calls me right away. And you can too. I need to ask you something. Ask away. Although I can't chat for too long, I'm expecting, say, Correct me if I'm wrong, but I get the feeling you were sent here by Jake. That's why I'm here. That's why I'm His here. His name's Travis, well, by right. the way, Ron. You're right, baby. And nine times out of ten, the Ron is usually right. Gotta say, I'm surprised to see Jake partner up with someone. I always struck me as the lone wolf kind of guy, you know? But any friend of Jake's is a friend of the Rons. The Rons. Right, let's get down to brass tacks. Dude, you know, I like this guy. I asked Jake back here was so I could share some information. But since you're his partner, I can tell you the info instead. For a price. After all, I'm running a business here. <sighs> oh, hold on. What info are you talking about? As Jake tells it, you and he are building did up they? settlements together. No, that's cool Did all. the actual voice actor come and read and lines for Sim Settlements 2 mod? After or did all, they do some the magic to like it hack it together and, and make it work? Best and brightest, right? I was just thinking about that. It's like someone had to read these lines. But I guess if enough lines were said, the player voice, yeah, the player voice. Or is there someone Someone who did a pretty good version of him. They reuse lines, sometimes splice, but not a, okay, okay, okay. That's yeah. It's done well. Yeah, I suppose so. Uh, or, but you can't always tell who's hip just by looking. Thought, or can thought, you? You ever heard of a vigor tester? It's a kind of science machine cooked up by pre-war nerds. It can measure a person's attributes. Use it to scan someone, Garlic. and it can tell if they're as strong Travis, as a okay? claw, or as weak as a kitten, smart as an AI, or as dumb as a mutant. Pretty rad! A useful device, especially for some cool cat wanting to find the cream of the crop. Just so happens, the Ron knows where to find the one of these testers. And I'm willing to tell <sighs> you where it is. Out with it. No need for interrogation techniques, Hot Rod. The Ron is more than willing to spill the beans. Third person. However, you know this guy's a good a time at the bar. For this Always talking about how the Ron was the caps. best quarterback Sounds in high good. school. We all we would have taken state too. I bet he talks about that all the time. Sure. 
There you go. Oh yeah. First things first, take this folder. That's all the info the Ron could dig up on the Vigor Tester. Robco. Got it, dude. Now, according to the Ron's records, last known location of the tester was Vault 81. But dig this. That vault's still active. Still has residents inside. Really? So, common courtesy says, you knock first. Vault dwellers? If you can get inside, ask someone in charge about the tester. If it's still there, chances are they'd know. Let's kill all On of them. On a side note, if you're looking for able settlers, I got a few leads you might They're not going to be able to handle us. Here, we got to get rid of them. Kill them all as usual. Kamu? That's right. That's right. How'd you know? Rick basically has to start writing. Has to start writing by saying, this is how the conversation starts. This is how it needs to end. Let's look through vanilla dialogue. Oh, okay. It's probably not. There's probably a lot of dialogue. And then you kind of just figure out what works for the most part. And then splice together when you have to. Like, there's probably a bit of improv there. Maybe not exactly what was looked for. Or what you're hoping for. But then things are like pretty close. I don't know. Seems like quite the project. <sighs> oh, and replace them with sins? Oh yeah. Vault dweller sins. We can do that. Throw the mini nuke you got in there. Oh yeah. Would open up. Knock knock. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I'm sure that'll come in handy. Yes, and you shall receive. Oh yeah. There's a lot of dialogue, yes, but also hard Since to not repeat Jake lines whenever busy, possible. Oh yeah. Pursuing the vigor test Make, yeah, that makes sense. If you don't know where Fault 81 is, it's near the old Chestnut Hillock Reservoir. Just look for all the water. You can't miss it. Thanks for your help. You are more than welcome. And remember. If you've got information to buy or information to sell, then you come see the coolest cat in the Commonwealth. The Ron! The Ron. Okay, dude. Heather? Get out of the way. You're such a big girl now. Okay, ask about the Robo Schematics at Vault. Oh, Vigor and Vim. Okay. Let's go. Vault 81 is is friend. Okay. Is it? What's up, gal? Oh shit, it's a different game. No. We we pulled it together. Ugh, we pulled it together. We got sim settlements underway. We're gonna try to cross the finish line on this, okay? <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna try to cross the finish line on this. Oh, but proud of you. Thanks. Appreciate that. Oh, if you see my dad, let him know. Okay. If you see my dad, you let him know that. All right. I appreciate that. We got Heather in some, in some armor now with a minigun. So that's good. And then we got, where's Nick Valentine? Look at Nick. Look at him, his true self. He's he's ready to rip and rock. If you could travel through time, would you go back and shoot whatever asshole decided nuking the whole world was a good idea? I would. I would shoot you, Heather. <laughs> Heather, I would shoot you. I'm sick of your attitude. Okay, let's get out of here. Where's uh, Vim and whatever? Oh, Corvus? You help the Institute if you let Vault 81 live. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We can work something out. We can work something out. How much are you going to help them? One hundo? All the way? Take over for Sean? Save the Commonwealth? I can let Vault 81 live. Oh, shit, the homies are stacked. They're, it's a lot better. It is a lot better. Like, we could... We could probably go back to Far Harbor now with them. And they could probably... And they could probably do the heavy lifting. Like, it would it'd be... It should be a lot more manageable, like, right now. So I'm... I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. 
because they were kind of they were like kind of useless before they just they just like went down so fast also did a lot like heather could do some damage with her with her alien blaster but like now with the minigun she melts but nick valentine with his plasma rifle he he is really good i really like it <laughs> enemies go flying it's crazy Oh, you'll provide the famous ramen? All right. Okay. Here, let, let's make it... Let's make it more visible. Okay. I keep thinking I see Cora get off the couch. If you guys see Cora get off the couch, if you see her, you let me know. She's not supposed to be off the couch. It's a rule. It's a rule. Okay. Commonwealth. Yes. Give me that clear sky. I save all the time. This is how I ended up with like 3,000 saves in Skyrim. Oh. The nukes were a blessing from Adam himself. You also dragged him into high level zones before you should have. So who's to blame? Oh wait, no, they were dragging me. Let's be real. They were dragging me. It was Nick's quest. It's, oh shoot! It's Nick's quest. He was dragging me, so I'd say Nick's to blame. Look at him now, though. Holy smokes, dude! I just like watching Nick work. I'm Look at this. Come on, Nick. Show the people. Yes, show the people what you got, dude. Ow. Heather, I just like watching them work Ow. now. <laughs> she just mows people with that. I'll stand behind her. Come on. She's, She's facing off that. She's facing off with that knight right there. Reload, Heather. God. She's incredible. I love seeing Nick now we fight. Again. I love... I love seeing Nick fight. Okay. Let the bodies hit the floor. Bottle cap. Laser rifle, copy. Oh, you don't get XP if you don't damage them. Oh, okay, copy. So poke him, hit him one time, hit him one time, and then let him do the work. Got it. Got it. I hit. I hit him one time. <laughs> we gotta save. We gotta conserve ammo. <laughs> oh, how'd you find Heather? Um, well, there's a radio station, but the radio station uh, didn't work. It, 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 like, never populated, so it, it was, it's bugged. Um, but we just went to her location where she was supposed to be and just found her on the side of the road. But, from my understanding, she's supposed, she's supposed to have a radio station. Like, there's a quest that pops up and it tells you to listen to a radio station, and I think that's how you find her. But we just had to go to where the quest marker... I think the quest markers point us there, or someone pointed me to it. I don't remember. The radio station is bugged, but should still add the quest marker. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, the, there, yeah, the radio station didn't appear. But we, we hunted her down. Let's move people. Let's move. You leveled up? I leveled up a while ago. Okay, we need... We need to start putting a little more... Oh, no. Okay, we can't do... And we can't do gun nut yet. No more chemist. Oh, here we go. Science. That's what I want. High-tech mods. Dude, we are so... There's so many more things to get. I am such... When I look at the perk tree, it really makes me realize how low level I am. Because there's so much to unlock here. There's so much. And I'm not even close... Yeah, there's so much. Yeah, I have Medic. Once I get 30, I'm gonna do it again. It was, it was really useful. It really made the stim pack better. Oh. 
Yeah, medic to craft impacts. Yeah, but it also makes them right. I'm pretty sure it makes them more uh, heal for more. Yeah, stim packs right away to 45%. That's nice. Buffness. Is that our strength? Buffness. You must work out. Gain armor equal to two times your base strength. Wait, so if your strength levels like six, you get 12 armor? I don't know. I'm not sure how that how that works. Yes, you press Alt to cycle perk ranks. They personally better. Interesting. <laughs> Daya, one thing I noticed, your idiot savant perk doesn't make your guy bust out laughing when it goes off. Yeah, it's it's actually different. Lively changed it. It's called beginner's luck. And I don't know, there's a there's probably things that are different about it. But I don't have Idiot Savant in here, per se. Unless it's somewhere else. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure it's been replaced with Beginner's Luck. I don't know how much different it is. But yeah, I'm not on Vanilla Perk Tree. It's funny when it goes off in mid-convo. I never got to experience that. So sad. <laughs> Getting XP doesn't play catch register sound every time. That would actually kind of be annoying, <laughs> Diet. Now that it, 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 it's like a ching. Can you disable that in your game? Oh wait, it's time. Dog tree time. Oh God. Dog tree time. Lively, do you know, do you know why the reverb, like I thought in settings, there's a reverb option and I, I figured it would turn down the actual reverb in the caves, but it doesn't. I like turned it off thinking it would turn it down, but I don't know what that does. I don't know what that, like it's so loud in here with Heather stomping around because the reverb. Makes all echoey. Oh my god. Give dogs a treat. Do pen push ups. Chair spin. Oh my lord. Okay. Dogs, let's give you treats first. Oh, the reverb slider is just for gunfire effects. Oh, interesting. Okay. Copy. Let's do the chair spin on the ground so we can go faster. We locked in. Okay. knees how did I, I don't know how I used to do it <sighs> well now we're sitting let's go back up oh my god party Fezzi. hydrate oh god okay raise it up at least <sighs> Gnarly? Oh 
my god, dude. She does not want to party? She never does that. God, she was like, no! Glad you're back. Oh, my oh, heck. Boy. Oh, smoke. Thanks for the sub, dude. <sighs> glad you're back, smoke. I'm glad you're back. Eight months? That's crazy, dude. That's crazy. Eight months is a long time. That's why we're getting old here. Yeah, she didn't... Yeah, that was weird. I don't know if it was the flashing lights or what, but she didn't want to be touched, which is really weird. That's really weird. Wait, push-ups? There's no push-ups. Nice try. Nice try, garlic. Nice try. Did they get treats? Yeah. You were doing push-ups? Yeah, I did push-ups. I did them right at the start. That's why I was like, are there more? Trying to, I see what you're doing there. Trying to double dip, dude. I got you. I see your shenanigans. I see your shenanigans. <laughs> you miss them, do them again. <laughs> okay. I'll, okay. I'll do them again. I'll do them again. Coming right up. They're they're on their way. They're on their way. Oh Holding man, right I feel bad for Aloy. I wonder security. what, why she got, got snarly. That was weird. Vault eighty one. There are people in here, so we're not running? killing these people. Yeah. Pretty good observation there, genius. Now about that pit boy. Oh, he's kind of mean. He's kind of mean. He might have to die. He might <laughs> oh, Kami, you missed everything. Restart from the beginning. Yeah, Dex, her ears did go back. Yeah. No, that was, that was interesting. It was interesting. Don't worry. I'll have to thoroughly... Investigate the situation later. Okay, God. All right. Oh, okay. There we go. Well, don't kill him right away. I'll give him a chance to talk. Okay. Got it. Feel the burn, <laughs> dude. The I'll never forget the thousand we did. Here in I'll never forget. <sighs> Push-up challenges. We may bring them back again for certain games. Now I'm really confused. You haven't been here before. What's the disease you have? I don't know. I've never looked. I've never looked. What's with the third degree? It's called protocol. And I don't want to get rid of it. Here. I want to keep it as it's clearly it's gotten us this far. It's gotten us this far. I th I think it's part of our power now. One of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. How do we earn it, overseer? Okay. All right, guys. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm All sure right. Calm everything for the hydrate. Cheers. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help They you. sell a really sweet rifle in here. Okay. Fusion cores. Three to be exact. Count your days. I'll be saving up more points. Okay. Okay. I'll believe it when I see it. Don't make me do too many. Be uh, be nice. <laughs> don't don't do too many. I already have the fusion cores you need. I've been punished really? enough. Well then, 
I suppose I should say welcome. He got mole rat disease by rubbing them on his face? Oh, I threw away the... I threw away the, the squirrel sticky note. Yeah, how do you how do you check your diseases? Hovering over it effects. Explosion effect. Oh, sin don't get diseases. Okay. Okay. Casual gamer have arrived. <laughs> Whoa, dude. Institute scum. Whoa. Interesting. All right. You arrive the perfect time. We're about to sterilize Vault 81. Oh, man. My guys have been working doubles for weeks now. We're about they to sterilize Vault 81. Everyone's working hard right now, Cal. You think I don't know that? These look Just like the raiders to me. Can. That's all I'm asking. Fine. I'll see what I can do. But you and I both know we can't keep going on like this. Sorry about that. As you'll soon see, we have a few maintenance projects underway. Gwen McNamara, Overseer. Welcome to Vault 81. Here, we pride ourselves on having maintained a successful vault over these past two centuries. We'd like to be completely self-sufficient. But there are certain resources we can't provide ourselves. Hmm. Why do you keep yourself so isolated? Why not? We have warm beds, clean clothes, a solid roof over our heads. With casual gamer, are you asking what I mean by sterilize free. them? We don't deal with the elements or raiders. We're safe here. And for some, that safety and stability is what counts. I <laughs> professor, your wife made that squirrel and you just threw it out. It's okay. She can draw another one. <laughs> she can draw another one. She's gotten better at drawing since then, so I'll make her draw a really good one. I'll make her draw a really good one. Or I'll get a stuffed animal squirrel and I'll put it right here. That's what I should do. We need more squirrels. Yeah, we could do that. Aren't you curious about the Commonwealth and what it has to offer? Of course. Conmu, you're really trying to, to butter me up with this water safe. today. We receive Cheers. We select traders often enough to stay well informed. That's why I like to use a give and take system. If no one for Fezzi by sterilizing means murder everyone in cold dead. blood. Speaking of, if you're ready, I can take those fusion cores from you. Close. Close. I wouldn't call it murder, though. Of course. Here they are. Thank you. Dr. Penske will greatly appreciate these. Wouldn't now, call it murder. I have work to do. Ma'am, what about his, uh, friend here? I'll allow it. Security is already extra mindful as it is. If he's lived this long in the Commonwealth, I'm sure he's chosen his friends wisely. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. Oh, your game's having a rainbow Maybe glitch as well as stretch text glitch and vice? Oh, dude, I know. I know nothing. I know nothing. Dude, okay, Heather, hold on. Heather's not coming with us, you guys. Heather's not coming with us. Come here, Heather. Hey. You're way too loud. Stay right no here. Don't move, okay? Nick, you come with me. Heather's way too loud. She's, she's gonna she's gonna stay at the entrance. Everyone gets no levels of welcome from the overseer herself. Almost like the war more never even happened in here. Is something the matter? You sound upset. What? No, I'm just tired. Do you usually ask such personal questions? <laughs> anyway, welcome yeah, to Vault 81. Maybe. I'm Deputy Overseer Mansfield. If you have any questions or problems, please bring them to me. Otherwise, enjoy your time in the vault. Can you Take a look at these schematics. Oh, goody. More junk from the Commonwealth for me to examine. Kill him? All right, hand it over. I'll look. <sighs> oh, I... We'll I do it on our way bus. out, maybe? It's the Vitamatic. The vault's previous position used... We gotta get some time. stuff here first. However, when Dr. Forsyth took over... Don't worry, we'll kill him then. Hazardous. There's something about combustible tumors or something There's such. something about him that bugs me. Is that why you're here? Maybe it's the, the inflections of, of his voice. If so, I'm afraid I'll have to disappoint you. Even if we no longer use the device, it's a rare piece of technology. I can't just hand it over to some unwashed outsider. Unwashed. Unwashed. Maybe we don't wait. Maybe we kill him now. What if I made it worth your while? 
Once you're done here, let Heather do her thing. Okay. We'll throw one grenade in to trigger it. And then we'll just let Heather get pulled in and take care of everyone as they funnel their way out. And she'll just stand there with the minigun. Then I suppose I could justify giving you the Vitamatic as payment. <sighs> yeah, don't worry. We're gonna kill this guy. We're gonna kill this guy. Yeah, sounds fair. The first task I'd ask of you is rather mundane, but vital to the vault's continued survival. You see, our vault's reactors are kept running almost exclusively by a single robot, Old Rusty. However, due to his poor maintenance, Rusty requires a lot of oil to stay operational. A lot of oil. If you could bring, say, ten units of oil to Old Rusty, that should ensure his continued operation, at least for a few months. <laughs> Any brothers or sisters of Steel Chat? They're all they're all Institute insiders, casual gamer. Everyone here, even those who deny it, okay? Even those that say they're with the railroad. Especially those that say with the Brotherhood. They're all with the Institute. Everyone here. Undercover agents. All of them. All of them. See? Well trained. Yes. Diets with Adam. Sure. I can do that. All undercover. Your next task would be a little more hands-on. Recently, the vault's been having some issues with its water supply. We've had to run the pumps at full power just to draw in enough water. And the water we do get is of questionable quality. I'd need you to check the intake pipe at the nearby reservoir. <sighs> this guy's is putting is us to work. Flow. And if it is, clear it. You may have to get a bit wet. If you manage to solve the issue, find and speak to Catelyn. She deals with the vault's plumbing. I'm on I'm it. I'm on it. Clean water coming up. Hmm. I'll believe it when I see it. If you do succeed, I'll have one more task for you. Finish that, and the Vitamatic will be yours. Off you go. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that, dude. Will we trigger everything if we kill him? Hold on. So we're, what are we supposed to do here? Help old Rusty. Do we really have to help them? Hey, Ashes. Come on, Heather. Light him up. Good. No one must have liked him. They didn't even f It's a demon. If you need a doctor, of course it's a demon, right dude. Hey, watch it. It's a demon. Oh my god. Ah, oh, hello again. Is there anything I can help you with? Oh my god. This place is haunted. Let's get out of here. Oh my gosh. Come on, Nick. Let's get out of here. When Walker started, but I don't follow the true path of justice that Commander Perfezzi guides. And that is the Institute. Yes, here, here. <sighs> One for all and all for the Institute. That's right. That's right. I think I know how you keep breaking quests. Whoa. <laughs> no. If they can die, they're allowed to die, okay? That's the rules of the Commonwealth. If they can die, then they should die. He can't die. He's one of, yeah, I know. So that's fine. So we didn't break anything. I only kill those that can be killed. Is that it? Can I go now? A kid. I know, come on. I'm literally trembling right now. I'm literally, I'm literally, tre I'm trembling right now. I'm reaching down into my pocket and getting my blaster out. I'm getting my blaster out. Go away, go kid. Away, kid. Go oh, away. Asshole. You! Oh God! Nick, stand your ground. Whatever you do, don't give up. Get out there, Nick, go on. Oh my Lord. 
He turned on me. You don't get treats. You don't get treats. I'm not treating Aloy today. I'm upset with her until I figure out why she snapped at me. I'm gonna have to replicate that off stream. <laughs> that was wild. Good for Nick. <sighs> Wasted points? Uh oh, is it There's not wasted points. You got. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. All this for a cat? We fed. We fed Cora. All of this for a cat? Heather, light him up. Light him up. You did good. Wait, you're 500 for... No, I just treated... Uh, I just treated Aloy. Uh, Core, I mean. Sorry. I got you. That's why we got two dogs. That's why we got two. <laughs> Someone's coming. Okay. How do we get in there? So some of them can die. Except him. Come on, Nick. Don't turn on me, all right? I'm gonna need your help down there. Oh. Nick? We don't need... We're gonna have to talk later once we get back. About the whole thing that happened earlier. The whole shooting thing. We're gonna have to sort out some of your allegiances. Okay, Nick. Wait, he turns on me because I'm doing evil things? Wait, he's the one shooting them. All I did? See, look at this. Right here. Look, something's going on. This is interesting. Send Nick away. Cancel. And then he turns on me. <laughs> interesting. Cora, you want to go out? Interesting. Wait, you killed innocents? Wait, this is a little messed up. And he hates me now? He killed the innocents. Hey, all I did was kill a cat. Alright, let's quit. Let's Ashes, quit killing him. All I did was all I did was shoot the little kitty. Damn it. Aaron's not going to like this. All I did was shoot the little kitty. He did trust me, he did all the killing. All I did was shoot a cat. He literally killed everyone. He should be, he should just kill himself. <laughs> he, should, he shouldn't turn on me. <laughs> he, if, if it makes him so upset, he should just go after himself there. Nick, I won't forget this, okay? <sighs> <sighs> Guys, we're going to sort this out. We're going to have to sort this out. I'll talk to my, I'll talk to Todd. Take the poor kids to her. All right, we'll, we'll listen to the kid for a sec. Hey, mister, are you really from the Commonwealth? Yeah, I am, bud. Yes, I am. I knew it. <sighs> hey, I can show you around the vault if you want. Just five caps. Sure, sure. Okay, give me the tour, Austin. Here's the caps. Yes, I gotta show you to Erin. She's gonna flip all of me. We'll start over here. Let's go, let's put the gun away. Oh, I can't put the gun away. Probably for the better. Oh no, there it is. All right, come on, dude. I'm ready for your tour. Okay, guess not. Hey, where are you going? Wait. The tour just started. Okay, I was following you. you. This kid's a little. Seeds. I need more seeds. I'm ready. Come on, Austin. Oh. She's looking pretty bad in there. 
Again, Smoke, I saw your message. It's because you're killing people. I didn't kill anyone. It was Nick. It's literally video recorded. All I did was kill a cat. You know? You need to check the water once again. No one told Nick. No one told Nick to kill everyone in here. He just did it. It's the kind of guy he is. What the hell is that thing doing here? That was your parents. The things you can touch, like your desk, the floor, your hands, they are all made up of matter. Things you can't touch, like lights, I started it. Heat, no, radiation, dude. I didn't. I just, I just. I wish my mom wasn't working so much. Okay, I thought we were going on a tour, dude. I thought Someday? you. I'm gonna check out the Commonwealth if my grand lets me. Dude, this kid's tours suck. I paid him for a tour and he literally just walked to class. Oh my god. I literally paid the dude. What a scam. What a scam. Okay, get out of here, kid. What a scammer. <sighs> oh hey, you must be the outsider. I'm Catelyn, the vault's plumber, or at least the closest thing anyone has to a plumber. I don't <sighs> suppose Mansfield sent you here. I've been bugging him for weeks. because I ran away. The water situation. <laughs> Who knows? The water. Recently, the water pressure from the vault's intake line dropped. That's Did I stop the tour? I was right there. Usually we just compensate by increasing power to the pumps. Do I have then to do the tour? Is this mandatory for sim problems. settlements? But this is the fifth time the pressure's dropped in the last few days. I don't know what keeps It feels like for the uh are busy. We do have the role play of it. That's how it played out. This little butthead up, kid scam me out of my money. It's not my You think about that. You give someone money for a tour, you step you step 10 feet away from them, maybe 15 feet, then all of a sudden, they're like, ah, tour's over. And then he was like, follow me, mister. And I was following him, and I followed him all the way to his classroom where he sat down. <sighs> sounds like, sounds like these guys in Bunker 81, they got it coming. Yes, I'm here to help. We don't need that kid's Good. tour. Time someone did something. The Wait, you guys are saying the tour is mandatory? The no. I don't know what to tell them. I, I trust lively. <laughs> oh. So, tell me about him. Mansfield? Mm -hmm. He's a decent enough sort, but he does rub some residents the wrong way. <laughs> I just noticed what she's doing with her tool. Work. But when we first opened the what box, is she fixing? To explore the wastes. I don't know. That seemed kind of brave to me. Although he was also the first to come back. I don't think he liked what he What is she there. working Since on? Then, it seems like he's always It's not how a wrench works. Plumbing 101. There. Some say he's out there for job. Oh, there's a much better tour from a girl at Bunker Hill. Okay. Copy. We'll see if she knows how to give a tour. I just don't think that kid knows how to give a tour. I've got to get going. Scammer. Okay, bye. Dude, I love... Okay, good. Catelyn, you're gonna get it, okay? You're gonna figure it out. I believe in you. Find out what's blocking the water intake. Help Catelyn. Help old Rusty. Okay. Okay, let's figure out what's blocking the water. Wait, it's impressive how she makes that noise. Yeah, sure. She's acting busy because she's scared of you, murderer. Disappoint the little ones. Oh my god. Yeah, she's just trembling in her boots, doing doing she's just doing random stuff. He's like, just make it through this conversation. Just make it through this conversation. Quick, quick, quick. But she is doing a good job. I agree. I swear. Forty years of marriage. How do you guys let me let me try to figure out how to fix this water for her? Dr. Forsythe is asking to see you when you have Okay, where's Dr. Forsy? All right. Let's go find the doctor. Doctor's not in here. Where did that boy get to? I'm heading out. Austin? Don't wait up for me. Austin wait a second. Angle. But I need your help here. Is this guy is this guy doing the same thing? 
No, there's probably bolts. There's probably bolts there. But I wouldn't give for some brand All right. New there's probably bolts there. Hello, sir. Oh no, wrong way. Got it. That actually may not be the wrong way. Let's go. Oh, this is where we came in. Got it. There's another lady hammering the floor up that corridor of all 80 wonders are confused folk. <laughs> Need to check the water pumps again. The water pumps. Which way to the water pumps? Let's go this way. Here's water, pipes. <laughs> Need more scenes, <laughs> that person. Okay. What is it? She was like turning a hammer on the ground. Where are the pumps at? Oh, the knowledge of how to use tools didn't survive the bombs. Copy. Look at this, this guy's welding. Welding, got it. Lost knowledge. Hey, what's up, Dave? How's it going, dude? Blow towards in a control panel. It's gonna work, okay? He's gonna he's gonna make it work. I have faith. I have faith. What I don't have faith is that I'm gonna find out where where I go to fix these these water pumps. I need to help one of those people. Just start taking a wrench. I didn't fix it. Who's in here? No one. The work never ends in Vault 81. <laughs> yeah, it's probably because you guys are wasting your time doing stuff. What are you even fixing right now, lady? Gosh. Somewhere. Oh, reactor? I don't think that's where the pumps are. Oh, here's the thing. Security overseer elevator atrium. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Hold on. We got stuff here. Old Rusty. Old Rusty really takes it out of you. You've no idea, Mr. Luca. Hey, will you both just get lost? You should quick save and kill everyone. We've already been through that like four times. Then you won't have the choice to leave because the overseer will make it for you. Old Rusty. How can I assist you? Warning. Open you for me. Blend in. Take the screwdriver and hammer. <laughs> Do a couple nails. I might as well just grab one of these cones and just start like hitting the wall with it. Is something wrong? I'm a bit on the blink, I'm afraid. On the blink. Okay. Sorry, I can't help right now. No problem, sir. Wait, I wanna hold on, I wanna help you. Hey, old Rusty. How can I assist you? Warning! Open you for maintenance. <laughs> of me. Interesting. Is something wrong? I'm a bit on the blink, I'm afraid. Is something wrong? I'm a bit on the blink, I'm afraid. Okay. Actually, I'll be back later. All right. Busy, busy, busy. <clears throat> Interesting. Okay. So, help Rusty. He's on the blink. So, this is going to be one of these quests where it doesn't, like, point me exactly where I need to go. We need to help Rusty. Rusty. And we need to help Caitlyn by fixing the water stuff. Rusty's on the blink. I got a pretty good track. Don't necessarily know what that means. This is beyond me. Can't hack that. Security's too good. Okay. We're not meant to be here. Those are those computers are too powerful. Hold on. Can I help you with this, Rusty? All right, where's the water pumps at? Oh, lucky. You're lucky, kid. 
atrium. I don't think there's water in the atrium. Would there be? Let's go this way. Let's go down. We're looking for... We're looking for something. Clinic. They're in a lake outside? Wait, what? <laughs> That's where the the water problem where you resolve it? You have to go outside to a lake? Yeah. The water intake pipe. They're filtering water from the lake outside. Oh my gosh. I never would figure that out. I never would figure that out, dude. I never would figure that out. We'd have been here cooking, Kanmu. Forever. Wait, did someone say that? Did someone tell me it was outside? Huh. So you're the reason the patrols are double today. Wait, I'm not the reason, lady. Calm down. Let me get out of here. Yes? Oh my god, dude. I had no idea. I had no idea. I don't even know how to get out of here. I'm going to be trapped. I'm going to be trapped in here. Here, I think we'll go this way. It's some way. Oh, there. Okay, there's the kid. He led me to his classroom. You know what? I honestly blame that kid's tour. Whatever you want. It really, it really threw me off. It really threw me off, okay? It was that gosh darn tour. Yes, it's Austin's fault. Yeah. <sighs> you would know if you took the tour. It was that little kid's fault. <laughs> hey, Steve Dawson. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> Appreciate that. <laughs> I tried to take his tour. That kid's a little, it was too inept, man. He just like gave up on it. Ugh, it was a scam. He's running a scam down here. Guys, I was there. I can go back and clip it for you if you need. I was there. I tried to take the tour. Good old Heather. Keep 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 watching guard here, okay? Selective reading is probably the truth. <sighs> Guys, he's old. <laughs> he's gonna take some time to read the chat. I am. I'm getting up there, guys. It's all downhill from here. Larn, Prezi, I'm back. You know what that means. I never knew you were gone. <laughs> In my mind, Larn, you're always here. You're always here. All right, let's check. Oh, look, there's a lake. There's a lake. Oh my God. Party Professi. Last time we did this, we almost got bit by a dog. Okay, we're gonna leave Aloy alone because we gotta sort out something with her. Oh my Lord. Aloy PDSD, yeah. It's okay, Aloy. something? Aloy's core is barking. Aloy's like, I'm on alert. <sighs> Don't freak out the dogs. Oh yeah, Aloy like wanted to bite me earlier. I tried picking her up. Which I do all the time. I always scoop her up. 
So I try to scoop her up while we're doing the party dance. And she like snarled and snapped. So I'm gonna have to figure that out later. I'm gonna have to figure that out later. Try to recreate it. Figure out what's going on. Oh, nice. Got the bug. <sighs> Quite possibly the flashing light. Yeah, it could have been. Not sure. Okay. We're here. Let's kill the bugs. <sighs> Someone's coming. There. Nice. It's not close to clear yet. Come on. Dude, I love Nick Valentine is awesome now. Find out what's blocking the intake. Unless you're hounding for a green sun can, I suggest we get a move on. Oh yeah, it's a freaking bench, dude. A bench. Lauren, you're epileptic, actually. Well, when we do part of your frezzy, you just take a deep breath and close your eyes. <laughs> Hold your breath. All right? <laughs> That's all you have to do. <sighs> all right, cool. We fixed it. Oh, man. If this were Dragon's Dogma 2, I would pick Austin up. That was one of the best things about Dragon's Dogma, is picking people up and throwing them. I would pick Austin up and I would throw him in the brine. I would run outside, I would take that little kid, kick it and scream it, I would throw him in the brine. Oh my gosh, that was one of the great strengths of that game. <sighs> A lot of fun. Oh, Epic, you just supposed to blink in time with the flashes? Oh wait, Kevin, what'd you say? That day many people started break dancing after watching that. Okay. <laughs> you did that to Sam so many times, yeah. It's okay. It was good times. It was all worth it. It was all worth the cause. He's both a murderer in IRL and Fallout. Whoa, first of all. That was Dragon's Dogma 2. And second of all, those people could all be brought back to life. You could bring them all back. So it's not really murder. It's more of like a cleansing. Literally, it's a good way to get rid of diseases. Dragon Blight, just throw them in the brine. It solved a lot of problems. All right, let's talk to our friend. Let's let her know. I wouldn't give for some real time. Let's go. Did you pet the dog as well? Or are they gonna bite you? They're not. They're not gonna bite. They're not gonna bite. Ailey just freaked out. I was trying to pick her up. She. She freaked out. She's fine though. Oh, yeah, Caitlin. You should have plenty of clean water now. Was that you who cleared the water <laughs> intake? I noticed the pressure's back to normal. I'm glad someone was able to do something. The water may still have a A pawn in case, brine saves nine. Run out of it. Here, take this. <sighs> I'm sure, man. It's a good way to live. It's a good way to live your life. I want to give you a personal thank you. Casual gamer, cleansing the US right now. Be right back. Nice try, dude. You try. You, tr you come here and try to throw me in the brine. I swear. It's you come. New every day. Seeds. Come on. Seeds. Come on. Come on over to Oregon, dude. I'm ready. You try to throw me in the brine. You try. Okay, now we just gotta. Okay. So now we gotta help old Rusty. Help old Rusty. Call me anymore. God dang. Oh. Is that your way, Con Move, asking me to to get rid of that person? 
Lauren, you got no more seeds? I mean, oh, no more seeds? God, I'm getting all mixed up. No more points? Don't worry, they come in time. They come in time. Cheers. Okay, now we're gonna have to figure this out. <sighs> we're gonna have to figure this out. Yes. Rusty. Help Rusty. Yes. Is this something I was supposed to have been secretly told about before? I'm going to the quest and I'm looking. Help old Rusty. Dex, you're off to bed? All right, dude. Have a good one. Sleep well. Thanks for hanging out. Enjoy your stay with Austin. Okay, I will. I will. We'll try to make it through here. I don't know how to help Rusty. He kind of wasn't very cooperative when I tried talking to him. But maybe now that the water's on, you, maybe that his problems fine. will present themselves and I can help. Yes? Not up, down. We open all the doors. We want to go into the reactor, which I already forgot where it was. There's a doctor's welcome, office. You think, you think they'll help Rusty? I hope I'm not being presumptuous, but I'd like to ask you a favor. Would you mind donating some medical samples, even just the blood sample? Okay, sure. Sure, you can have some blood. Excellent. Just have a seat and I'll draw some blood. I sus there. suspect evil doing. This will only take a sec. Give him his own blood. Okay. <laughs> there. Hardly hurt a bit, eh? God, Thank Nick you. looks Nick this looks badass. Now, I need to get these prepared immediately. Got it. Oh, right, let's go find the reactor room. We're looking. We're. What's in here, Doc? What are you hiding in here, huh? Is there anything unique on these scans? No. Reactor room. I saw it earlier. Now I forgot where it is. It may be up top. It said, it said, up, it said reactor over it. So we may, yeah. it may be up top to get to it. Let's go upstairs. So if you get by the rats, you get 10 max Looking HP. See Maria. She runs the Sunshine Diner in the atrium. Interesting. Like if you get bit by mole rats? Oh, here's the reactor. Here's the reactor. Here, let's see if we can help him now. Hey, old Rusty. How can I assist you? Warning. Overdue for maintenance. <laughs> of me. Is something wrong? I'm a bit on the blink, I'm afraid. Okay. Crazy old. We went through all the dialogue head. options. Huh. Oh. You can use hey, the cure on yourself, that's evil. Hey, I don't even know what, what that is. is. I don't even know Carla like, wants to spoil that. I don't even know what he's talking about. Casual, I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> hey, old Rusty. How can I assist you? Warning. I think Rusty's broken. It's later in the story. Well, then why are you telling me that? <laughs> hey, why are you yeah, telling me sorry. that then? You lost? No trading going on down here. I'm not lost. I'm trying to help out. Funny? It's not. You shouldn't spoil stuff. I mean, I don't even know what's going on, but if you're going out of your way to spoil stuff because you think it's funny. Mm -hmm. Where am I? Ugh. You deaf or something? Got it. Okay, we'll just... <laughs> 
sounds like you just want to troll and it, I didn't even know what was going on, but sounds like a recipe for disaster later. So I'm just going to time you off for a bit. Oh, well, Bobby wasn't watching. Why do you think he's broken? He may not. No, he may not be broken. I'm just kind of talking out loud. I'm just trying to I'm just poking my way through trying to figure out what's going on. He's not able to tell me the problem. Uh, I'm going to talk to these guys and try to sort it out. Where am I? Generator room. Can't you tell? Look, I I'm not even sure if you're allowed in here. Most of the trading's done in the atrium. I can tell you how to get back if you want. Oh, and hey, if you got any jet on you, I may be willing to take it Oh, God. Hands. Another drug so addict, dude. Five caps. Oh. Another drug addict. Mansfield told you he needs 10 units of oil? Dude, I don't... I don't remember that at all. <laughs> I don't remember that at all. Oh, shoot, dude. I'm forgetful. Sure. Here you go. Hell yeah. We'll help this guy out with his drug problem. Professor, he kills his chat now, too. 360 no scope. 360 no scope. Hey, outsider. Do me a favor. No. If you. I mean, it's a good. It's a good. Hey, remember what I said. It's good conduct, I think, to to not. Like it, if there's something you think is a spoiler and you're literally saying it because you think it's funny, I mean, I don't know. Hey, man, it's kind of lame, right? It's kind of lame. That's not a good precedent to set, I think. It's just gonna then. It's, it's kind of lame. Fortunately, any junk items with oil count. You don't have to bring 10 oil specifically. Interesting. If you don't want to talk. Anything. Hey, I gave you, Bobby, sir. I gave you the jet. Now do them all Murphy and enjoy it, okay? Enjoy it. 10 oil. We gotta grease them up. Oh, anything with oil. There's probably quite a lot around here. I wonder if we can just like throw some asbestos on him. Preserved cigarette pack. Coffee cup. The Commonwealth can take a real toll. This is uh oh maybe there's stuff in here where he's working. That's a sensible thing. Just the person I wanted to see. There was all around here. They would if there was all around here, they wouldn't need it. <sighs> Any chance you got a second now? Well then I only imagine there's no oil anywhere in here. You think I should go back and just grab some oil from a uh, sanctuary? Maybe they have an oil vending machine. That's milk. Hybridization. It's got to be a flaw in the hybridization. <sighs> Interesting. Maybe Austin took it. Maybe he's hiding it in the classroom. Maybe he's hiding in the classroom. Any chance you got a second now? Nick, what's up, dude? You all right, Nick? I wouldn't normally bother you with this sort of thing, but... So, any oil... Oh, like here, flip lighter. This has oil in it. Any junk items with oil counts. So, like, all this stuff... Oh my god, no, I was stealing! Stop. Just happened. Yeah, no. Well, Kanmu, they definitely have oil. They definitely have oil here. <sighs> Look at this. Nick Valentine, the traitor. <sighs> All I did was pick up a can of something with oil in it. 
Oh, these people are crazy. These people are crazy. Now I know you guys wanted me to kill everyone in Vault 81. It's getting out of hand. Dave, good thing you didn't come to once human one hour queue times. Rip, dude. Are you trying to get in right now? Okay, let's go to the surface. Hey, traumatized. What's up? You just missed a lot of the trauma. If you're looking to do some training, here, let's get out of here. Alexis is just about so in. we know we just need to go grab oil. We'll go back to sanctuary. You know, I mean, I'm assuming when, when I get this stuff with oil. Yeah, let's just like I have stuff with oil, but here, let's go back to sanctuary. And let's just grab things with oil and come back. Kamu, you heading to bed? All right. Thanks for hanging out, Kamu. Have a good one. Get some sleep. I get trapped in here too easily. Too easily. There we go. I always, I only remember my way out because I see where Austin is. I see where Austin's chilling and I go the opposite way. Okay. Interesting. Dude, I would get so lost on these quests. If you guys weren't telling me, I would get seriously lost on these quests. Heather? All right, Heather, we can finally take you out of here. Honestly, you might be ready for Far Harbor, okay? Follow me. Oh, Dave, you've seen worse queue times? You waited like almost three hours for New World once. Oh yeah, they can get bad. I mean, it's the game, the game had their official release yesterday. I'd imagine servers are pretty slammed. That's how it goes. I mean, that's what I would expect for anything. New MMO launch, new MMO launch. They always have notorious server queues. Kind of comes with the territory. A lot of games that are persistently online are always online. Well, we kind of screwed up. I I heard you joined a, I heard you guys joined a server with a bunch of uh, streamers on it. And it's like really crowded. Our server has co on it. If you okay, so a lot of people are trying to be on that server. That makes sense. Here, let's go back. To sanctuary. Yeah, let's go back to sanctuary and let's check and see if they have oil on it. Boom. Oh, hey, what's up, Professor? How's it going, dude? Hey, it's been a while. How's Fallout going? It's Fallout's going. It's going well. I get, I get decently uh, lost and confused out here. I think I'd be pretty. I pretty much wouldn't want know what to do right now. If, uh, if Lively didn't tell me or anyone else here. So I'm stumbling my way through these quests. Try we already saved the Commonwealth. We already rescued it from all the evildoers. But now we're just get, trying to get that extra credit. But yeah, how's it going, dude? What games have you been playing? Are you still, uh, are you still, are you still playing Destiny? The Final Shape? Or are you hopping to something else? Okay, here, let's check. Let's see. So I'm supposed to be looking for something with oil in it, huh? Anything? That's the problem that you have with Fallout? Okay, copy. Yeah, I get pretty lost. You still doing some stuff in Destiny? Dave, you've been lurking. Yesterday I was in chat, but I had you on TV, so you can't really chat. Oh, that don't matter. <laughs> don't matter. You can lurk all you want, Dave. We need to find... I just talked to, I just talked to myself. It works out. <laughs> Larn, you've been most useful? You have been. You have been. It's a cheap TV. 
you're tiny, but it works. Okay. Put me on, put me on a big TV. I want to be big. I want to be big professor. So we need to find something with oil. Is there any way? Oh, <clears throat> is there any way to like search for things with oil in it? Like junk, you know, store our junk. Can you search oil? No. Gold plated flip lighter. Oh wait that oh yes you can't oh my lord. <sighs> That's one. Okay, we're going to Far Harbor! Heather, it's finally time to flex that muscle of yours, okay? Nick Valentine, sir. That new armor, dude. Buy it from Heather? Oh, that's right. We'll see if she has enough for 10. What's up? Trade. Help yourself. Oh, no, not trade. Uh, barter. Hey. What's going on? Let's see what you have Let's to barter. Have. Let's do it. You make her parents proud with all the money we give her. Where? Oh, right. Having her wear that suit of armor. Let's see what she's got. She wears the power armor well. She's a little loud. She's a little clunky. I wish she could walk softer. Steel screws, rubber, plastic, leather. Oh, let me read what's in the stuff, maybe to break it down. Aluminum, bone, ceramic, cloth, concrete, glass, lead, leather, plastic, rubber. Rip. It's okay. We go to Far Harbor. We go to Far Harbor. Oh, Professor, you're sad you missed Subnautica? Oh, dude, it was fun. Subnautica was... That was fun. I just played that as just a filler game. We ended up... I mean, I ended up beating the game. <clears throat> but, man, I had, I had a lot of fun in that. I got one of the worst jump scares I ever got. <clears throat> While on stream, at least. I mean, it's probably one of the worst jump scares I've gotten in games. Yeah, when a reaper came, I went behind the ship, Aurora, and then a reaper came up and out and latched onto my ship. Dude, it really did startle me. Quite a lot. Quite a lot, dude. But it was really fun. Met a lot of good people there. It was a fun game. I did bought... Did you... Have you bought any, uh... Any new games in the, uh, Steam sale? Why doesn't that work? Larn, you just tried to redeem the jump scare and it didn't pop up, did it? Oh my god, Twitch is broken, you guys. I didn't see that pop up. Here, I'll play it right now. <clears throat> it's so interesting, because those, those alerts were working earlier. And they just stopped working. It's really weird. And it's, uh Oh, shoot, oh, shoot, oh, shoot. Oh my god, Heather, go! Heather, go, go, go. You got him, okay? Pull down the fort. Pull down the fort. Oh my god. This right here? There we go. It's only broken for you? It might be. I don't know. Maybe you owe maybe you owe Twitch. Maybe you owe Twitch some money. Maybe you owe Twitch some money, so they're, they like shadow bound you from redeeming those, who knows? Data, okay, here we go. Clear Quincy from, no, 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 find demon secrets. Here we go, here we go. Best left forgotten. That's what we're looking on. Looking at. Here we go. 
Okay. We're gonna see if we can do it now. Harbor Grand Hotel. I feel like we, I feel like, I feel like Heather and Nick have the power. I feel like they have the power. I hope they have the power. <sighs> Otherwise we'll have to go to some vendors and look for oil. I'm hoping we can just find oil off everyone's bodies while we're at it. Kill two birds with one stone. Uh oh. That may have been a bad spot to save. Let's get out of here. Oh, hey, Nick, Heather, get in there. Let's see. Let's see you put the new tools to the test, okay? Oh, my lord. Yep. Yep. Dude, Heather's in her element now. She just wrecked those guys. Okay, let's go. Let's push in. <clears throat> Here. Go. What's up? You got it. Let me send her in. I don't okay, she's she's making her way. <laughs> Heather, okay, just follow me. Wait, let's see what wait, let's see if she does. Oh shoot, oh shoot. <laughs> oh, so Heather, you're supposed to fight! Oh no, okay, I broke her. She's still trying to she's trying to follow the commands. Oh my god, she's down. Okay, we're not gonna do that. Okay. I thought that would be effective tactic. To command her to go in. The AI doesn't work that way. I understand that now. <laughs> she just she just does everything in her power to go to a spot. So what we gotta do is run in, lure the danger out to us. Someone's coming. Come on, Nick. Lay down some suppressive fire. Oh man, there's a lot. Okay, let's pull back a little. Let's get behind Heather. We'll try to try to snipe some people. I'll try to help out. Oh, nice. Go, Heather, go! Look at her walking into the mist. Oh my God. Come on, Heather, you can do this. I literally know where no one is. Oh my Lord. Oh my God, every, oh my Lord, everyone's down. Oh no, I'm going for Heather. Oh my gosh. Can I stim pack myself through the animation? Aid, we're gonna find out. No, no, okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, it almost worked. Seems like I need to rub a squirrel. <sighs> Hold on. Hey, okay, we gotta clear the we gotta clear the weather so we can see what's going on. True storms weather control, Commonwealth, clear. Humans one, muties done. Nice, keep that up, Heather. <laughs> I really need to get a pet squirrel. All right, I'll draw him out. We'll do it again. I'm gonna be the field medic. Oh shoot, I'll be the field medic. Dude, they do a lot of damage. Kill myself first. Medicine stim pack. Oh, I pushed in. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Nice. Okay. Oh, God. You don't scare me. Haha, <laughs> you are so weak. <laughs> nice, Heather. Okay, where are they at? Dude, you can't see him through all this smoke. That's crazy. Oh, 
Alright, I'm field medic. I'm gonna run in and revive as soon as something happens. Dude, Heather's just pushing in. Holy heck. I can't even see what's going on in there. As soon as I go in, I just get... Here, as soon as... Oh, my lord, Heather! She's so stoic. The game isn't over yet, beauty. Only one of us is walking away from this. Oh, he's down. Nice. Oh, right there. Good job, Heather. Keep it up, keep it up. I wish I could see where his head was. Somewhere. Heather's still up, good. Nick, you're still up. Oh my lord, they're doing it. They're doing it. Okay, we go. We push in. We push in. I change weapons. Shotgun. We have the power. We have the ability to beat Far Harbor. I would like to thank, I'd like to thank everyone involved. Special shout out to Heather. Okay. Getting hungry. Uh-oh. Completed, uncover the location. Locate the nuclear launch key. Okay. Oh, that's right. There's a lot of invisies in here. What's that? I hear something. Damn. Oh my lord, dude! They had my. Oh my gosh. No, no bite. Oh my god, you guys, keep it up! Oh my lord. Dude, that night can walk or whatever, it's like someone was right behind me. And Nick just blasted him. Okay. Let's try to pick up all the weapons. All right, find the launch key. Nope, I don't wanna go outside. Oh, dang it, messed up. Nope, no one's here, dude. Oh shoot. Okay. We're up. It's okay, Heather. We're going back. We're going back in. Don't worry about them. They'll take care of themselves. All right. We're oh my god. You hit like a rad rope. Oh my god. Oh my God, get us, they're coming in. Suffer, suffer and flee. Right, we got one more down there. You okay, Nick? Here, I'll get you up, okay, bud? Well, actually, if Heather kills this guy you before I die. die. Oh, shoot. You missed, stupid. Heather, take him down. I don't, have to use, I, don't have to use, I don't have to use a stim pack on Nick if you kill everyone in here. Come on, Nick. Get up. It's going to be fine, dude. That's a really bright light, Heather. Oh, over encumbered. All right. So we're going to go into inventory. Weapons. 
all we're gonna start dropping these there we go i want to keep that plasma rifle i should be good enough for your <laughs> suffer for your arrogance all right we move he's over this way And they really need to hire a... They really need to get like a drywall guy in here. Someone to fix this place up. All right. Keypad? Oh my God, please turn the bathroom in. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Secret bookshelf. All right, what do you got in here, my guy? Oh, I know what I should do. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I have that. I should mark stuff with oil in here. So that way we see it and we can pick it up as we go. Um, we have something in our inventory with oil. Um, right here. Inspect. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Um, component view. Oil. Tag. Oh, wait, now how do I untag the other stuff? I don't know. But oil is tagged. Oil? Okay, good. Oil? Okay, good. Oil! We're winning. Here we go. Listen to the safe room security tape. Play tape. Hey! Hands where I can see them. Now, where is the key? Franny, put the gun down. What exactly do you think you're going to accomplish? My job. You're going to give me that key, and I'm going to get paid. Hey, the, the world's over. Are you really? Ah! 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 Scream all you want, Arnie. Everyone's been evacuated. It's just you and me. Now focus. Where is the key? Rot in hell. Ah! We can do this all day, Arnie. Poor Arnie. Fine. The hell's it matter? It's on the boat. Fringe Cove Docks. Okay. Combinations 44, 6, 75, 12. Now, was that so hard? Map updated. Obtain the nuclear launch key. So <laughs> long, Captain. Now, where the hell's the release to this door? Sorry, Franny. Oh, my God. You're stuck with me. Oh, my God. Arnie. Oh, my God. Wait. Is this Was this was this Ar this was probably Arnie? Yep. Oh my gosh. Okay. Can we unlock this? Yes, we can. A little to the right? Oh yeah. That's it. That is it. Okay. Come on, Heather. All right, nope. We need oil. Oh, let's lock this in, by the way. Interesting. I'm wondering, for all of these, obtain the nuclear launch key. Oh, wait, no, 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 it was this. Um. Oh no. Oh, so you just do interesting. There were multiple things on the map. Do you just go down one path? Oh wait, best left forgotten. Oh no, no, no. there's multiple things here. Ema's memories are pointed are pointing me to secrets he hid across the island. I need to investigate these. 
as well as access memories. Okay, so I do, okay, I am probably gonna do all of these. I, I don't know. Maybe not, I don't know. Okay, cleansing the land. It makes it seem like, all right, I, I feel like we're gonna kill everyone with a, with a nuclear warhead. More oil? Oh my lord. I don't, I don't know if this, I feel like, I think that's a mod. The highlighting, it is so useful. Uh-oh. Downstairs. Let's get out of here. figure out what to do for dinner. Oh, Annabelle made uh, spam fried rice. So there's that. That's an option. She put that in the fridge and freezer before she left for Seattle. So I got that. It's super good. Oh, Lord, dog. Oh, God, reload. Oh, thank you, Nick. Oh, Lord. Okay, cool. Let's get out of here. Let's head to this. How far is it actually? It's just across the way. Oh, we can fast travel to some parts of these. Interesting, children of Adam Shrine and we can run south down the road. It's gonna be 2100. Is that nine o'clock? Okay. <sighs> Stick by me. Oh Stay man. Up. And that, my friends, is how it's done. Jen, what's up? How do you play without bopping to Diamond City Radio? <laughs> That's a fair question. I just have it turned off. That's that technically that's how. Technically that's how. I've been listening to uh I was been listening to the Fallout 76 playlist for the playthrough. The first day I played, uh we were listening to the radio. The first day. I would say it made people overall very happy. <laughs> You would think I would keep listening to it. But I like, I like this. They have a pretty good, they have a pretty good soundtrack. I made a, I made a playlist also for the Fallout 4 soundtrack, but I seem to be more partial to Fallout 76 music. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Let's see where we're at. Okay, we need to get on the road and go south. I'm like messing around here. Let's get on the road and go south. Oh no. Come on, Nick. Thank goodness. We just, today is the first day that I like threw armors and new weapons on Nick and Heather. Cause I like, I like hit a wall. From the difficulty, but now that we got Nick and Heather kitted out, it is a lot more doable. Let's make sure we're running down the right road. Yes, we are. The road's kind of turned into water. Okay, switch over to the energy weapon. Got anglers. Nick, use your plasma rifle, please. Let me lure him in. 
Take him out, take him out, Nick! Take him out, Nick! Oh my god, good, good job, dude. We're picking up a lot of radiation here. I'm, I'm betting. Uh-oh, legendary. Heather, get in there, girl. I'm betting I can, uh, I can manage Nuka World now. Maybe. Here we go. Yes. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. <gasps> okay. Well, I'm not 100% sure. Well, I think we got meleeed. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> It doesn't take a lot. We're pretty squishy. What's that? Stay close, Nick. <laughs> Thing are somewhere. Dex the flag? What's up, dude? Here we go, here we go. Oh no, that's a shotgun. All right. Heather, yes. Wait, no, 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 what is this? We're on fire again. Okay, 95. All right. Let's try not to get slapped into oblivion. I just got one shot meleeed by like one of these angler super mutants. I'm super on guard right now. I'm trying to make my way through the marshes. Orcs don't know it. Wait, orcs don't use it. Orcs don't know it. They go round and round for miles. Wait, there we go. Plutonium angler. Heather, stay close. Somewhere. Right there. Oh my gosh. Use a hand over here. Heather, I know. Oh, shoot. No, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh my gosh, Stim, please. Reload, angler meets. Need back up. I know, Heather. Where's Nick at? All right, we're right on top of it. Oh my gosh, we have to go under the water? Oh. <laughs> I think we have to go under the water. I didn't expect her to be so much good. Nuclear launch key. Got it. Take. Stim packs. Yes. Okay. Score. That's good. Go back to the nucleus. Use the launch key to destroy the nucleus. Okay, it seems like confront Dima about the nuclear launch key. It seems like you are picking a path with that quest. This is, I think, what, what folks were saying about the optionality 
on Far Harbor about the different things you can do. It just happened to be that I went to this place to get the launch key. A decision must be made. Yeah, I see this. I didn't actually, I didn't, I didn't actually actively <clears throat> choose this location and this path because it was a nuclear launch key. I just chose it because at the time it was like the most nearby. <laughs> I don't even remember what the other options were. Oh. You haven't made a choice yet. You can still get any ending. I mean, we got the nuclear. It's Fallout. A nuclear, a nuclear ending seems seems super fitting. <clears throat> Question is, this is a choice, huh? Confront Dima. Destroy the nucleus. I don't know if this is a either or, or a both. Can I destroy the nucle nucleus and then confront Dima? Here, let's see if there's any info in here. Optional. <clears throat> Speak to the High Confessor about the nuclear launch key. All right, confront Dima about the nuclear launch key. Use the nuclear launch key. Oh, you can choose who to nuke. Okay. Well, let's just go to the nucleus. Let's go to the nucleus. Children of Adam. Goodbye. I think they were here. <sighs> I think they were here. I'm curious what Demo would say about it. Oh, Heather. Yeah, I'm going. Yeah, I'm going to actually. <coughs> Confront him. <sighs> we'll give uh, maybe maybe he'll see his brother Nick in his new drip and he'll have. He has something to say. Uh Oh, we thought we thought we almost crashed there. Guys, stay close, okay? Stay close. <sighs> Let me go chat with your brother, bud. Welcome to Tarola. There's so much to see and do. The capital city is full so, of culinary Dima. delights Look. and brave warriors. Some come looking for the city of gold. Others are going to be there's so much going on right now. Oh my god, Heather! No, not you too! Do they think their exploded bits are Oh my gosh. Everyone in silence. Silence. Okay. But I had Chase shadow you. She saw you entering and leaving the nucleus. So, what was in my memory banks? Are we closer to resolving the conflict on this island peacefully? Uh, uh peacefully? <sighs> okay, right, let's talk about that. I have a memory of yours, Meta. Nuclear launch key. You knew how to detonate the sub in the nucleus all along. Give me a moment. I need to remember for myself. So, I chose to forget the launch key even existed. Oh, interesting. Poor Confessor Martin. Was I lying to him all that time? The submarine is rusted into the dry dock. 
The only target that missile is ever going to hit is the base itself. The nucleus. Where the children of Adam live. Yes. We have to keep that key out of the wrong hands. The nucleus has innocent people living there among the zealots threatening Far Harbor. Wrong hands, huh? I found the launch key already. I'll make sure it's never used. Should we lie to him? I don't think so. I'm going to use it. The key is the answer, Dima. Yes. The key is the answer, Dima. We must destroy the Careful nucleus. Your word. That key is the answer, Dima. Yes. We should destroy the nucleus. You're serious? Oh, yeah. How would that solve anything? Get rid of the children of Adam. All right, we got some options here. Wait, both? I can't believe both is an option. Wait, what's that? <laughs> Did it really say that? Did I not even read that? Are you all right? Acadia can't stay neutral any longer, Dima. You need Far Harbor to survive. Help them get rid of this cult. The Adam children believe in division deep down nuclear destruction is what they want they just need to be convinced <laughs> wait convinced that they want to die take your time katie you can't stay neutral any longer dima you need far harder to survive help them get rid of this cult katie you can't stay neutral any longer dima you need far harbor to survive help them get rid of this cult nuclear genocide is not acceptable no matter the circumstances, we have to find another way. Do we? My memories have to hold an answer where both sides can live. No. Have you found anything else? No. If both sides make it through, Dima, then you guys are just going to fight each other later on. We might as well just bite the bullet now. <laughs> mm. I should get going. Of course. Okay, interesting. Well, I'm just not going to tell you what I'm going to do, okay? I'll be back once I solve your problems. Bye, Dima! I will fix your little island, okay? <sighs> we'll do what we have to be... We'll do what has to be done. <sighs> it's part of the children of Adam's belief structure that they will ultimately become one. With the vision. A nuclear afterlife. Oh, interesting. Oh, division? Is that, like, in reference to splitting the atom? Good thing the key isn't in the wrong hands. I know, for real. Yes. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. Yeah. Di don't worry. I'm glad we... I'm glad the good guys got the key. We know exactly what to do. We know exactly what to do. I never liked these. The first time we met these guys, the children of Adam... A lot of problems. A lot of problems. Oh. Okay. Let's save. Let's walk in. Let's take some rat away. <laughs> We're at like half health. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of radi radiation in here too. Medicine. Rat away. <sighs> All right, let's get her done. Unfortunately, I didn't see all your Far Harbor exploits, so I don't want to say much. I'm not sure what I'll even covered. I honestly, <laughs> honestly, I don't even remember everything that I did. <laughs> oh, you're interested to see how, I'm, how we play this out? Well, it's going to be an explosive ending. It's going to be an explosive ending. I never sided with them before, and I've been playing through recently and said, why not? They're pretty crazy. Yeah, Children of Adam are kind of nuts, though, huh? It's all that radiation. Oh, oh please. Oh. Keep the faith. Keep the Oh man. Oh man.
Oh, we may need to throw on our Heather? We we may need to throw on our radiation suit. I don't know. Whoa, dude. I am the king. I am the captain now. Okay, let's go. Be respectful. You walk through. Hi, Confessor Perfezzi. It's got a good ring to it. <laughs> Excuse me, High Confessor. Glory to Adam, my child. Did you need something? I need a lot of things. The launch key for the sub nukes. I wanted to ask you about it. The launch key for the sub's nukes. I wanted to ask you about it. The key to division, yes. Reunion with Atom at the flick of a wrist. An object of true power. Lost to the ages, unfortunately. Oh, interesting, you what should say you that. To know? I love that we can just make them blow themselves up. Let's give them what they need. Let's help usher them to their destiny. I recovered the key. I think you should have it. You found the key? Yes, sir. Holy Atom, it is a miracle. Oh, wait! This family owes you a great debt. Wait, 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 I misunderstood. Wait, not lose hold on a second. Race. I may have misunderstood. You cannot rest until Far Harbor is wiped from the map. Wait, 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 I wanted but to wipe you, you from the map. You have done well today. Wait, no, 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 confessor. I'm confused, hold on, let me look at my quest real quick. Hold on, yeah, I misunderstood. Yeah, we're loading back, okay? We're not gonna live in this reality. We're not gonna live, we're not gonna... He's gonna nuke Far Harbor, no, 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 no. We're not gonna live in this reality. We're gonna load right back, okay? <laughs> I was thinking if I gave it to him, he would nuke himself. <laughs> oh, gosh. Use a launch key to destroy the nucleus. Okay, so it is... Oh, wait. What are these right... Hold on, I'm gonna check something out. What are these right here? Hold on. Oh, and now it's taking me back. Interesting. Markers are being a bit interesting. Okay, we go through the door. <sighs> he tricked me. Tricky confessor. Oh, I just noticed this was a, this was a submarine. I just noticed that. I know that you can hear me. I knew there's yeah. I'm uh, it would make me think we'd go in here and we would uh, launch the missile from here. It all makes it's all making sense. Be respectful. So we don't talk to the confessor. We go to the launch terminal. Yep. If there's an Adam Adam oh God, Adam, escape. Okay. We're still helping them fulfill their destiny, okay? Oh Lord. We don't have time, Heather. We don't have time. We don't have time. We gotta get out. This place is gonna blow. Come on, Bethesda. We don't have time for this loading screen right now. There's a nuclear missile about to take off. God. Gosh darn it, Todd. Load the screen, Todd. Let's go. We gotta go. Someone's coming. We gotta go. Heather, come on. 
Come on. Come on, Nick. Where's Heather? <gasps> oh, shoot. Oh, my God. Heather. Heather, come on. Oh, my gosh. Oh, okay. All right. We did it. We did it. Peace and prosperity has been restored. Far Harbor can finally rest. All right, Heather. This is one of the least peaceful options. Whoa, it's, it's pretty peaceful. Oh, wait, what was that? Find out Dima's secrets. Do I, uh... So we're, we're not done. That's not, that's not the ending of the Far Harbor quest line. I'm assuming we need to go back and talk to Dima and... I have no idea. We'll see. Uh-oh. Where's this guy at? Uh-oh, we got some big boys. God, I love that plasma rifle he's got. Oh my gosh. Hold your ground, Nick. I'm gonna lure something to you. Stay there. Oh my God. Nick, watch your six. Oh my Lord, I'm so sorry. That was kind of my fault. Oh my lord. I don't think the children of Adam like you anymore. Why do you say that, Heather? Come on, give him a chance. <laughs> All right, we are going to. Looks like uh, some nuclear fallout or something. It's very green. And I think we have about how half the oil we need to help old Rusty out. About halfway home on that. Vim Pop Factory. Oh, we can just fast travel there. What is find out Dima's secret? The way life should be. We went in here before, I believe. Here, let's just go straight to it. Right here. Uh oh. Oh, shoot! Alright, we definitely were here. I believe you tried to go here and died a lot and left. <laughs> sounds, that sounds right. That sounds right. <clears throat> it's okay. We got the new and improved Nick Valentine and Heather. Oh, shoot. It's a nightkin. You're fine now. Oh, God. Oh, and God. That's another win for Team Human. <sighs> okay. Oh, oh no, 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 stim pack.
Mr. Valentine, I would love it if you would push forward for me, okay? Just don't get popped. I don't know if they know how to get up here. Oh, they'll find a way. Oh, then I just went to a hotel and died a lot and then started seeing others too. That, sound, that sounds like it's correct. Oh, steel and spring. We need oil. Let's reload. Did Heather take him out? God, they're so good. All right. Let's get inside. Give Heather her moment to shine. Minigun time. All right, Heather. Get her. Get in there. Let's rock. Get in there, girl. Oh, Lord. Where's Nick? Oh, my gosh. He's such a good tank. Yeah, Nick. Oh my god, he's so badass, no, dude! No, I... God! Damn. Oh my lord. Come on. Who are you shooting over there? What the flip? Okay, Nick, you're still good? Oh my god, they're so good, dude. This place is fun. <laughs> it's fun. It's fun with Heather and Nick. I would be getting absolutely trounced right now. All right, we need someone to go. There we go. Huh? Yes. Play? We what? Laser sniping rifle. I think it's the first time I've seen a energy sniping rifle. First time I noticed. Okay. Upstairs, got it. I see it, I see it. It's such a world of difference having kitted them out. All right. <sighs> Stay close, comrades. Nick, you're here? Got it. Let's go, Mr. Valentine. We got one, two, three, four. They're up top? Oh, no. oh, they're in here. Oh, shoot. Don't worry, Nick. You and me, okay? I'm looking for more invisies. All right, Heather. Oh, shoot. Oh, here we go. You should consider yourself stopped. Oh my God, I missed all this. <gasps> okay. Okay. Wrecked. All part of the plan. All part of the, all part of the plan. We're just feeling them out, you know what I mean? That, that 
We're just peeling him out. I wanted to give him that one, you know? All part of the plan. God, that was wild. Where's this? There's this invisible. Oh my gosh. Just show up, dude. Where are you at? It's on. Let's lure him up. Oh, right there. Watch out, Nick. Okay, good. Okay, they're down here. Oh God! <laughs> Jeez, like stupid lady. Hey. You should consider yourself. Be nice to Heather, okay? Oh no no no! I hear bomb. Where's he at? I hear him. Heather just bugged out. I hear him. Oh God, I save right now. <laughs> oh my Lord. Oh, he's right around the corner. Oh no, we have to reload. Somewhere. Run! Heather, watch out! Oh my god. Good job, Heather. Holy heck. Okay. Must have been nothing. We push in. Oil? Yes. There's oil in there. What's this? Vim. Interesting. Oil. All right, we pr we probably have enough oil now. Oh no. Oh, that's just Heather. When I hear the stomping around, I think it's a super mutant. Something oh. there. Find Dima's secret. Mm. Well, Heather, are you with me? Here we go. Oh man. Where's that silly synth man hiding? Oh no! Oh my gosh. Not today, we're gonna survive. Oh, what is he hiding? I read that where. Yeah, what is his secret? Okay. Oh man, get him, Nick. Oh my God, dude. Oh shoot. Heather, hold your ground. Ow. Hold your ground. You're mine now. You got this. God dang it, dude. Nick, get up, dude. I'll stim you. If, if the option would appear. Okay, I can't, but just know deep down in my heart I wanted to. Oh, you're up? You're good. All right. 
Uh oh. Taking shots here. Go swimming. I'm gonna walk right into a trap. Oh, we got something right there. Security door control open. Many twists and turns. Where's my crew at? Get in here, guys. I'll see you. See you there. This is a really cramped elevator. Ground floor. What's this? Unmarked grave. What's done is done. Avery's locket. Avery's skull. Confront Deem about Avery. Hold on. What's done is done. Is it... is it going to be painful? Yes. It's going to be like having everything you are ripped out and replaced with something else. Someone else. I'm ready. I just... I wish I could say goodbye to everyone. No one Sound else can light. know. This isn't just about infiltrating... If you need assistance, please approach the intercom. That synths drawn here need to meet. Reasonable. Willing to accept them as just another living thing. No greater or lesser than humanity itself. You'll be part of the bridge between our two worlds. That all vanishes the moment anyone discovers that it's been manufactured. That you're a synth. Did she have to die? The, the woman I'm replacing? God. She looks so peaceful lying there. Don't. Please. That blood is on my hands, not yours. So we kill him. You can take the synth out of the Institute, but you cannot take the Institute out of the synth. We, okay, first of all, the Institute are the good guys, Heather. We talked about this, okay? Dima is a bad example, all right? He is not representative of, of Institute ideals, okay? I want that to be known. Let's get out of here. Let's go kill him. There can be no other way. He's misrepresenting. He's misrepresenting our entire operation. There can be no other way. If there is a greater good, he better spill the beans on it immediately when I get to him. That's gonna be his choice. We'll let him, uh, he can sell us his side of things once we, uh, once we roll up on him. Oh, that's a wall. <laughs> if, we, if we can get out of here, he's gonna be in for sure. Oh shoot, oh no, there's bad guys everywhere. There's an exit, let's get out of here. Let's go. 
All part of the plan. <laughs> that was the emergency exit. It was quicker. Just interesting how you perceive, perceive these things. No judgment or anything. Oh, I mean, I, I wouldn't. I, I, I don't imagine you're over there judging lively. Don't worry. It's a video game. I'm, uh, I'm making choices that I wouldn't make in real life. This is where we get to be crazy. <laughs> We've got we, we are we are role playing. We are role playing. Oh my god! Get off me, dog! Oh my lord! Nope, doggy, no! I'm just getting. Hold on. Oh my gosh, dude! That's in stim pack. Okay, let's go. Oh no. Oh no, it's not what we want. It's not what we want. Okay. Oh, maybe judgment's the wrong word. I'm not trying to steer in any particular direction. Copy. Copy that. Wind Walker, under the Profezi's rule, there can only be optimal ideals. That's my new general. <laughs> I just really like seeing how different people go through these things and how they view the chosen. Okay. How they view uh, the cho the choices made. Wait, it wants us to go back inside? No, no, no. We can fast travel out of here. Not with enemies nearby. Okay, hold on. We got people to kill. So one could say Dima is trying to unite synths and humanity. Someone else would say murdering someone is too high a cost. You know what? I mean, oh. I mean, I think I would agree with Dima. <laughs> Actually, if I'm not getting swept up in the moment, that's why I said we're, we're gonna give him a chance to explain it to us where he's coming from. You want my Because I, cause I probably, Sean and I probably agree with a lot with, with some of the stuff he's doing we're gonna give him a chance to convince us <laughs> Larn, don't worry i'm judging you ready to die die i agree with all the choices you made 12 out of 10 playthrough Yeah, my initial reaction was we're killing him. Yeah. Yeah, that's the emotion. That's the emotion, you know, taking over. But we'll have to give lot, you know, our rational, logical side a chance to prevail. We'll see. We'll see what he has to say. If if he has anything to say at all. We'll give him a chance. We'll hear him out. Maybe I'll maybe we'll let Nick maybe we'll let Nick kill him. Brother Little brother on brother violence. Never hurt anyone. <sighs> Look at Cain and Abel. They did fine. <laughs> uh, it, it all worked out. Alright, we may have to put the refugees down. I don't know if anyone's going to be able to feed them if Dima's dead. So... We'll see how that goes. You just really love when good writing actually makes you think about what's right or wrong. Oh yeah, there's a lot of gray in like a lot of situations. There's a lot of gray. It definitely makes it more interesting when it's when it's not a clear cut black and white good versus evil. It definitely does. I could agree with that. I could agree with that for sure. <laughs> That's where a lot of good shows do a lot of good stuff. A lot of good stories and narratives, books, a lot of TV shows. You know, like sometimes, you sometimes the bad guys end up uh, having quite a bit of humanity. It creates creates that gray zone where you kind of question their motives. So, Dima, you have a question. Okay, Heather. Why do you even call me Nick? 
Heather, I need you to stop walking around. Hey. Stay right there. And after the personality experiments started. And walk her little brother on brother violence. You called yourself was like I said, only off the lights. Valentine. <laughs> yeah. If there's another name you prefer, I'd be happy to. No? Oh, I, I like the name. When you wear something for a long time, it kind of seeps into you, you know? Of course. I like their dialogue. I saw the atomic blast from here. Felt it shake the island. Yeah, it was crazy, what dude. Done? What do you mean? For all of their faults, the children of Adam did not deserve nuclear annihilation. It's what they wanted. I brought them the division. The prophecy has been fulfilled. Okay. They were crazy. Someone had to stop them before they kill more people. You got a lecture me, Dima. I made a decision while you were cowering. <laughs> yes. They're with Adam now. Yes. Take no. Let's tell it to him. Let's be brutally honest, okay? You don't get to lecture me, Dima. Yeah. I made a decision while you were cowering on top of this mountain. Don't That's turn right. this on me. I haven't destroyed an entire people. Whoa. Did gaslighting much? Does mean so little to you? See how he just turned that around? This guy. And what's done is done. Was there anything else? Oh yeah, there's something else, dude. There's something else. Classic Dima, yeah. Yeah. Tell me about the grave. Your memories led me to a gravesite. All right, Mr. High and Mighty Dima. You killed Captain Avery and replaced her with a synth. You got some explaining to do. So you could control Far Harbor. What? That's impossible. Let me see what you found. Oh, I'll show you. Remember I, the pain you caused. I did it. Yes. I killed a woman from Far Harbor and replaced her. I stripped a synth's identity from her and made her an agent. Yes, you did. It was as cruel to the synth as it was to that human girl. Let's, let's ask him a few questions about it first. Why did you do it? I needed to calm Far Harbor. A moderate voice. An example of what humanity should be. How we could exist together as equals. But I couldn't live with the memories of the blood on my hands. A human and a synth are both gone because of me. Should we just be, should we just like try to make this feel as bad as possible? No, 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 let's ask him a question. Let's ask him a question. Let's be practical. How do we proceed from here? Okay. Let's be practical. How do we proceed from here? You're right. We have to focus on what has to be done now. Yes. Is that what you call justice? Because I sure don't. I'm starting to see things more clearly we have to keep this secret from far harbor if they knew i had done this they wouldn't destroy just me they'd come after acadia and then without us the fog condensers will eventually fall into disrepair everyone will die So you did all that on your own. No one else involved? Let's keep so asking. you did all of that on your own? No one else in Acadia is involved? What I've done <laughs> goes against all of our ideals. I even hid it from myself. So, no, there can't be anyone else. Like I said, I'm not steering you in any way. I generally want to see what you do on your own. Yeah, I'm just talking out loud. I, <laughs> that's normally how this goes. You get my sick and twisted thoughts in real time. But I'm to keep kind of in and out and I it's led to much this, confusion. This hey, don't worry. To take in. I'm confused a lot sometimes too. 
Interesting. We got to make a choice here. Make your case to people far harbor. Dima, let them decide. Let him be a... Uh, let him go out there and Take your time. get executed. This is not a moment <gasps> for hasty decisions. I want to see the public trial. But people never think clearly with that mob mentality. I know this this is a lot. To we take in. what's you know what? It's tough. What's done is done. Keep the peace. I kind of want the parents to know. That's what I wish. I wish I could know where it was going to lead. Because I want to tell them. Take your time. I want to tell them everything this about Dima. And I think the only way. Hasty decisions. Yeah, that's all right, Dima. Keep talking, buddy. You're not going to weasel your way out of this one. Make your case to the people of Far Harbor, Dima. Let them decide. And if their judgment is to destroy Acadia, the synths I've gathered here are innocent. I'm responsible for them. And that blood here. will be on your hand, Dima. You really think Far Harbor will destroy them if they find out? You really think Far Harbor will destroy Acadia if they find out? They were willing to kill the children of Atom for far less. Yeah, but I already took care of that, so... <laughs> oh. Said you wanted human and synth kind to of be equal. Well, now you have to prove it. Tell them the truth. Trust that they'll do the right thing. I can side with that. You said you I can side with that. Kind to be Greeting streamer. Greeting chatter. Now What's up, dude? Prove it. Tell them the How's truth. How's it going? Trust that they'll do the right thing. We no. have to trust. I can't risk oh, throwing okay. away no trust. I've built here. The lives that depend on me. What happened has to stay buried. I guess we can't. <sighs> Far Harbor has a right to the truth. You have to do what you feel is right. Okay. But think about Oh, the Valentine loved that. Carefully okay. You act. All right. Tell Far Harbor about Avery's murder. Oh. We're going to keep the peace. I'm going to hey, keep the Dima, peace, okay? What have you done? By attacking the children of Adam. Okay, no, now he's going to lecture me again? Nope, never mind, taking it back. Okay, that guy needs to learn. That guy needs to learn when to stop talking because I I was about to tell him that I'm going to keep a secret. And then as soon as I turn around, he starts on with that line again. Judging me for taking care of the children of Adam. So now we're going to go tell the people of Far Harbor. I'm glad he made that easy. I'm glad he made that easy for us at the end. Really struggled with this decision. Hey, I was going to... I decided right there at the end, I was going to turn around we don't have and talk to him. Right? I decided I was going to turn around and talk to him and I was going to keep it a secret. But then the moment he started judging me again, I was like, okay, never mind. We're going to, we're going to let the people of Far Harbor know what you did. And I hope, you know what? I hope they come and get you. Oh, oh you recently got Fallout 4 on your PC. You fall in love with the game, but I don't have that much play time. I have like five hours of gameplay on the save file. I wanted to check out some fall streams around you. Oh, well, welcome. Welcome in. If you're playing on PC, are, are you playing modded or are you playing vanilla? I'm using uh, I'm using the Magnum Opus mod list. <clears throat> That's a pretty good one. Uh, I don't know if you're familiar with Wabajack or that. But uh, did you get all the DLC? That's on sale right now. It's a pretty good time grabbing the uh, Game of the Year edition. But this is kind of my first time. I mean, I played, so I played this game at launch. Let's make sure we're going the right way. <laughs> yeah. 
Follow the Road, <clears throat> I played this game at launch in 2015, and then I didn't play it since. So th this whole playthrough kind of felt like, uh, this whole playthrough kind of felt like a, a first playthrough. I mean, there's quite a bit I remembered as, as we came across it for the base game, but everything for the last like week has been, has been new. <clears throat> Oh yeah, you've uh, you just got a taste of Fallout 3. Oh Fallout, oh a Fallout like three days ago. So I'm really uneducated. All right, you, I mean you'll be fine. Uh, all I have, all I have to say, my guiding words. <clears throat> okay. No, no, I won't say anything. I'm afraid. I don't want to spoil anything. Just follow your heart, okay? Just follow your heart. Let it guide you. Let it guide you. <laughs> oh, she, and it's a good one. The game's fun. The playthrough's been fun, regardless of my frustrations. But, you know, my frustrations are also due to my own inability to remember or pay attention as well. It's as much of my fault as anything else. <clears throat> Working our way. Let it bleed out in the bushes? Let's go. <clears throat> oh, did you, uh, uh, Will, Will Vuck? <laughs> did you, uh, did you watch the show? The Fallout TV series? Man, I... I thought that was very good. <clears throat> I thought that was very good. Oh, you've only just, just left it off where you're trying to search for your wife's killer and I found a synth base. <clears throat> it's, oh, really behind, so no spoilers would be nice. Yeah, I won't, I won't, I mean, if, if you're watching, there's going to be, just don't pay much attention to what's going on the screen, you know, let it, let it kind of glaze over you, but <clears throat> there's going to be, obviously there's like going to be active spoilers going on right now. <clears throat> oh, Lively, you like, the Fallout show is amazing. Yeah, I thought it was really good. <clears throat> I mean, it's, <clears throat> it's right up to my throat. It's right up there now with like one of the, one of the greatest video game adaptations uh, to TV that I've seen, you know what I mean? Like there's a handful that are up there and it's, w I think things are getting better and better with video game adaptations. So what's that? It, yeah, I, I loved it. It felt very authentically, uh, fallout with everything. They even got the radio, the diamond city radio. It's like that music and that feel, uh, it, it all went really well. <clears throat> cyberpunk. Yep. Cyberpunk. Yes. Cyberpunk was great. There was quite a few. Dude, I watched it all, but I stopped for some reason. I stopped and I was missing one episode. Dude, go finish it. Just finish it. Just go finish it. It's worth it. It'll be fun to see what they do for the next season. Oh shoot, is Far Harbor under attack? Oh my god, there's... Take him out. <sighs> Something out. Oh, the show... The show made you want to get a taste of Fallout, so I got Fallout 4, so it was a massive 9% discount. Yeah, it was a great... It was a... It was a great thing to do to promote the game. It was the same thing with Cyberpunk. When when the Edge Runner came out, that was largely like the game had sorted itself out and they had they had kind of fixed it. And it was a mass brought a massive resurgence to Cyberpunk. I recently played Cyberpunk and man, that the DLC, man, dude, I cried. It was it was really good. It was really good. I hope these trappers aren't good guys. 
With $10, I ended up buying four games, including Fallout 4. Dude, what a deal. What a deal. Well, Smoke, you've watched the series four times now? <laughs> I could rewatch it. I could totally rewatch it. Yeah, it is amazing. It is. <clears throat> it is. All right. Will? Will Vuck? Uh, tune out. Wait, what's that? Yo, that's Nick. Man, compared to what I've seen of him, detect don't even, don't worry about don't worry about this. We just got him in armor. <laughs> don't you worry about him. No, you pay attention. I was just gonna say, I think there's gonna be some. Uh, I'm 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 about to like finish the DLC. I'm just saying this to protect you. I think I don't know. I think this is major resolution of the DLC. Um, I would tune out for a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna talk to these people. Just don't really pay attention. All right, there we go. Of the hour. Spoiler. Wiped out all the children of Adam. <laughs> these caps are for you. And if you need any. Oh, she Cyberpunk was a great tabletop. Personally, was a little disappointed at the game. Oh man, I loved the game, dude. I loved it. I thought it was incredible. I never played the tabletop, so no reference there. But standalone game with no comparison to anything else. I mean, I think it just drew from the lore, right? The world building and lore of the long for this world. I'll do what it of the tabletop. To my island. But man, the DLC, the game, man, I thought it was, I thought it was great, but that's all right. That's why we have so many games. For a shipment, F different flavors Alan, for everyone. Alan, I got no taste for bloodshed. Alan, okay. I won't shy away from him either. Alan's got a sale going on. If you put down roots, the children of Adam Alan, blow out. <laughs> imagine I'd be all right with that. Okay. He doesn't really want to talk, I guess. I thought he did. Nice to see you again. Avery. Everything's relatively quiet for once. Okay, Avery. Need something? Okay. Let's ask her. What's the penalty for murder? What's the penalty for murder in Far Harbor? We're too independent to really have laws. But if a murder can be proven, tradition is the culprit's executed. Extreme, but it keeps the peace. Okay, well, let's just tell her. Wait, what's... What's your opinion of Dima? Let's see how she feels first. What's your opinion of Dima? We don't see him that often. <clears throat> he seems pious, I guess. He rubs a lot of people the wrong way around here. So I'm glad he keeps to the observatory. Why? Hmm. I have proof. Okay. That Dima killed the original Captain Avery. Here. I... But that's... Yeah. My lock? It, it was lost in a fire. The skull. It, it can't be. Yeah. Listen, I, I'm me. I remember everything. Yeah. I can't be a, a synth. You're yeah. Wrong. Listen to this. These holotapes prove it. <sighs> listen. I won't listen. It's lies. You're making it up. She's about to destroy herself from the inside out. <sighs> Dima replaced you. We're gonna fry her, dude. He, he wouldn't. He's. Oh, God. It's true, isn't it? I'm a synth. We can't have the world living in a lie. What it's like to learn everything you know, everything you believe is a lie. Oh. My whole world's been turned upside down. I understand. My whole world's been turned upside down, too. Friends, family, I understand. At least you know you're you. Your tragedies are yours, mine. The only thing I can do now is live the way I believe is right. Dima is a murderer and a liar, and he should pay. Well, but if you she's about to take out a lot of rage anyone, and anger. Especially Alan Lee. Many innocent people will suffer. Our harbors on the edge. And this will just push everyone okay. right over it. Confront Dima. If you can make him pay, do so. But please, keep that evidence a secret. <sighs> I already talked to Dima about it. Oh. <sighs> 
Aren't you saying that just to protect yourself? I've dedicated my life to trying to keep this rust bucket of an island mm. in one piece. And I'll be damned if this changes anything. Yes, I want to keep it secret, of course. But if you share that, there will be blood. Oh, okay. I can't make any promises. Far Harbor's barely holding itself together. If you're careless with that. Interesting. Well, I tried to talk to Avery, but he wasn't one to really talk. Guns, ammo, and souvenirs. <sighs> Oh, Will, you love the enemies in Fall 4? You were searching for the synth base with Nick and dog meat and a random mutated bear mean. came and killed you three times? You'll die a lot. I died a, I've died a lot. Don't let the island catch you up. Oh, Oshi, true, it's great on its own. Oh, you like the tabletop better? Your D and D nerd from old times, dude. I have the five E core set, but I've never properly. I played one time. Uh, <clears throat> I went to, uh, I went to like a, a one shot session with uh, at the start of a campaign. I don't know what if it's called one shot. I don't forget what it's called, but it was it was really fun. But I don't have the I don't, I don't have the proper social group to actually play it. But I would Every love day, to play it. My wife would also love to play it. Yeah, we have we have like the five E uh, core set with like the the monster manual, the player's hi, uh, guidebook or handbook, and then the the bait shop, uh, the DM guidebook or whatever. I would love to get into it. It just it's really it was really fun when I played that one time. It was really really fun. It was a little it was a little it was a little weird at first because it's like hard to kind of like kind of settle in to the mindset to play it but but man as soon as we did it was a blast it we had so Our much fun dude all your medical information. we we had so much fun so many silly things happened it, it was it was really fun it was really fun oh as a reference to my username i decided to name myself william in my save file oh is that what you go by then william you're not gonna give me attention to whoever Graham over here is because I don't want to get spoiled. Yeah, that's why I was giving you a warning. I was like, don't don't pay attention to any guns, of this stuff. Just kind of, you know. Hey, Alan. Uh, not many people on this island get it. I think you do. Oh, right, he doesn't want to talk. Food. <clears throat> Stim packs. That's very interesting. Oh, nice. You got all the tools then. You just need a group. Yeah, I just need a group. I do need a group. I don't have any... Dude, there's don't a the there's a game store, but it's it, it's like just cards. So, like, they do, like, Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, Magic the Gathering and stuff. <clears throat> I want to find, like, a proper board game store that does uh, around here. Where people are doing more than that. Because <clears throat> I, I really yeah. like board games. Like, modern board games. They're like video games, dude. It's like... I have this game called Gloomhaven. And the sequel game Frosthaven. Dude, it is so good. It's so good. It's kind of like... It's kind of like if Dungeons & Dragons and a bio, an old Bioware game, like, had a baby. <laughs> and it was a board game. There's a lot of narrative choice, and you make Great these decisions, and it like focuses on the ta tactical turn-based co-op dungeon crawling. It's really good. The uh, the, the narrative on. is really cool, and I've never beaten it. It takes like it would take like six now. months of dedicated weekend play with a group to probably get through it. It's kind of like a and D campaign. It's very interesting. It's very cool. It's called Ooh. Gloomhaven, Stim but now there's a sequel Fully called Frosthaven. Stopped. It's ma it's a massive board game. It's very cool. Oh, your name is not William. It's just uh <clears throat> It's just a random name I use in everything and decide to name myself hand William hand as hand reference. Hand. Okay. What do you go by for like when I look at your name, I just in my mind I just see Will. But it, the way you spelt it it's Will. You need it. <laughs> Uck. Big shop's got it. Alan, the children of Adam are dead and done for. I can't tell this if this is again. 
broken, but it's like pointing me to him and I would love to talk to him. But <clears throat> we're not going to. Oh, Will is definitely what I like to go by. Okay. When it comes to streamers, read my name. Okay, okay. All right, that's what sticks out to me. All right, I guess we're going to go to Dima. I like... I figured he's the guy I'm supposed to tell. I want to tell. I want to tell Far Harbor and let them, you need. let them do whatever they feel like doing. And just let them be the masters of their own destiny here. Get them while they're in stock. I just can't tell... I feel like I'm interacting with them wrong. <sighs> well, sometimes the game doesn't want you to do what you want to do. You know what I mean? <sighs> oh, is the entire Pit Boy and Health Bar being blue original? Or am I uncultured? Oh no, you you can well I have mods installed that kind of governed uh some of those colors you can you can change it from green you can change the ui color from green and the pit boy colors and the the pit boy flashlight like if you hold tab down it'll bring up your flashlight and if you hold tab down it'll turn it off <clears throat> by default that should be green for you but you can i like it green okay <laughs> but if you want so if you want to change the ui color Go into uh, settings, display, <clears throat> and there's these right here HUD, HUD color, and Pip Boy color. You, you can mess with these to change the color of these HUD elements, and then also the Pip Boy color. You can do it right here if you feel like it. Oh, the vanilla flashlight is an Omni Glow. I like the direction one better. I like this. This is, this is good. I take it. <clears throat> oh. Alan. I wish you could know. <clears throat> In my heart, I told him. What do you think of the Katie Dima? Well, uh, living in a scientific observatory wouldn't exactly be such a waste. Well, how are the puppies doing? Oh, they're doing good. Cora's out in the kitchen area. Aloy's just chilling. Aloy's chilling. <clears throat> Careful with your We still need to discuss what you did in Far Harbor. I can't undo what's done. <clears throat> but for the sake of my people and those in Far Harbor, we need to bury that evidence. Please. Okay. I'll keep your secret. <sighs> I'll keep your secret, Dima. Thank you. Maybe the guilt will keep me focused. <clears throat> I promise you. As long as Far Harbor stands, I will make sure that Arcadia does everything to make up for my crimes. The island will be a better place with both our people working together. All right, Arcadia's shield. All right, good luck, dude. Oh, we're over encumbered? Okay, let's unencumber ourselves. All right, Heather, you're right there. Come here, I need you. I need you. Oh, Will, you spent a lot of time in your gameplay not knowing you could fast travel. You know and when you doing. walked all the way back to Sanctuary, I would just turn on your radio and go on a journey. Dude, that's the way. I did that for the first, like, what was it? The first two days of stream. <laughs> if you don't fast travel, you will discover so much and you should, ju you should just lean into it. I mean, eventually I start fast traveling, do whatever you want, right? But that was so much fun for me. It's like, cause you'll get distracted on everything. It, it'll just pull you one way to another. It's very fun. That happened a lot to me in Skyrim as well. It's really fun. Gotta say it's so much more fun that way. Yeah, it, it, it is fun. It is fun. Hey. It can be a challenge hey. to stay focused even. Here. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Hey. 
Trigger control. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. You hold this. Okay. Didn't mean to shoot her. Okay. Hey. That's good. Let's go. How are we feeling quest wise? Talk to Kasumi. Let's go. Maybe all those test tubes plugged into you will keep you focused. Oh, wait. Wait a second. Oh, yeah, hold on. I was thinking we are going back to the parents' house. You saw under bridge a guy being threatened by a synth? Wait, I haven't even seen that. That's cool. <clears throat> yeah. There's a lot. There's a lot of random stuff out there. Don't be afraid, okay? Don't be afraid. Will, if you ever feel like it, don't be afraid just to shoot someone because they're irritating, okay? All right. Don't be afraid just to pull the trigger, okay? I don't want you to feel restricted, okay? If anyone ever gives you too much attitude and you think that they're overstepping, you just, you just point that gun right at them, okay? Yes. Oh, where is she? Heather is so loud. Whenever I tell her, I literally have a screw loose. You know, it's actually pretty she nice Oh, she's below. Complain about this with someone who understands. Where's the stairs? There has to be stairs. Here we go. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot. Will, there's a lot. There's a lot of stuff that can happen. There's a lot. I mean, I've been playing for at least six hours a day on stream now for nine hours, but I've been, I've been trying to focus on doing the main story, then the, <clears throat> and then now the DLC and stuff, and then some other major quest line. But uh, there's so much to get distracted on, so many side adventures, factions and stuff, and. It, it's great. There's so much going on. There's so much going on. It's a great experience. Will, have, have you ever played Skyrim, Will? I'm wondering, since you're new to Fallout, if you're also new to, like, other Bethesda games. Oh. <clears throat> Oh, you want to make different save files and go through different routes? Oh yeah, you can you can do that. There's there's many different endings and choices. There's a lot of different routes to go. Yeah, I would just I would have fun on your one playthrough, and then if you and then you you, you don't need to focus on doing everything or 100 percenting. You could totally start another playthrough and make different choices. See what happens. A lot will happen. Oh, you haven't played Skyrim, but I'm really interested in getting it. Well, Skyrim has a lot, a lot of this like organic discovery and like tons of options. Skyrim does this as well, like Fallout. <clears throat> it's just a different setting and a lot of, you know, it's just different, but with swords and magic and bows and arrows and stuff. It, Skyrim is my, like one of my favorite, favorite games ever. It, it's awesome. It's awesome. But yeah, if you're, Playing mod, like, I think this for Fallout 4, I, I, I really think it's for Skyrim. Playing modded, if you're on PC, getting a mod list. I played Nolvis, but there's a tremendous amount of mod lists out there. So you kind of can choose the kind of one you want. But they will add so much, so much good stuff to the game. There's a lot of incredible quests in Skyrim, a lot of incredible content. Tempest greater than Novus? No comment. <laughs> Lively, you're a little biased, okay? <laughs> uh, you shot dog meat. 
It's okay. I I would I think I did too. It's all right. It's all right. Kasumi. That explosion. <laughs> it was you, wasn't it? You used something in Dima's memories to destroy the children of Adam. You're not actually upset that they're gone, are you? You're not actually upset that they're gone. <sighs> it's not that, it's just all those people. They were crazy, but did they have to die? <sighs> I guess it doesn't matter now. Hey, listen. So when you first showed up, you came to get me mm -hmm. to bring me home. Yeah. I've been thinking a lot about that. Okay. I hurt Kenji and Ray by leaving, didn't I? I could have just stayed home, pretended everything was all right, but I left them. Should I go back? They obviously still care about me, or who they think I am. They need a daughter. Yes. They deserve to have one. Wait. Everything in Acadia has been settled. I found my answers. Maybe it's time I did something for someone else. Yes. This, this is good. Yes. Wait, what? Can I convince her? She's real? <laughs> Wait, let's just not. Hello? I'm confused. I don't even know. Let's just let her make her choice. You're right. Just. <laughs> You're right, Kasumi. I need you. Yeah. Go home. Yes. I will. That seems it's fine. I'll start gathering my supplies and. That all seems fine. I'll have to say goodbye to everyone. <sighs> Thanks. For Kowski, you shot him a thousand times and you saw Maybe him? Oh, man. Poor dog meat. He, poor dog meat. <laughs> oh, gosh. <sighs> he makes the saddest whimpers when you shoot him too many times when he's hurt. Gosh, Preston. Poor Preston. Everyone's trying to everyone trying to kill this guy. Oh, <clears throat> we're trapped in here. Here we go. Here's the way out. Alright, I'm excited. Fezzy therapy? You should never abandon your family. I don't think I'm qualified. <clears throat> I don't think I'm qualified to have <clears throat> to give professional therapy advice. You, I don't know. I don't know if it, if you'd end up better coming to a Perfezzi therapy session. Okay. The detective's <clears throat> life isn't an easy one, but it rarely lacks for excitement. <sighs> oh, your Will, your cousin played Fallout before you, and seeing Preston, I just told him to shoot him. I just told him to shoot him. See what happens. And that's that's a possibility. That's that's a valid choice. What do you need a tip with? <clears throat> I don't know if I can give you a tip because I don't I don't know if I know enough, but there's people here that know a lot more than me. Casca, you mean but he's just in the way? Well, I don't take him with me. But that's because I haven't, because he's been he's been kind of weird and buggy. He just attracts enemies when you want to be stealthy and shields enemies <laughs> for more bullets than he does damage. It's fair. That's fair. Okay. Let's go see if we can chat with the people. Yeah. Here we go. Talk to Mr. Nakano. <clears throat> is that here or is it... We have to... Isn't that kind of in Commonwealth? Back at his house? I think you travel here. Should be at the house in the north. Ah, uh, first stay at home dog. He's just fine though. Yeah. He's he's chilling in the sanctuary. We've never taken him anywhere. I tried the first day, and I just kind of struggled. He would just disappear, and I'd call him, and he'd randomly show up sometimes. Mom. Oh oh oh. I'm home. Kasumi. Oh my god, my baby is okay. 
welcome back home. Come on, give her a hug. What are you guys, heartless? Good to be home. You, you saved my daughter. Thank you. I'll copy that, Oshi. Oh, your tip. Um, Will, you saw power armor and just took all of the armor with me and have been taking it with me just in case there's another power armor without any armor. I don't know why, but I want to know if that's worth it. Hello? <laughs> I would I would take the uh I mean I I don't know. I took the power armor when I found it and I gave it to my companion to carry it. But then I just took it back. I just delivered the power armor back to my home and sanctuary and just left it there. I just I Are I just left it in sanctuary. <sighs> And then if I ever needed it, you could get it. Um, and it'll show up on your map as a marker. So you always know where it is. Um, and then if ever you find pieces of power armor, you should pay attention to what they are because certain pieces are better oh. than others, like the T-45 and the 50s and the 60s. And the there's multiple variations. Um, and they have different stats. So as you find pieces, you can swap them out to make your power armor better. So you want to do that. But yeah, I, I've never used the power armor the whole playthrough. I don't I don't want to use it. I just gave it to my companion. And it's super powerful. Stick them in power armor. That's what I did. So you just have full armor piece of T45 power armor? Yeah, that's, that's where it starts. Are you all going to be okay now? Yes. You have X01 made plus jetpack. If any of you ever need help again, oh, I got a jetpack. Kasumi, does this mean you know where your parents? Kasumi's parents are heartless. You're not a saint. I know. Well, I gotta. I'm sorry. I was just. So I got a jetpack. I wanted to go. And then I couldn't couldn't somewhere. figure out how to use it, so I just stashed it. It's okay, Kasumi. Your whole oh diet. Now that they're all together, mini nuke them. Do you folks need a minute? Do you folks need a minute? No. We'll, 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 to we'll try to not. We shouldn't keep you. <sighs> Listen to Kasumi next time, Kenji. Don't just try to keep her safe. Talk to her. Listen to Kasumi next time, Kenji. Don't just try to keep her safe. Talk to her. I know. I mean, unless she's being crazy, then you lock her up and keep her safe. So but I almost lost her. Yeah. First you, first you just chat with her. Otherwise, you might just drive her away too soon. Nick, you stand outside. Mr. Nakano. I need to speak to you. Okay. There's one last thing you and I need to discuss. Your reward for bringing my daughter home. Oh. Me. We don't have much to offer. I'll take and the my house. My father traveled the continent. He had quite a collection before he died. I'll take the house. I buried it all near the house. I'm not the explorer he was. I don't need them. I think they would be better with you. Okay. Thank you. I don't think we're getting the house. Thank you, Kenji. You Maybe I just kill them all and take it. You travel <laughs> far and back to get me answers. Thank you again. Maybe just kill them all and we'll take the house. Family. We won't forget that. Let's see. see you around, Kenji. They shouldn't Goodbye. be necessary. Best of luck to you. Now, right? We should be able in the future. Oh yeah. Okay. Here, let's uh let's let it all sink in for a second. Yep, Nick, get Thank ready. You. Get ready, Thank Nick. You. These synth lovers have to die. This is how it should be. Okay, they're still essential. <laughs> Just checking. In the party of the bang. I tried. I really did try. Oh, Will, you saw you saw a dead guy in a on Common Boston. I don't know if that's uh, what it's called, but the corpse had a torn letter from his wife saying she misses him and not to go to common Boston. I mourned his death and then shot his brain out and stole his... You stole his tattoos? Oh, his tatoes! <laughs> his tatoes, his potatoes. Oh my gosh. Will, don't listen to Lively. Go into Boston Common. Follow your heart. Okay? Follow your heart. Follow your heart. 
follow your heart. I don't know what it means. You already went. That's right. That a boy. I knew you could do it. I knew you could do it. Okay, so you just started a glass cannon run in Fallout 4 based on Frankie from One Piece. Wait, who's Frankie? <clears throat> we have some, uh, uh, Larn is, uh, is all caught up on One Piece. Probably knows who Frankie is. I've mostly just watched the first chapter, first season of the anime, and I watched the show, the live action, which I actually was a really, I thought was a really great, was a really great, uh, anime adaptation. It was really fun. Chat with Heather about Dima. Oh, really? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, something? Hold on. He told me something about a reward somewhere and I totally missed it. Did he give me a map or something? Inventory, miscellaneous. Notes? Artillery announcement, Heather's tour, items needed. There's a Kenji, markers. Huh. I totally missed that. Oh wait, maybe, it, here, let's go talk to Heather. Oh, it's in the shed, okay. Oh, that quest. Oh, I thought that quest marker was for Heather. <laughs> That's the quest marker. No, I don't even know where the quest is. <laughs> oh, should be miscellaneous. Oh, interesting. Dig up the stash of supplies. Got it. Interesting choice. Put that in miscellaneous. I just thought at the end, maybe they would. Okay. Dig it up. Oh, Frankie is the cyborg shipwright. Interesting. I don't even remember. Ooh. <clears throat> oh, we got a new sniper. Hey. I'm Get out of the way, Nick. I'm trying to loot. Okay. Let me have this moment. Plasma rifle. Okay. Well, let's check it. Oops. Let's check this thing out real quick. Inventory, weapons, rifles. So we have the hunter rifle. Okay, it's not this. SV98. Improved vast slow factor. 20% less action point reduction cost. Okay. Fire rates. Same ammo type. Less range. I'm not really going to use it in vast. All right. What's, uh, I'm not going to use that, but that's all right. They tried to give us an up. Oh, daily goat video. Oshi. Okay. <sighs> Here. I got a video of them drinking water. <laughs> They're very thirsty. They were out of water all night. So I poured a bucket and, uh, they just swarmed. <laughs> they swarmed. They're like, oh yeah, that's nice water. That's nice water. Oh, wait, we gotta go talk to... Wait, but Heather... Chat with Heather about Dima. Wait, let's just bring Heather to us. Here we go. Hey. 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 I just restocked if you need some tea. <sighs> Oh my god, goats. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Goat call. Yeah, I got 12. 12 Kikos here. We're going to get a lot more. <clears throat> I'm pretty excited. We got one sire. Uh, 
You like llamas? <laughs> hey, llamas, you can get, uh, llamas can be, uh, <clears throat> they can be, uh, guardian. Guardians to the goat herd. Can we chat? I'd like that. <sighs> okay, let's talk. What's on your mind? You know those components we find on the synths we're killing? <laughs> I'm gonna make a trophy out of some of them and hang it in the bunker. Okay. <clears throat> What's on your mind? Remember when we saw the Pridwin fly into the Commonwealth that first time? <sighs> it was such an impressive sight. And on top of killing Kellogg. Watch it again. Let's I'll watch the goats drink water. Oh, thanks for the hydrate. Cheers, Will. Okay, interesting. Your thoughts? When we were uh -huh. Taylor would give each of us one of those little Okay, come on, hold on. That's all. Wait, how am I how are you Okay, Heather. Hey. What's up? I'm all ears. You drink some water as well? <laughs> okay. <laughs> when we cheers? Okay. That's good. That's good. Oh, Maybe we ask her about something. I wanted to ask you about something else. Shoot. Hmm. Okay. Good. You can go now. You'll catch up later? Oh, whoops. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Well, that's okay. She doesn't need to... She doesn't need to... Oh, shoot. Will, thanks for the follow, dude. I appreciate that. Welcome. Welcome in. Welcome in. Okay, I think we have enough oil now. I think we have enough oil. That's funny. We went we went and completed Far Harbor only because we needed to get oil. <sighs> only because we needed to get oil. So now we should be able. I wanna talk I wanna talk with Heather about this, but help old Rusty. Maybe you have to be in Far Harbor yeah, for her to want to talk about it. <laughs> you think it's worth? You're gonna enjoy these streams? Well, you're catching me on the tail end of them. We'll be uh, tomorrow. We'll be going into. Uh, we'll be continuing work, down. To tomorrow I'll be playing a, a modded quest line Still called Sim up. Settlements, uh, which is what I was working on today. So there shouldn't be spoilers there for you too much because. Uh, Oh, I don't think you're playing with that mod. Um, but then after that, I'll be going into uh, some DLC content. But I'm done with main story. But, but yeah. You think we should go back to Far Harbor? You think it's worth hearing what she has to say? Nah. <laughs> I was kind of feeling that. I was kind of feeling that. <clears throat> I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna take that oil. We're gonna go help. Uh, we're gonna help old Rusty. Back on track. Oh. Back on track. Oh, oh she hates you after run. Good luck. Have fun. Night night. Hey, have a good one, man. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for hanging out. <laughs> I'm glad you got to I'm glad you got to see the finale there of Far Harbor. We did we didn't quite do what we wanted to do because uh, we couldn't talk to Alan, but you know what? It's whatever. <clears throat> Have a good one though. <laughs> Chat later, dude. Oh, Will, you want to access <clears throat> Fallout content available? So I got Fallout Shelter on your mobile device. I remember I remember when they came out with Fallout, uh, Fallout Shelter. I played that as well. <clears throat> it's a fun little mobile game. Okay, we're gonna see. We're gonna see about all Rusty here. You're gonna check on your minions, okay. <clears throat> Come on, Rusty. 
Oh. I wish I could take off Heather's this line boots. Of work, you have to expect the unexpected. On her power armor. Still, I've got to admit. So she would walk She's around more quietly. <clears throat> That's what I wish. I wish I could take off her boots on her power armor and make her walk around more quietly. I think that'd be a I think that'd be a victory. The work never ends in Vault 81. <laughs> Yeah, it's probably because you keep doing weird things. Like welding the walls. I feel like I hear Heather traipsing around. Rusty? Wait, are you not in here? Where's old Rusty at? He's not in here. Well, let me just make sure. We have the right. Yeah, help old Rusty. He must have moved on. Oh, here he is. <laughs> is he maybe he's sleeping? Even robots need sleep. Pardon me. Hey, old Rusty. How can I assist you? Warning! <laughs> Open you for maintenance. Pardon me. Here, this will make you feel better. Here, this will make you feel better. Oh, thank you, sir. You are most considerate. No problem, Nothing dude. Like the oil, eh? Oh, glad I could help. Oh, man. I would have been stuck on that quest forever. You're back? Okay, if they're doing good, glad to hear it. Glad to hear. Oh, cheers, sir. Years. Where are we going now? <clears throat> oh, report, report back to Mansfield. Oh, I totally forgot we're in this vault. It feels like ages ago that Austin tried to give us a tour in here. Oh. Fallout 4 and play? Oh, Fallout 4, you play. This line of work have to expect yes. the unexpected. Still yes. Yes. Fallout 4, I play. I've never had a case. Fallout 4, you play, though? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Will, you had to get drinks of water? Nice. I've been hearing okay. things about you. Old Rusty is running okay. efficiency, <laughs> and the vault's water problems have been solved. I didn't expect such confidence from a wastelander. I must say I'm pleasantly surprised. Mansfield? Fallout 4, you don't play. Okay. Fallout 4, you don't play. I understand. I understand. <laughs> oh, I, I play a lot of games, Slay. I've been... We've been on... Today's day 9. Of the Fallout 4. Of the Fallout 4 playthrough. Oh, you're just talking like Yoda Sorry? Okay. <laughs> I, just, I just didn't know. I thought maybe English isn't your first language. I thought, I, I don't know. <laughs> Some people, a lot of people come in with like one liners just to kind of mess around and then they evaporate. <laughs> so I didn't know if this was one of those. Oh, <laughs> the coffee. So you don't, you don't, but you don't play Fall Four, or you do, or you play Skyrim maybe. Something. You play games. We'll settle on that. <laughs> what were you expecting? Honestly, I was unsure. But I had hoped you'd prove yourself <laughs> capable. Uh, new at and Fallout? Have, yeah, pretty much. Now that you've demonstrated your ability to get a job done, I feel I can entrust you with something more important. I am. Um, if you complete this last task, I'll be happy to reward you with a Vitamatic. Okay. I played on launch. On launch week back in 2015. But uh, I haven't played since. So now we're playing modded with a magnum opus mod list. Uh, I went through base game already. We just went through Far Harbor, and and now we're doing we're we're doing Sim Settlements two. And as I progress through that, whenever I get stuck, whenever the next time I get stuck in Sim Settlements two, uh, I'm gonna go over to Nuka World and check that out. 
But you've played all the Fallouts and Skyrim. You're playing uh, Sim 22 right now. Wait, oh, you're playing Sim 22 now. Wait, Sim Settlements 2? Or Sim, wait, oh, Farming Sim. Oh my God. Farming Sim 2022, got it. Oh my Lord, that broke my brain. Yeah, Farming Sim, no, I got it. <laughs> I just, my brain just totally omitted that word. I have Farming Sim as well. They actually just released a trailer for Farming Sim 2025. There's going to be agri... There's going to be a... Uh, sorry, there's going to be a... Uh, I, th I think there's going to be livestock in it. They teased that there's going to be uh, chickens and stuff. But I'm hoping it goes beyond chickens and does like all sorts of livestock for the farm. But at the very end of the trailer, I don't know if you saw the 2025 Farming Sim trailer, but... For real, I've heard bad things about Fallout 4, but it's actually super fun. Oh, you've heard bad things? Well, I mean, you'll hear stuff for sure, but it you have to take into context what people are, where people are coming from and what they're actually talking about and what they're maybe comparing it to. Um, but yeah, I, I think you'll have fun in it for sure. Farming simp. <laughs> Cheers, lad. Okay. <laughs> Turn me into a slush bucket. At least it's no alcohol. <clears throat> Although I was thinking about getting a beer. Although I don't drink, but we got this Mountain Dew alcohol. Uh, just because it's new and we saw it. And we're like, well, I want to try that. I'm interested. So now I'm sitting on this alcoholic Mountain Dew in the fridge. Uh, it's very interesting. Fall 4 is a good story, and once you get bored of it, you can build settlements. Oh, yeah. Or settlements can be built for you. Slays, have you done, uh, have you tried Sim Settlements 2? It's very cool how they can, auto, you can set them to auto-build for you and everything. If you have a good imagination, you can build a lot of stuff. Oh, yeah. You remind me of a guy from Maroon 5? That's a good thing, right? Is a musician? <laughs> oh, you have a console. I think Sim Settlements is on console. I think you can, I think it's on console. I'm gonna check it out. Sim Settlements 2 mod. Yeah, if you're on Xbox. If you're on Xbox, you can play it. Oh, Adam something. Good looking guy. Oh, good look. Oh. Well, shoot, dude. Good looking, huh? All right. All right. Okay. 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 Dang. All right. I'll take that. <laughs> I'll take that. Just tell me what you need done. Ever since we opened the vault, our safety has been of chief concern. We routinely send out security patrols. Will, what does this change? What? To report in. What it's change? Overdue, there was no change. Still, <clears throat> a there was no change. The was to scout, and they've caused trouble for us well, you, you remember having an open door yeah, in Fallout 4 for a mission? But not having any bobby pins. You searched everywhere just for them to be in the Museum of Freedom on the desk. Yeah, I have a lot. And you don't lose you don't lose them unless you uh <clears throat> unless you break them. So as long as you're good, you shouldn't need too many, is my understanding. Do you know where I can find her? Yes. <sighs> her patrol route was between here and Forest Grove. Adam Wall. Levine? So she's is that like Avril Levine's brother? With the mercenaries recently claiming that area, she may be in trouble. <laughs> Hopefully I'm just worrying over nothing. But if you decide to do this, I'd advise caution. No worry, I'll find her. Don't worry, I'll find her. No, good. <sighs> Once you've found our missing patrol, report back to Will? me. Will? All right, man, I gotta go enjoy the yours. stream. Good luck. Survive the wasteland. Hey, have a good one, dude. Thanks for stopping by, it was fun. Uh, if, you're, if you're curious to stop by during the rest of the playthrough, I'll be playing Fallout tomorrow as well. I stream Monday through Friday, uh, 1 p.m. Pacific time to 7 p.m. Pacific time. So if you feel like if you feel like hanging out, you can drop in. 
But no pressure, no worries. But yeah, it was nice meeting you, dude. Have a good one. I'll catch you later. I'll catch you later. Wait, Avr Avril is Levine. So it seems unlikely. Oh, Levine. Oh, Levine, like that kind of Levine. I got it. Spelling. Oh, got it. Got it. Don't make me regret it. You just got grease you in your eye. How, wh where did the grease come from? Why do you have grease? Are you playing games right now? Or are you working in a shop? <laughs> oh, you really enjoy the no screaming BS streams? What are the screaming streams? Hey, sometimes, sometimes I yell. I'm yelling at Heather. Never had okay. an <laughs> Sometimes Heather or Nick are out there in battle and I have to holler like to get them, happens. you know, to keep them safe. Almost. You know, sometimes, sometimes, sometimes I shout, <laughs> but it, it's to save my people. Oh, the F this game done. Oh, <laughs> should have been here yesterday. I was so discouraged. I try. I I I think I do a pretty good job at. I don't. Uh, I don't ever try to blame the game for too much of my own incompetency, <laughs> which there is a lot of. But yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't rage quit here. Well, I've rage stopped fighting bosses before in Dark Souls, but <laughs> there was no F this game. <sighs> just I just had to get better. I ended up summoning someone to help. <clears throat> you just watched a guy break his television because of Wii Bowling and end stream. Let that sink in. Okay. <laughs> what a winner. <sighs> oh. <laughs> oh. A lively, the screaming and ego and I'm a god gamer and saying, let's go. Oh, caught you hate it all. <clears throat> I have to say, I would probably catch myself saying, I, I don't know. <sighs> I don't know if I ever say let's go in, in real life. There, there might be, there might be instances, but whenever I say it, now I always think about how it's so oversaid. I feel like I slowly train myself away from it in real life. But it's pretty rare that it happened. We bowling is very hard, to be fair. <laughs> oh, God. I found it. Yeah, let's go chat. Dude, I can start doing that for you guys. Is this your guys, is this your guys way secretly of actually telling me you, you want that? Oh! Boston Dan, let's go, chat! Yeah, let's go! Oh my gosh, heck yeah, dude! I'm down, new rifle? Let's go! Yes! I, I did destroy the Brotherhood. Let's go! Yes! I did! Let's go. If you want me to leave forever, sure, do that. All right. We'll see. <laughs> oh gosh, I'll just keep that on retainer, okay? Whenever I need to, whenever I need to whip that out for you guys, I'll remember. Oh, we need Heather over here. We need Heather. Stay away, huh? We need Heather. Heather, come on. Come on. Get in the fight. Lock and load. All right. Yes. Yes. Medicine, stim pack, heal up. All right, I'm saving. Okay, let's go. Nick, watch out, okay? Be safe, dude. It's not safe out there. Crossing the bridge, cover me. Okay. But, oh, good job, good job, good job. Good job, dude. Stay low, stealth, stealth. Alarn, wait, what do we want? <laughs> Larn, they're they're trying to convince me to start <clears throat> to start shouting like "Let's go!" all the time on stream. <clears throat> That's their game plan, but I'm not falling for it. <clears throat> 
Wait, what's it? Uh, this is probably a silly one, but I also find myself getting annoyed when people say the names of Twitch emotes out loud. They pro- that's probably- wait. Is that intentional or accidental? Is that intent- do you think it's intentional or accidental? I say that because- <clears throat> I'm not sure the context of what you're talking about exactly because I definitely have so I don't have all of the emotes active on like whatever it's called 7TV I don't know so sometimes people will put an emote and I don't even know it's an emote and I've been there's this one I've been saying forever and I did not know Kappa People would come in and type this, and it wouldn't emote, and I would like not know what it was, and I would say it out loud, and I didn't know for the longest time. <clears throat> there's a handful, there's a handful of those. I didn't even know that they were trying to emote. I thought they were just saying a word. I don't know. <clears throat> but I know what you mean. People, people, <clears throat> I'm picking her put down. Poggers is a good example. <clears throat> Poggers is a good example. I, I do hear that. Well, if I start saying Poggers now, you'll know that you were the point of inception. So it will, it'll all trace back to, to you lively. Oh. Is that the laughing Mexican fella? I think so. I think so. I think so. Oh, what do I? What do y'all think of Kai Senate? Oh, I, I don't, I don't really have any thoughts, either. Either way, I mean, I don't really know. I don't really follow him. I, he kind of went. <clears throat> he kind of had a crazy, uh, a crazy playthrough of Elden Ring with a, like a hundred-hour marathon. But I don't, I don't really know one way or another much, much about him. <clears throat> he yells a lot. I see. I see. <sighs> you know that's a laughing failure. You're just guessing his nationality. I mean, that's a pretty good guess. Here we go. Okay. Oh my God! That bear ran right into me. Okay. Good. 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 <clears throat> good. 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 I'm ready for, dude, I'm ready for chapter three. I bet it's gonna be a long time before we get there. Oh wait, this is a good question to ask you lively. <clears throat> about, about how many, assuming I don't get stuck all the time like I do, assume it's not me, assume it's a normal person playing. About how many hours is it of just doing Sim Settlements 2, the quest line uh, from Chapter one to ending chapter three. Is that like a six hour endeavor, a 20 hour? Like, I don't, I got no clue. I'm curious. You didn't even get the chapter two yet. Oh, copy. Yeah, I'm, I'm just curious how, <clears throat> how long they are. Oh, Slay, thanks for the follow, dude. Appreciate that, welcome in. Oh, here we are, here we are. I appreciate that. Oh, hi, cheers. I'm thinking about going and cracking open a Mountain Dew. Wife's in Seattle. Crack a little Mountain Dew on the stream. <laughs> oh. Nice follow sound there. Dude, I love Lord of the Rings. That's a song we played at our wedding. That's the song we played in our wedding. When my wife walked down the aisle. Common Concerning one. hobbits, it was great. A way more than six, but it's hard to make a fair guess. Chapter two has new gameplay mechanic that I'm not, you're very unwilling to talk about. Okay, no, that's fine, that's fine. Chapter three is yet another new set of mechanics. Uh, it's also very time consuming. And again, I'm unwilling to discuss. No, no, that's good, that's good. I appreciate that. Yeah, I was just looking for a rough number. <laughs> but copy, a lot more than six hours. Oh. Fine, I'll rewatch it all over again. <laughs> Dude, it's good. 
You're lucky you played it at your wedding? Wait, what's the question? What's the question? <laughs> All right, we're going back. Oh, Heather is so loud. The LTR song, yeah. Played it, yes. Yeah, I played it at my wedding. That was my, that concerning Hobbits, that concerning Hobbits one, that just the little snippet played of, <clears throat> the violin, uh, that was my wife's walk down the aisle song. What a beast, yeah. Oh, I love it. I love, it's one of the greatest stories I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. <clears throat> Lively, if you <clears throat> if you fully complete those mechanics and stuff, you could easily sink a, in a hundred more hours. If you just do the bare minimum to move the storyline along <clears throat> and get going, you could probably do it in twenty. Okay. Never try to speed through it though. Okay. Copy. I'll keep that in mind. <clears throat> so in in my mind, I'm thinking Sim settlements is three days at a minimum if I just focused it. I just wanted to kind of size it up, like three days to a week. That's what that's what I'm gonna picture in my mind from Sim Settlements too. <clears throat> 20 hours easy, okay. <clears throat> oh man, my, my voice is starting to go. Up or down. She's looking pretty bad. Heather. Good lord, Heather, you're so, you're so loud. Hey. Come here, stay, don't hey. move. Hey. Yeah, just stay here, stop running around. Yeah. Stop running around, Heather. Sorry about the maintenance. It never ends these days. Oh wait, when else was the bee down here? Well, I thought we were supposed, to, I thought we were supposed to come down here. I'm so confused. I super messed it up. <clears throat> I get the feeling you're ready to move on from fall pretty soon, so I don't want I don't want to pigeonhole you into feeling like you have to keep going. Oh. No, don't worry. Profezzi governs Profezzi. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how to I don't know how to say that without 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 Welcome sounding back. mean. Nice to see the Commonwealth hasn't gotten you. But yeah, you don't worry. <laughs> don't worry. Full I got full autonomy. I got full autonomy. But I am so my my goal when I set out to play a game is to play it all the way through. Is to play it all the way through. And when I set out to play Fallout 4, the intent was to beat the narrative of the base game, beat the narrative of the DLCs, and then spend as much time in here as, you know, as I want, right? While I'm still having fun. <clears throat> I was only, I was considering dropping out of the playthrough early. We had beat the base game, uh, the main narrative, because of the hitches I was coming across and I was like getting discouraged. So I'm kind of past that now. So I, I'm going to keep the plan is to keep going. <clears throat> and then we we beat, you know, quote. We beat Far Harbor today. So I'm going to my plan is to keep going down Sim Settlements too, because this like I want to walk away from Fallout 4 <clears throat> being able to actually talk on some of this stuff. Like that's, that's like the big takeaway. Like I want to get the experience. It's not gonna be the full experience. I'm not gonna hundred percent stuff and I'm gonna make bad decisions. <clears throat> but I, uh, I want to be able to talk on like the Sim Settlements 2 mod cause I've heard so much about it. I want to be able to at least touch on and talk about Far Harbor and Nuka World and the major DLCs. That'd be, that'd be the hope is to get through it. <sighs> is to get through everything. That's typically what I try to do. Like when I played Skyrim, I really went through that with a fine tooth comb, but I also enjoy the world of Skyrim more than Fallout because <clears throat> I like the fantasy, right? 
I, that's my personal preference. But yeah, you don't have to worry, Lively. You're you're not keeping me here, but you did help me. You did help me <laughs> by help it, by uh, holding my hand at the end there the other you're day back? to get through Sim Settlements well, to Hiccup. So thank you for that. A certain someone <clears throat> What happened to the patrol? Well. Oh, oh Slay, so like off topic, uh, but I have around 250 hours of uh, one save in farming Civ. So basically, you'll do what you want to do. Yeah, basically, I'll do what I want to do. <laughs> I was just saying, you don't have to worry about, like, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Skyrimer is where you uh, you get a lot of hours in too. Oh, I put a lot of hours in Skyrim. When, when, when I was doing my Skyrim playthrough on stream, we did it for 37 days. It, it was 37 parts. It went on for a long time. You have about, Lily, you have about 2K hours in Fallout 4 on Steam. That's a lot. But you also, you put a lot of time into it, working on it and stuff. You put a lot of time working on it. So that also makes sense. I honestly would imagine, I thought maybe you'd have more. <clears throat> you probably have more hours in X-Edit, yeah. And the creation kit, yeah. Garlic, do you just shoot everyone in Far Harbor? No. Uh, we we dropped a bomb on them. <laughs> on, the, on certain people. <laughs> oh. And, uh, but everyone's alive. Peace, peace has been held. But it, in spite of our actions, I was gonna let the people of Far Harbor tear people apart, but I couldn't. But yeah, we killed the children of Adam. They deserved it. Yeah, not, well, not everyone, but a lot more. Yeah, I mean, yeah, but that faction, they wanted to die by the Adam bomb. I kind of delivered them. I kind of delivered them. Oh, a lively kind of get that the world of Skyrim is more appealing, but I prefer the gameplay fall for. Even as I say that, I prefer going pew pew over stab stab. Oh, copy copy. Yeah, I'm a stab stab guy. <laughs> but I like pew, I like pew pew. I like shooter games, for sure. Can't complete Skyrim without marrying, without marrying goth vampire Serana. Oh my God, I didn't. Garlic is a huge Serana fan as well. Garlic burp right here. <laughs> I couldn't marry her. I tried. I tried at the end. It didn't work out. She abandoned me. She's like, I'm going to come back in a week's time or whatever. And she never, she, I don't know. We couldn't put a ring on it. It was a sad day. It was a sad day. They're dead. I'm sorry. You're serious. You? Yeah, we when weren't playing vanilla. She she should have been. I knew oh, it's a joke. Okay. Was wrong. Well, <laughs> well, I tried. But yeah, I wasn't playing vanilla. I was. Uh, we were playing Nolvis. She was definitely a marriage option. I think I just tweaked some stuff in my MCM that made it not work. That kind of made some conflict. <clears throat> Cause I at one point married someone else, and I I don't know I I think I just kerfluffed it up. Are you okay? No. She didn't find me worthy. No. Is there something? Um, not. But. I know you're playing Novus. You don't us, mention me in their Discord unless you want everyone to hate you. Uh oh. You did as much as you could. I and the rest of the vault are great. What for do your you do, Lively? The Phytomatic <laughs> is yours. What enemies have you, you made? The vault's clinic. Oh Dr. my god. Has been informed you have permission Let it be known. Him. Just I just want to say this. You have okay. to excuse me. I don't want to misrepresent. I need to update the vault's records. Oh wait, I think I really just missed out on some emotional emotional trauma from him. Okay, he seemed very upset. He seemed very upset. Oh, I was going to say, I just want to say, I really liked Nolvis. That's all. That's all I want to say. Don't hate me for that. I don't know what you got going on, but I it was really fun. <laughs> it was a really fun time. 
Oh, you're a long-time outstanding outspoken supporter of free and open source modding and took a large issue with notes being paywalled. Oh, copy. Well, I didn't pay for anything except, uh, I mean, I don't, I don't know if there's something else going on, but yeah, I, I didn't pay for anything with Nolvis. Your pit boy ever act up on you? Oh, it was paywalled early on? Oh, okay. Copy. Copy. Oh, okay. Now you no longer have an issue? All right. Copy. How much did it cost? Like, what were you, was it like a part of a Patreon? Was it beyond like a, behind like a Patreon paywall to start to get access? Oh, $5 Patreon? Copy. <clears throat> I've paid, I've paid for, for mod access through Patreon. <clears throat> I have done it. I don't know if it makes me an enabler, but it often can be well worth it. You know, I mean, it's always nice when it's free, but like if, if you had Magnum Opus behind a $2, $3, $5 paywall, and it's what I really wanted to play, I would, I would support you on that. Like I would, I would do that. I've done it. I've done it for things. <clears throat> yeah, seems like I get your I get where you're coming from. <laughs> That's creep. Whoa, look at that. Wait, 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 what's this? This is the first time I noticed her staring down at us. She just Ain't this I never something? noticed that. She's just staring down at us. Oh, a mod list? No way. A paywall on a mod list? Ridiculous. I mean, I don't really, I don't think it's ridiculous. Like, I'm, I'm not... What I mean by that is there's a tremendous amount of work that goes in. I mean, feel free to correct me and tell me there was not a tremendous amount of work. But from where I'm sitting, there is a lot of work that goes into curating a large mod list and making it work well and be cohesive a lot. That's worth something to me if it comes up. I mean, like I said, I'll, I'll take free. <laughs> but depending, I'm, you know. She's just standing there messingly, I know. It's crazy. It's crazy. Take the Vitalmatic. Oh, I'm literally supposed to, okay. Inventory, miscellaneous. Is it in aid all? Is it an aid? Take the vital. Oh wait, the vital mag is an item. <laughs> Dude, I'm so lost. I wasn't supposed to come down here, was I? It was probably on that guy's desk. Let's get out of here. I was stuck in here for so long. <sighs> oh, go downstairs to the right. Oh, dang it. Hey. Okay. I'm listening. <laughs> Nick, move. Get out of the way, dude. Get out of the way. We got to go back. Activate. We got to go back. Oh. oh, it's a ton of work. Yes. Uh, you put four years in Opus, sometimes more than your full-time job. And at the end of the day, it isn't my content. I did not make all these mods. It's true. Here we go. Downstairs to the right. Yeah, this, this is very well done. And it makes me not like her. 
she she seems it just seems hi how are you it, it just it's it's got some vibes about it it's got some vibes about it I'm running the test she's a real creeper up there she's a chill I can't treat Austin until I know what he's infected with dr. Forsythe not now Bob. a new stranger will have to wait your turn we have an emergency here was the emergency got bitten by a mole rat. isn't that enough Jacob there can't be that many mole rat diseases or toxins Rachel is examining the mole rat hopefully she'll find something but these aren't ordinary mole rats who knows what kind of diseases they are carrying because he's just a child, it's affecting him more severely. Dr. Forsyth, please. I think I found something that might help Austin. Bobby! Hold on, Priscilla. What is it, Bobby? Well, you know that door Austin found? He found it because of me. I keep my private things in there. He saw me get them. You mean your chems? Get to the point, Bobby. What did <laughs> God! You, you mean your chems? The whole extra vault in there I see room. you I in the get. closet when there you think you're alone. There. So I started poking around. Inhaling that there jet. Were notes and stuff about using mole rats to grow viruses. But they also said that they used them to make vaccines and treatments. A secret fault. Oh Good Lord. Lord. I've never heard of such a thing. Bobby, you're a genius. You mean a junkie genius. God. You might be a cure for whatever Austin got from that mole rat somewhere in that place. You mean you your chems. How would you like to do Vault 81 a favor? And a junkie genius, yeah. Mind? I'd be glad to help. I would be glad to help. I was hoping I could count on you. Bobby here will show you where he keeps his secret stash. Okay. There's a chance that somewhere in there is a cure for Austin. If you find it, bring it to Dr. Forsythe. And for Austin's sake, please hurry. Okay. Follow me. Wait, hold on now. Hold on, buddy. Don't get ahead of yourself. Hold on. I got stuff to do here real quick. I got stuff to do. You'll be fine. Let's take the middle matic. Yeah, no big deal. Just borrowing this. Oh, sorry. Uh oh. <laughs> oh yeah, it's shiny. Oh yeah, we got a new toy. It's a weir hole in the wall. Find the cure. Vim and vigor, dude. We're starting to stack up some good. Wait, we don't have too many quests here. Take the vitamatic. We got it. There we go. I was like, oh, please, please work. Equip the Vidomatic and fire at people to learn about their abilities. When used on settlers, it will reveal even more useful information. You mean we can shoot people now, not get in trouble? Why are you sitting down on the job? That's right, get up. <laughs> get up, Nick. Shoot anyone you want, try it out. Oh yeah. I'm going to set it. I'm going to hotkey this right now. Oh, it's not under... Wait, hold on. Don't tell me. I'm going to find it. It's not under here. Where are you? Aid? Peril? What is this? I give up. I broke. It's not a category. Oh, it's on its own. It's a in weapons. Did I not? Oh my lord, it's right there. Okay. Can I set this to zero? Oh no. Oh, you can't. Oh, I see. Wow. Didn't really do anything for Nick. Copy that. Copy that. Okay. You aren't hitting them? It looked like I was hitting them. I mean, clearly it wasn't, it wasn't connecting, but he got engulfed by the bubble. <laughs> I tried. I gave it a college try. His secrets shall live to see another day or to not be seen on this day. That's the universe telling us. When those moments happen, Lively, I just take that as the universe telling me this wasn't meant to happen with Nick. Move on, you know? Go bubble attack someone else. There's something guiding, guiding us elsewhere. 
Report back to Jake. All right, let's report back. Do we? Okay, we got to undo. There we go. Jake, I'm coming, dude. <clears throat> I'm coming, dude. I got your Vitomatic. It's really cool. Somewhere. Elevator. I can't wait to not. I. I hate being underground. When I was in Skyrim, I would get so lost in the dungeons and in the caves. I get so turned around underground. Oh. Just leaving Austin and die? No, no, no. He's, he's gonna be fine. He's gonna be fine. We'll come back for him. We got to take care of Jake first. Austin will be fine. I could sense it. I could see it. <clears throat> I could see it on his face. He was gonna be okay. He was gonna wait. It was all gonna work out. She's really, she's staring longingly at this. America lives on in you. Are you thirsty? You trying well, I to wouldn't give some real time off. Oh, okay. See you later, lady. <clears throat> on his conscious face. Unconscious face? No, he's good. He's fine. Stay out of trouble. Neil? Oh my god. I'm not gonna shoot you. I'm refraining. <clears throat> I'm refraining from shooting you. Oh, report back to Jake. Got it. <clears throat> got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Try this, it means. I was like, who's Jake? <laughs> got it, Travis. I understand. Hey, Togar, what's up, dude? Helly. Yes, sir. Helly indeed. Helly to you. <laughs> oh, how's it going, man? Oh. <sighs> Aloy, you look bored. She probably has to go to the bathroom. It's only been six hours. You're six and a half. You're fine. Oh. Normally, I can just kick them out of the door and then Annabelle will take them, take them potty. But Annabelle's not here. We don't have that luxury. <clears throat> oh. You know, man, you hope your teammate came in with the conclusion. Wait, homework, school project stuff? You guys doing a group report or something? Call it, oh, your biography project, okay. He probably didn't. I, w I wouldn't wait and hope. I would not wait and hope. I would communicate and hit him up. See how it's going. Is due tomorrow? Uh, wait, if he's on your wait if he's if he's on your team, have you not been in constant communication? Sorry, I don't mean to just turn around and make this your fault. <laughs> oh, but if we were at work together, he never asked? I mean it's as much <laughs> sorry, I can't not. I can't not. I'm sorry. It's It's your stuff too. You don't wait for him to ask for help. You gotta, you gotta be there. You gotta, oh man, all right. Well, I hope. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Oh shoot, oh shoot. But yeah, when you're, uh, when you're invested in something success, you can't, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta take the initiative to make sure that other people are following through. <clears throat> but that's not why you came here. What's that? I'm sorry, Tovar. I'm sure it's gonna be fine. <laughs> sorry, dude. That's just my yeah. yeah that's It'll one way to get you'll figure it out. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. You did most of the work. All I need to do was the outline and conclusion. Okay. I hope he did it. I hope he did it. But I'm okay. Let's take these guys out. Oh, we need Heather. Here, let's summon her. But <laughs> how's it going outside of that? Be a leader. Take charge. Yeah. 
How's it going outside of that, though? Devices. Okay, here we go, here we go. Come on, Heather. Where are you going? This way. All right, let's take him down. There's like this. Not exactly. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy shoot, dude, I know he's. They already killed them. Oh my gosh. Oh, you know what I should do is figure out where I should figure out. I'll look us up offline. I'm going to sort out where to start Nuka World. Oh, wait, we'll, 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 when we get level 30, it'll, it'll get, it'll get stuff going. We're really close. Okay. Really close. Plasma weapons, melt power armor. Oh, dude, they're good. Dude, I'm, Nick, that, that, that rifle he has is solid. I'm very happy. I'm very happy with it. But yeah, Togar, I'm glad things are going good. That is good to hear. That is the optimum answer to the question. Ugh. You been playing anything or you just been too busy with, uh, you been, you been too busy with, uh, with school projects to hop into anything. All right, Travis, I'm here. Engaging hostile target. Uh, don't mind the robot. It won't hurt you. Okay. Are you sure? Or at least I don't think it will. I found it slumped in a corner in the vault tech building. Figure I'd repair it. Let it give me a hand bringing back all the stuff we found. Please contact an authorized repair representative immediately. I didn't quite get around to fixing its vocal processor. <laughs> uh, maybe later. Right now we've got more important stuff to be getting on with. What's that? T Rav? How things go with the Ron? You have anything interesting the Ron. for us? <clears throat> oh, you oh, copy. You set it to delay to level 50, I think. Okay. <clears throat> Copy. If you want to trigger at 30, change it in the DLC timing. Okay, copy. Yeah, if you set it to 50, then that is what it is. Here. Let's talk to him in a second. I'm going to do that right now, just so it triggers. That way, it'll just trigger tomorrow. Right when I hit 30. And then we can, like, check it out along the way. I'll be excited about that. Oh, what am I doing? That's not MCM. <clears throat> Mod config. What would that be? There's a, here we go, DLC timing. Let's see what they all are. Level 30, Far Harbor's, oh, interesting. That's why we were confused. That's why the quest, we, that's why. I like couldn't figure out how to get the, the quest with Nick Valentine to trigger. So we just went there. Ah, there it is. Nuka World. Oops. Cool. So I can do this anytime. We'll make it 30 just so it happens kind of naturally. Got it. A automation. Vault Tech Workshop. Okay. Oh, cool. Oh, so there's only two more main DLCs right here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Wait, mod config. I don't need to save these though, do I? Let's just hit, let's just hit save. That way I have them there for me forever. <clears throat> Took our too busy. Also got to turn in an essay before the 16th. Oh yeah, I figured. I figured. It's best, it's best. Set aside, set aside gaming and just focus up on school, knock it out. That's the right, that's the right way to go. It's kind of impressive you can do that. When I was in college, in my, I think I was going to my junior year, Star Wars The Old Republic, Star Wars The Old Republic came out three days, oh, let's go back to Jake, three days or four days before finals, going into winter break. I skipped everything. I skipped everything. I failed multiple classes. I didn't even care. I got so addicted. I got so sucked in. 
I was waiting for the game for years. I was so into it. It was a bad idea. <laughs> Wish it could have been more like you. But I went back and I eventually retook all those and it worked out. It worked out. Just make sure it's at least one level higher than your current level. Copy that. Because it triggers based on a level event. I'll take Workshot also has some quests, but it's short. It's mainly just to give you access to giant underground vault you can build. Okay. <clears throat> hey. Oh, hey. So, how'd things go with the Ron? Did he have anything interesting for us? Yeah. Take a look. Hey, I've seen one of these before. It's a vigor tester, right? Let's you measure a person's qualities. That's right. How'd they make her so tiny? <laughs> one I used was the size of a whole cabinet. Well... Hey, hold still for a sec. Yeah, hit me with it, T-Rav. <laughs> well, ain't you got a big old brain in that head of yours? Oh! There's a corner of this thing. All right. Shoot, okay, dude. I appreciate that. Coming from you? I appreciate that. A big old brain. I appreciate that. I'm just a person like everyone else. Stop. You're making me blush. Stop. You're making me blush. <laughs> <laughs> then my work here is done. But Ron really found this for us, did he? Not bad. This will come in real useful. Help us assign the right people to work the right jobs. Here. You should keep hold of this. Okay. I think you'll put it to better use than me. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Besides, I'm betting you had to jump through more than a few hoops in order to get the thing. That's true, actually. Only right you get to keep it. <clears throat> it was a stupid amount of hoops. I had to go to Far Harbor and find oil. I had to do a whole... I had to nuke the children of Adam to get this to you, dude. I had to do so much. You don't even know. It was wild. <sighs> How were things here while I was gone? Well, as you can see, I've been busy. I've been organizing. Oh, he comments on whichever of your Tech special HQ. stats is highest. Okay. Yeah, intelligence is the highest right now. Vault Tech version of a com hub, <laughs> or Vault Hub, as I started calling it. Go on. Actually, thanks to Vault Hub, I've already made some progress on repairs to the real thing. Turn it on, and I'll show you what I mean. Okay. New plots on the blocks. Understood. Activate the comm hub. Copy. We will do that. I'll do that tomorrow. Oh, I gotta go eat. That's right, I'm gonna wrap it. Oh, it was a success. Technically, we beat Far Harbor. Oh, be right back? No, that's a trick. Ending. <laughs> oh, ending. All right, guys. <laughs> Thanks for bringing it out. Oh. Uh, everyone that knew that stopped by. Thanks for the follows. Appreciate it. It's always fun meeting new people. Congrats on dropping the nuclear bombs on religious people. Hey, I gave them what they needed and what they wanted, okay? We liberated a whole people. Have a great night, bomb dropper. You know what? I'll take that as a point of pride. Thank you. Smoke, you have a good night too. Larn, oops, it's 3.30 a.m. Yeah, it's 7.30 for me. We all saw it. Good. All right. I gave them what they needed, okay? They wanted that bomb. <sighs> Die, you have a good one too. Keep us updated on your new PC when you 100% again not locked in. Oh, you've been Minecrafting, okay. Oh, I've been poking at Minecraft modding myself. I need to get that Distant Horizons mod working. I didn't work on it all this weekend. Hopefully this weekend coming up. Okay, guys. If there's anyone new lurking out there, uh, I do stream Monday through Friday, 1 p.m. to 7 p.m. Pacific time. We do six hour streams here, so. <clears throat> I'll be back on, I'll be back on tomorrow. I'll see you guys then. If not, then I'll see you when I see you. But have a good one, everyone. See you tomorrow, bye. Bye.